<sighs> Hi, Pigeon. I accidentally put the cookie in my name and I can't get rid of it for another 11 days. It's staying. You are now Cookie Pigeon. You are now Cookie Pigeon. Cookie. So, <laughs> I don't know if I'm excited for this or not. Nah. I don't know how to feel with this. Um, so we'll find out, I guess. <laughs> I don't know what to expect. I've seen um, some videos here and there of this. So, <laughs> let's go. <laughs> Uh, new game, I guess? I don't know. It's funny when a girl tells her story only to be told back that it's unrealistic. Almost as if they're afraid to believe it's real. Dylan? For everyone who doesn't know, my mom's a bitch, my dad <laughs> shot himself, my life sucks, and my brother's on a watch list. <laughs> Not in that order, or, or maybe, I don't know. But last year, <laughs> that combination left me at the worst, most predatory school imaginable. At least I thought it was the worst school. But then I like talked to other people and it turns out it wasn't that bad. Well, no, it was that bad. It was just really standard. Other girls saying their gym teacher wanted to bang them. Their counselor texting them at three in the morning. I was the only one with a white nationalist photography teacher though, so I guess that's something. Here's the problem. Mom won't listen, the principal doesn't care, and I still have all of senior year to get through. My life's just a game, a sick, hopeless game. Like, I've never really been religious, but if God is some introvert loser sitting in their computer chair, I really hope they can help me through this. Girl, I got you. Don't worry. I love this. <laughs> First five seconds. I love this. I'm already so fucking over this. <laughs> All I said was hi. I wish I was hi. Do you think I'm here this early by choice? What is it this time? I'm still awake from last night because my mom accidentally took one of my brother's Adderalls. Instead of what? I don't know, like oxy or morphine or something. They give old people heroin pills to mellow out over gas prices. Does <laughs> pills even look the same? Anyway, so she won't shut the fuck up over how many days I'm <laughs> I'm like, mom, if I can't go to sleep, I'm gonna miss another day. Well, wasn't she right? You're here early for the first time in forever. Oh, God, I was fucking talking to a guy. Can't you just agree with me and say, yeah, she's a bitch? Okay, sorry, Nicole. Your mom is a yeah, bitch she's a bitch. <laughs> fucking whore. See, now I feel better. Hi, this is why we have friends. <laughs> uh, oh guys, what's up? Did I tell you I got an iPhone for my birthday? That's uh that's cool. We talk to you like once a month. Oh. Well yeah, it's crazy because like I didn't know iPhones could do this much, bro. Bro. Is that, like, Asian child, or is that just when it's being made? That's uh no, nah, but like there's all these cool apps. Like I know there's YouTube and stuff, but there's apps where you can like shoot guns and pop bubbles and stuff. You mean games? Okay, <laughs> let me just, <laughs> let me just take a second here. Holy fuck. <laughs> Bye, pigeon. <laughs> okay, let me take a second here. I need to breathe. <laughs> Oh my god. Holy shit. Oh, I'm crying. <laughs> oh god. What are the options even in this game? Window full screen and the volume. That's It's not even like games. Okay. It's, it's just apps. <laughs> like there's an app for this, there's an app for that. Is there an app that'll make you fuck off and kill yourself? <laughs> um is that like a choke or are we Just go. <laughs> uh, uh, <laughs> You guys are crazy. That alone was way too much in the morning. There's no way I'm getting through these classes. Oh my god. Are you gonna skip again? What choice did he just leave me? I can't see anyone like him for the rest of the day or I'm gonna go insane. Come on, <laughs> let's go somewhere. I have a quiz today, Nicole. Oh, I have a quiz today, Nicole. Game? Just we take it tomorrow. <laughs> Fine. So where are we even going? Oh! I get to pick? Fuck yeah. Okay. Uh... Go to the mall, skip in school until lunch, hang out at home. Okay, home? No. I feel like they should go to the mall. 
I feel like they're the kind of girls that would go to a mall. Right? Or am I crazy? I feel like they would go to a mall. What the fuck is this phone? <laughs> what the what the fuck is this phone? Uh, how do y'all? Th- <laughs> Jesus Christ! What is this phone? <laughs> is this one of those ones that you slide and it has the keyboard? Uh, God, I don't know. Would they go to the mall? It's they wouldn't. They definitely would not go home. It's either the mall or they skip school until lunch. I skipped school until lunch. That's what I would do. Because I've done that. <laughs> I never go to the mall. The mall's like such a loser place to go. Uh, fuck it. I'm going with my gut. This is probably your worst idea yet. Bitch! It's easier than sitting in the cafeteria. Skipping in school is worse than just actually going to class. There's no TV or alcohol or anything here. Yeah, but is there an ice cream vending machine at home? <laughs> that shit doesn't even fucking work. No, I think it's working this week. Okay, Bitch. even if it is, we cut school and eat ice cream all day. What are we, six? I need drugs, Nicole. <laughs> what, so now if you're six, you can't do drugs anymore? <laughs> I'm math right now, staring at the pregnant girl two rows down from me. That would be more entertaining than this. Oh my school god. Is a pregnant girl? Do I know her? Well, she if you haven't a seen a kid girl? walking around looking seven months pregnant, then I'm guessing no. Does she have a camera crew from one of those reality shows? Oh my god. No, I don't even think she speaks English. She's like a Salvadorian transfer kid. Jesus Why Christ. Why is it so weird to be pregnant in school? Oh, all the guys are so mean about it, too. They call her Juno to her face. Juno. You just fuck off. No, that was such a good person. movie. See, this I is love awesome. Juno. I guess. No fat, balding piece of shit in a polo shirt telling us all we're... Oh, okay. wait. We're on our way to class, right? Fuck. Uh, Fuck. <laughs> uh, yeah, we were just getting water for the plants in AP ecosystem. Go off, There's Nicole. <laughs> that class is on the other side of the school. Uh, oh, well, no. <laughs> the plants are from, from California, California. <laughs> so they only use bottled water. Oh, yeah, only and bottled. the cafeteria is the closest place with bottled water. You go, girl. <laughs> I'm going to circle back around in a few minutes, and I hope you'll be off to class by the time I get back. Oh, fuck. Yeah, of course. No problem. You go, girl. What was that? <laughs> Oh, no, pedophile. It's a new slang term. I know it sounds like the other thing, but when we say... <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> oh, I can't breathe. Oh, God. <laughs> I'm so glad I have water. Oh, holy shit! Anyway, it it means cool teacher. Jesus. Huh? If that's the case, being strict is a part of the job, but it is good to be a pedophile every now and then. Oh my Dumbass. god! Yeah, dude, totally. I dude, totally. A pedophile. <laughs> Look at their faces. <laughs> There's no way he actually fell for that. Why would he say that if he didn't? What if he's trying to trick us into trying it on someone else? There were no witnesses. He could totally do that. Or what if he's just actually a pedophile and wanted an excuse to say it? So you don't think he fell for it either? No, I'm just saying that's a more likely possibility if he didn't fall for it. How is that more likely? Think about it. Why would a man want to be a public school teacher other than to have sex with the kids? That makes no sense. <laughs> okay, if you're a man, right? You have way more job options, less annoying jobs, but teaching pays like total shit. Yeah. Uh-huh. So why would a guy go to college for one of the worst paying jobs and one of the only jobs where a man can be around minors five days a week? Cause they like teaching? Then why not a university where they actually pay? Uh, I don't know. Not all male teachers are ugly. It's not like they don't have options. <laughs> exactly. Sex with a regular oh bitch won't do it for him cause they want don't tell your parents ass. Totally fucked up, I know. Oh my god. Nicole, you need SSRIs really badly. What the hell is that? Shit, run. What the fuck is that? I go out to check on one staff complaint, and of course, I see students skipping. Excuse me? I think we're safe. Safe? We should have went to the fucking mall. Here, gonna find us. <laughs> Everyone just not skip here. This particular girl's bathroom? Yeah, because it's right next to the vending machines and emergency exit. It'll be fine, okay? This shit. Wait. Like, Hold you're on, cool what the fuck? Everything, but you're just like 
fucked up. <laughs> Ooh, drama. Ooh, I didn't think drama. You guys were dating. What? No, what? it was something else. What are you guys doing here? Skipping. Kelly. God damn it. Told you. Who's the other Maybe one? You guys could settle Kelly a and for who? Us. They're all male teachers, pedophiles. What here? the fuck? One hundred percent. Yes. Oh, all of them? No way. Kelly, you've so, never been Kelly, by Emily, a male teacher. Nicole. Really. You totally have. What's the other Kelly? one saying? You're just too dumb to notice it. Bullshit. Remember when Bullshit. You were <laughs> and the teacher stood over your shoulder for every single math problem? He was just being hopeful. Yeah, then I raised my hand in a sweater. Did he come over? No. See? I never said you were wrong. I just think you're insane for having a blueprint on it. So you guys want to buy Smatties? Are you serious? I told you the other bathroom's better. Are you guys here to buy Adderall? No, we're what just the getting fuck? out of the quiz. Then get the hell out. Tell that to the other girls. They don't have a quiz to skip. We were here first. Go yeah, off. And you guys probably won't even buy Addies or anything. Are you? What the well, fuck? No, but I know what they won't either. Is anyone here actually gonna buy Addies? Let them all know we're here. Is anyone How here much? actually gonna Twelve buy? Twelve a pill? Supply and demand, <laughs> Craven Simone. Jesus we gotta pick a new hiding spot. <laughs> Craven Simone. Oh no, we have to pick something else. Shit. Hide in photo lab. I don't know what a photo lab is. I'm not American. I have no idea what that is. Uh, hang in the courtyard. I feel like we need to hide. But I mean, the courtyard would be fun, right? Is that too obvious? I, I don't know. Would the courtyard be too obvious? <laughs> uh, shit. I don't know what a photo lab is, so I don't want to go there. I'm going with the courtyard. <laughs> I don't trust out of her it. Mind if she thinks she can sell at those prices. Mad you can't afford it? Please, I have Ooh. free in my Ziploc. I'm fine. Yo, guys, what's good? What are you doing here? Who the fuck are you? Class. Kyler? What, are you doing here? what kind of name oh, is that? I'm using my PSP to look at porn on the school's Wi-Fi. <laughs> you can't just wait till you get home. Just to say I did it, you know. <laughs> you can't even talk. You both get fucked up in the middle of class. That could wait till you're home. You do too. You pop perks in front of the teacher. Yeah, that's because I have an actual medical condition, okay? Oh. You guys didn't bust your knee up playing lacrosse. Oh, wait, here we no, go. If we're all getting fucked up in class, they cancel each other out. Yeah, so you still need to answer why you're looking at titty pics on your Game Boy. <laughs> PSP, dumbass. Why are you looking at titty pics on your Fisher Price Blackberry? <laughs> yeah, that's a better name for it. Make it sound official. Do you have a busy schedule? Yeah, busy telling bitches like you to fuck off. Oh. By the way, since we're all skipping, you guys want to like fuck around a little bit? You just told us to fuck off, and now you want us to fuck you? <laughs> you're watching way too much porn if you think that's gonna work. Yeah, we only like being treated like shit when you're creative about it. Yeah, let's oh. see what you got. Shut the fuck up, Jekka, pelican nose ass bitch. <laughs> nose is actually perfect. Nice try, though. Yeah, but the way you dress shows you might be insecure and overcompensating for your introverted childhood. Oh, oh shit. Yeah, now I'm gonna be up all night reading into that. First she'll hate me, <laughs> then she'll want me. All right, whatever, dude. Tell you what. I'll let you guys have the courtyard, but you gotta pay up the prescriptions, dog. Dog? Who talks morning, like that? Dog. You called us bitches 10 seconds ago, and now you want our drugs? Yeah, <clears throat> bitches need drugs. Can't help ya. Dude, no. this is so fucking not straight. Come on, I'll throw in five bucks. What the I'm fuck do you five, five bucks? bucks. Uh, okay, fine. Seven. I don't even care what you give me. Just help me out. Uh, what did he say he wanted? I can't remember. My brain is dead. Fuck. <laughs> Uh, what did he say he wanted? Shit. <laughs> I don't know. I got a Xanax. It's a pink one. Wait, it's, <laughs> it's a pink one. Right? <laughs> You're just gonna have to find out. Can you not be a stuck-up bitch about every single little thing? Oh. Why are you complaining? You got your pill. Go. Fine, bitches. <laughs> Wanna listen to Coldplay on my iPod? <laughs> Coldplay is engaged. iPod. <laughs> what is wrong with him? I don't know, but I'm really mad we got kicked out of the cafeteria now. Why? I want ice cream and the vending machine's too far away now. Oh my Why God. did I decide to skip in school? We could have done something cooler than this. I still got the Addies in my Ziploc. I would, but I just gave my last Xanax. If I don't take the Adderall, it's not going to mellow me out. We should have went to the mall. Why did I? Have you tried weed with it? I only Marijuana picked to skip in school because like that's what I did. <laughs> Girls, we're not talking about illicit activity, oh. are we? No, There's a it's fucking getting counselor. fucked up in illicit activity. But yeah, so what's that? It's getting I fucked up I should ask you the same. Class is in session, but you're in the courtyard. Oh yeah, we have a truncated schedule. What the hell really is now? What? I haven't been made aware of this. Yeah, they gave us one because we have issues. <laughs> and just to be clear, what exactly does truncated mean? Like the definition? Yes. Oh, no. It's, uh... 
Well, our next period back is English, so we could tell you then. Such a shame you girls get into so much trouble with bright futures ahead of yourselves. Excuse you, sir. Come with me. Fuck off. Why do you always say it like that? <laughs> Why do you always say it like Let that? me try something a little different here. Do you girls have thoughts and feelings for one another? Oh, fuck. Uh, I think Jekka's kind of spoiled. And I feel like Nicole's a bitch. <laughs> Not quite what I was looking for. It seems that almost every time either of you are in trouble, you're always together. Is there something between the two of you that you may Because they're realize? besties that fucking hate what each other. What does that even mean? He's asking if we're lesbians. <laughs> well, you just love that, wouldn't you? Now, please, there's no need for contextual assumptions. Jesus, I damn we can say the same to you. Be mindful of your venomous commentary. In my professional opinion, I believe it would be helpful for the both of you to trial some sort of affection to clear the tension between you trial affection are you telling us to make out in front of you no i'm asking you to physically express how you feel about one another in the safety of this judgment free room okay fine pat on the back good job champ can we go now <laughs> Nicole, will you please refrain from being intellectually and emotionally dishonest what does any of that mean Dude, this is an American pie. You can't just get hot girls to tongue kiss in front of you. <laughs> yeah, you at least have to pay us. I'm afraid you're only hurting yourselves in fighting this exercise. What the, what the fuck? fuck lets you work here? <laughs> fuck I'm lets you work here? <laughs> no, this is pretty fucking serious. Well, what can I help you with, principal? <laughs> if I could borrow your help for a moment, there's a student entirely passed out in the hallway. Uh, oh, oh my. Oh, oh my. I help. <laughs> Who is it? It's Kyle. I, I found him out on the floor, unconscious. I know CPR. Of course you do. I remember my first Xanax. But you gave him a pink one. Aren't those tiny? Yeah, but if he's never done it before, it hits really hard. He's like six feet tall. He wouldn't pass out over a pink Xanax, Nicole. <laughs> Are you a doctor now? I'm like a backpack pharmacist at best. How would I know? What if he found a Percocet and took them both? Ooh. Can that kill you? I think we should ask. <laughs> I think we should ask. Oh, hold on, guys. I forgot my big gulp jug. Oh. Hey, do you know how Kyler passed out? Is he a friend of yours? Not really. Um, he's like my boyfriend. He's like Sorry, my boyfriend. Girls, we can only divulge medical information with family members. Family. He's my brother. Oh. You said he was your boyfriend. Can he not be both? He shouldn't be both. Will you stop judging her Swedish heritage and just tell us? So, <laughs> essentially, his body shut down to the point where his lungs are barely functioning. Oh if we didn't get God. him sooner, he could have lost a lot of brain cells. I didn't know five was a lot. <laughs> Do you know exactly what caused it? We won't know anything until we get him to the hospital for a toxicology report. Since you're family, would you like to ride along in the ambulance with us? This must be very hard for you. Nah, it's okay. I don't care that much. <laughs> um, okay, so if that's it, I have very pressing matters to tend to. Where is my big gulp jug? Where is my big gulp jug? Are they just gonna wait for him to get that? Yeah, I see Kyler in the back there. They're not driving off. You don't think they can, like, stomach pump the pills and find fingerprints on them, right? Oh my god. No way. I don't think so. Cool. Girl. Yeah, I don't care if he dies. I just don't want to be held responsible. <laughs> yeah, same. Do you think we should go to class now so this doesn't look suspicious? Yeah, we should change too to screw up his story if he tries snitching on us. Good call. Where are you going? We gotta get our stories straight. Keeps good. See, now let's go to theater class. We have to. We have to go to class. We have to be normal. Crispin. We didn't do shit. Emily. Uh huh. <laughs> Emily. <laughs> Dude, I'm literally standing in front of you. Just making sure we do it right. Do what right? Taking attendance. Nicole, tardy. The fuck you mean tardy? I'm here. <laughs> the Meaning fuck you late. mean tardy? <laughs> Since when are you in charge of that? You're a student like the rest of us. As of last week, not anymore. Miss oh. Tegan made me student teacher while she's off working on Ms. a Tegan professional Miss Tegan made me student project. teacher. Oh, you so special. I was top of the drama class junior year. We can't have oh a bad God. actor teach the class. Well, I don't think you're a bad, bad actor, actor either. You probably couldn't even lie to the police. Yeah, honestly. Don't take her side. Why not? She's right. Because oh. I'm your student teacher, and I have the power to write you up. Any other questions? Oh. Has a guy ever killed himself while dating you? <laughs> So anyway, today we'll oh break up God. into two separate groups. One will do a table read exercise, the other will be improvised acting. So who wants to do what? I don't want to do anything. The teacher isn't even here. Can't we just hang out? Why would you sign up for drama if you don't even care about acting? It's a fuck around class. <laughs> We're gonna be actors one day. Yeah, no offense, Megan, but you're kind of not pretty enough to be in movies. I don't get why you want to act. Table. Acting isn't about looks. It's about talent and creativity. When's the last time you saw an ugly girl star in a movie? Stop calling me ugly. No, I'm not calling you ugly. I am. Oh my God. I like, am. Uh, like what? Like what? You look like the girl from Harry Potter, but not photogenic. 
Oh yeah, I see it. Is she talking all about right, Hermione? Get in your groups or I'm writing all of you up. <laughs> Was she talking about Hermione? Group improv or table reading? Ah, uh, shit. <laughs> I wasn't a theater kid, so I have no idea what table reading is. I know what group improv is. I don't know what table reading is, though. Isn't table reading where you just, like, read a script? I think? Or I might be wrong. I think that's what it is. Uh, let's go to table reading. I know what group improv is, so I don't really trust that. <laughs> so just read aloud, but act it out as if you were saying it on stage. Who's playing who? Emily, you'll play the cadet. Who's and playing Nicole, who? You'll play the captain. Well, uh, what do you think you're doing, young lady? <laughs> Sorry, I'm just nervous. Like that? Yeah, great. <laughs> so you guys play out the scene. I'll Jesus be back in a Christ. bit. Nervous about what? Missing home? I am nervous about dying in a war. Why do they sound start. robotic? Better finish it, cadet. Why don't we start loving instead of fighting? This sucks. Yeah, no fight in you, huh? What the fuck is this? <laughs> what the fuck Back. is this? How you guys doing so far? Decent. Yeah, this script's ass. Who wrote this? I wrote it. It's not ass. <laughs> it's pretty ass. It's, it's jail pretty after ass. her second kid ass. Like, you could write a better script Ooh. than this. I totally could. About what? About... A girl whose superpower is all her insides are poisonous. What so the fuck? if a guy molests her, his eyes melt out of his head and he dies in a slow, grueling pain. So I'm worried about Nicole. Okay, good. let me pause this for a second. What? I'm generally worried about Nicole. I'm generally worried about her. And I don't... Is she okay? <laughs> Can somebody... Is she alright? <laughs> like, I get it, but like, is she good? <laughs> <laughs> is, is she okay? Oh, hi, yo. Oh, hi, yo, yo. I've never been so confused in a game ever. <laughs> I've never been so entertained in a game ever. But I'm generally worried about Nicole. <laughs> I'm generally worried about her. And I'm worried these choices I'm making are making her worse. Because <laughs> I feel like each scene, she's just getting worse and more worse and worse and worse and i'm worried what the next scene's gonna be because i feel like i'm gonna pick the wrong thing and she's just gonna get worse oh god why wouldn't you just make it so her superpower avoids getting molested altogether oh Who god the fuck would want to watch that her superpower is nothing happens wow great movie idea can you just keep reading it's for a grade you know whatever my heart beats to love, not fight. Who the fuck is this for? <laughs> it reads like the anime cartoons Jeffrey likes. Who's Jeffrey again? He's the weird kid with glasses who draws pictures of girls he has crushes on. Oh, he would like shit like this. Guys, I'm right here. Oh, you shit. Know. Can you get back to reading? I gotta grade your acting. Oh, my God. Your heart beats to march, cadet. Hot one, the two, sense three, of humor four, in this one, game three, fits you perfectly. Uh, Not sure if that's an insult or it's a compliment like yet. A I, I don't know. <laughs> read it like one, two, three, four. <laughs> Do I remotely look like I'm even in the same universe of I'm giving a shit you, you are? Besides, we're the ones acting. Creative liberty. Exactly. I take it back. What I love Nicole. How She's can great. How march for someone else's death? I'll march this foot up your ass, ho. That's oh. not what I wrote. Creative liberty. Acting doesn't Creative work like liberty. that. Creative liberty. You literally said acting's about creativity. Yeah, so is it about looks again? Maybe we should teach the class. F for the day. F for the day. Damn, this class is easy. Damn. Go off, girl. Nicole, I can't snap my fingers. Over. What do you want? I just needed to have a little talk with you. Oh, dear God. About your participation today was a little concerning, gonna be honest. Bitch. Okay. Who? Is that it? Who? Or who does getting... she think she is? I am a teacher in this class, and you'll treat me as such. This disingenuous attitude You're a student teacher, honey. Got student Dude, what teacher. The fuck ever. I just told you, don't treat me like your classmate. I'm your teacher. Is that how you talk to your teachers? Actually, yeah. Don't lie to me. Oh my God, chill out. If you don't get your shit together, I'm gonna call Miss Tegan and tell her everything. Oh, then shit. she's gonna write you up for in-school suspension. Still think it's all fun and games, Nicole? Yeah, sure. A side note, are you withdrawing from bipolar meds right now? Don't change the subject. <laughs> We're talking about you and your <laughs> issues right now. Jesus Christ, okay. Think you can just smirk while Emily calls me an ugly Hermione? Hermione? <laughs> I have no part of that. Go ahead, call me ugly again. No thanks, uh, can I go? Aw, oh, see, now you get it. Now you're treating me like your teacher. 
Okay, Megan. It's Miss Megan. Oh, fuck Miss off. Megan, can I get the fuck out of here now? <laughs> You're excused, sweetie. But work on that foul language. Work on getting a fucking therapist. Holy shit. <laughs> So then she went shut the fuck up over how special color TVs were. Who was this again? Oh the my God. English sub today. She was I so love this. This is so great. We can go on your phone, right? I love the these two. Part. She'd They're stop so her great. She's story to yell at anyone with their phone out. A sub that won't let you screw around. What a rip off. I don't know how someone manages to be more boring oh, than I'm the crying. Holy Weird. shit. Yeah, I had a sub today too. How'd that go? The drama teacher nominated a student to teach the class while she's out of school. What the fuck? What I know. Why would she pick a student, right? No, why are you in drama? It's a gimme class. Don't worry, I have no intention of being an actor. Good. The drama kids are so fucking annoying. They're all ugly yet somehow think they're gonna be in a movie one day. Oh my God. Yeah, that's pretty much the student teacher, who's a massive bitch, by the way. <laughs> Do I know her? Do you know Megan? I was in second Do you know grade Megan? Why is she a bitch? So I'm just doing whatever, not really caring. And then she stops me outside after class and gets super in my face about it. What the fuck? Because we weren't acting good enough? I guess, but she's like, <clears throat> I'm gonna fucking root you up, get you suspended, like all this shit, and I'm just standing there. Oh, that makes a lot of sense now. <laughs> sense how? She was a tantrum kid in second grade. Every week was a freak out. Once a tantrum kid, always a tantrum kid. Oh my yeah, god. Control freak for real. So you're gonna drop the class? Nah, I'm good. I'm gonna drop her ass though. <laughs> Aren't you a little old for revenge? Oh, so now you're taking her side? No, no, I support you. I su it's not getting involved. You have such a future, <laughs> right? Apparently more than you. Future or no future? Revenge is a dish best served cold. Like, like pizza. pizza. Well, Damn right, Nicole. Go off. Pizza cold? Yeah, what's wrong with that? Now I know you're out of your fucking mind. Hot pizza is just grease. There's grease in cold pizza. It's just solidified schizo. Okay, can we talk about this in the courtyard? Oh, what for? I prefer to be told I'm crazy outside where it's warm, not in the mental ward like cafeteria with freezing cold AC vents. Uh, oh my god, the so ACs pizza. in the cafeteria were so cold. And I you still got the get tickets, that. Right? Uh, tickets for what? Oh what my god, fuck? you really forgot again. The dinner theater? Oh, yeah, I can, like, order those tonight still. Don't bother, I'll do it myself. Sorry, yeah, okay. If what you were actually fuck? sorry, you wouldn't have fucked it up the first time. Oh, yeah, I'll, I'll try better next time. I'm stressed out enough teaching this class. Bitch. Does this bitch just yell at all our students? <laughs> Is there a student, too? What do you mean, student, too? They're dating, you didn't know that? No, but it checks out. I thought it was kind of weird he was the only one in class not making fun of her. I know for a fact he wants out of it, too. Oh, my God. with, like, three of my friends so far. Not surprising. A bitch like her, I cheat on her, too. <laughs> She's in that weird category of just barely pretty enough to be super demanding. God, the sex with her must be so bad. Oh, my God. And he's getting that. She was raised Catholic, like, super prudish. Do you just know everything about this bitch? What? <laughs> Do you just know everything about this bitch? <laughs> All right, don't worry about it. Because I think I have my in. And for what? <laughs> Megan's life? A boyfriend she isn't fucking is the perfect weakness for me to exploit. This is starting to sound like a red tube video. Oh, Ew, Jesus. I'm not gonna fuck him. <laughs> okay, just check him, because every video <laughs> on there sounds exactly like that. Like what? Like, oh, you killed my parents. I'll show you with the most suffocating blowjob ever captured on video. <laughs> Dude, how much red tube do you watch? <laughs> Don't worry about it. Fine, but anyway, me and Hunter share a science class next period. That's convenient. What are you gonna do? Let's just say I'm gonna order a hot pizza and wait for it to get cold. <laughs> you know me so well. What the fuck? I'm gonna. <laughs> and so that's why I oh, wasn't God. <laughs> woken up when my wife killed herself. What? Any questions? Sir, hold Jeffrey. on. Wait yeah, a minute. What's our science lab gonna be about today? I meant questions about, about... my wife killing herself. Oh my God. <laughs> oh. Sorry, no. So for today's lab, we'll be identifying which element is which based on its mass and volume. Jesus Get into your groups Christ. while I grab the supplies. Oh, my partner's out today. Damn, that's. Sucks. Oh, my partner's out today. Okay? It sounds like a skater, uh, yeah, dude. I guess, but it's gonna be bullshit effort doing it alone. The I voice does definitely not want. match the character. I thought you hated this class. Well, we're both in drama, so it might help to know each other if we're gonna act. I thought you hated that class, too. I'm warming up to it. But, Nicole, I thought we were lab partners. Shut up! Shut the fuck <laughs> up! Go away! Oh, oh my god, Nicole. Chill. It's okay. Was that kind of harsh? Relax. Yesterday, he was telling me about how he kills dogs in his backyard. I can't work with someone like that. Huh. Jesus. Okay.
Okay, I guess that was justified. Sit with me. Cool. <clears throat> you don't mind if I look up my foot is phone, asleep. Oh my god. Uh, <laughs> no. Awesome. Yeah, it's something I do when I'm bored. That's not TMI, is it? Uh, I'm okay with it, but uh, why do you do it at school? Kind of add oh something to it. I don't know. So what are you doing after school? I gotta go to the dentist for a cavity. They always make me gag with all those tools. I hate it. Can't relate. You like the dentist? What? No, I meant gagging. I don't have a gag reflex. Oh, you're so lucky. I don't think luck had anything to do with it. I like testing my limits. Jesus Christ. Oh, you mean like, uh... <laughs> yeah, like that. Okay, so he's don't like don't a worry. stupid I know or like... Girlfriend. Does he not understand when people speak to him? I'm so confused with Hunter. He's good. I don't mind it. Sweet. along just fine in drama. By the way, I realized you're technically dating your teacher. Also, fantasy, right? Class assert dominance. Go off, Nicole. Go off. Do you guys ever role play? No. Can't say we do. I guess she's She's like so evil. School all day, right? Like so evil. I'm here for it. Nicole is great. Oh, cool. oh, she has me crying. Have you have a girlfriend and you're asking me about my role playing? Oh, no, 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 no. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm <laughs> no, 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 no. Relax. I'm fucking with you. Honestly, you don't need to worry. I have a sixth sense for relationships. A sixth and sense. I can tell Megan's a lot of fun. You can? How fun is she? Okay. Don't tell her I told you this, but just based on her personality, I can tell she gives amazing head. Am I right? Uh, your sixth sense might need some work. No, oh, shit. Was I wrong? Is she really bad at it? She doesn't really do any of that. How long have you been dating? A few months now. Wow, I'm really sorry you're in a relationship like that. Oh my god. Can you number in case you want to vent or anything? Yeah, okay, I'll punch it in. Now that you mention it, the relationship does feel kind of manipulative sometimes. You don't need that toxicity, Hunter. You don't need it. I know all about manipulative relationships. <laughs> okay, because you just so did this it. This is a romance improv. We're gonna need this to be used best for our mini production of Romeo and Juliet. Who's going first? I brought Well, we need a guy and a girl. Hunter, why don't you go first? All right, sure. Now, who's gonna play the other side? Emily. This is for romance. Yeah, romance improv. No, this is for romance. <laughs> I'll do it. <gasps> Seriously? Yeah, I won't get better if I don't practice, right? Okay, go ahead. What's the scene again? You're about to go to prison for 10 years. Ooh, and this prison. Is your last conversation with your girlfriend. Scandalous. Scandalous. This might be the last time we ever talk face to face. He sounds sure? so skater. You know, case, I know you will. Or like My surfer. Said it's not looking good. If I'm lucky, I'll get out in five for good behavior. Well, you're just gonna take that? You're free now, aren't you? Bro. What do you mean? Let's run away to Mexico. They won't find you there. I would, but this ankle monitor isn't doing me any favors. Just cut it off. I don't have any scissors. Yeah, okay. That makes sense. So you're really just going to serve the time? No other option. Serve the what time, about girl. Me? What am I going to do with myself without you? Do you think you can wait for me on the outside? I don't know. All your friends really want to have sex with me. <laughs> Look, I can't control you from the inside. Just keep me in the dark about it. You're giving up that easy? I thought you loved me. Oh my god. <laughs> I guess not enough. You're just telling yourself back to feel less bad about missing me. But actions speak louder than words. Whenever you touch me, I know the truth. But, but what am I supposed to do? Bad, touch me bad. one more time. Take me to my limit with your last night of freedom and don't ever forget the feeling. Uh, uh, and scene. No. We can't keep going? That's enough, Nicole. Okay, who else wants to try? Maybe a little too scandalous. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Emily, do you know where to buy whippets without getting carded? Uh, oh. no, sorry. I don't even do whippets. Damn. Oh, my God. You really look like a girl who does whippets. Oh, my God, thank you. Oh, my God, thank you. A little weird she took that as a compliment. <laughs> Nicole, I another talk with you shit i went overboard over what nothing so what's the problem this time actually there's no problem at all i just wanted to <coughs> let you know i really appreciated the effort today seriously what the yeah fuck? your scene with hunter today showed a lot of passion and actually kind of moved me what the fuck it's like you were really okay so her revenge did not work fall in love with you it showed a lot of talent oh well 
Okay, thanks. And Nicole, I just wanted to say I'm really sorry for being so hard on you. At first I thought you were just another disingenuous white kid taking drama because it's easy, but you really care. <laughs> yeah, I guess. So thanks, I'll see you later, Megan. Uh, Nicole? Yeah? I told you it's Miss Megan. <laughs> what the fuck kind of house is this? <laughs> star hip -hop? No, what's that? It's this video site no, with nothing that? but Waffle House fights and butt implants gone wrong. Butt implants? Yeah, I don't get it either, but when they screw it up, it just slides around in their leg. Ew, gross. Ew, what the Do you want to see it? Yeah, but later. I'm texting someone right now. You've been on the phone, like, all day. Who are you talking to? Little Caesar's cold and ready. Oh, I almost forgot. Yeah, how's it going with Megan's boyfriend? Caesar's Making cold some and good progress. ready. <laughs> and so far, I got 10, 11 pictures of his dick so far. Oh, my God. <laughs> desperate. Yeah, but I'm trying to get one with his face in it, too, so I can prove it's him. Yeah, or else that could be anyone's dick. But what if he's just tricking you with a picture of someone else? Why would a guy carry around 11 angles of someone else's erection? <laughs> he could be gay. He's definitely not gay. No gay guy would skeet in his mom's jewelry box for me. Uh, why would he do that in his mom's jewelry box? <laughs> I told him it would really turn me on, and within 90 seconds, he sent a picture of it. You want to see? Ugh. Yes. Oh, Look my this. God. Jesus Christ. Christ, it's like filled up. <laughs> pearl necklace on a pearl necklace. What's that thing in the bottom corner? That's the head. Ew, uncircumcised, <laughs> that's disgusting, get it away. You thought he'd send 11 pics of a photogenic dick? I'm gonna throw up. Uncircumcised men should fucking kill themselves. Maybe that's why you want to include his face. Well, you better be before he breaks up with her to go for you. Oh, if fuck him. Right, then it wouldn't be cheating anymore. Meaning it wouldn't hurt Megan anymore. Meaning you flirted <laughs> with this guy for literally nothing. As it stands now, you're technically into him. I cannot let that happen. Oh, shit. So, um, do we divide the mass by the volume? Oh, my God. I couldn't tell you. Or maybe we multiply the density by the mass. <laughs> Dude, I'm failing this class anyway. Who gives a shit? Is something <laughs> gives bothering a shit? you right now? Not really. It's just caring about science is for white guys who correct your grammar. Oh, right. Actually, there's sort of been something I've been thinking about lately. Oh my god, he's you thinking. Don't my grammar. No, not that. Just us. What about us? I had fun texting last night. Did you not like it? No, oh my god, did you not like, like it? Just I think about how I feel talking to you and compare it with talking to Megan. And I don't think she actually likes me. What? How so? She just doesn't humor me the way you do. It doesn't feel like she actually loves me. Oh my god. Are you sure? I think you could Does stick it out. Doesn't actually longer. love me. I could, but I don't really want to. It's no fun being with some bossy prude. If she liked me for me, <laughs> she would have done something. Oh like my that. god. You know, I don't think that's necessarily true. She just needs time, and you gotta be there when she's ready. Even so, though, aren't I cheating on her if I keep this up with you? Keep I mean, what up? Like sending you all those pictures. You mean when you came in your mom's jewelry box? Did anyone need my help over here? <laughs> yeah, actually, for the... No, we're fine. Just thinking. <laughs> okay. Jeffrey, could you draw a better picture of my dead wife? Yeah, the jewelry box? Yeah. Among others. <laughs> hot, by the way. You really thought so? I, I had another one like that, but I forgot to send it. Another jewelry box? No, it was on my brother's Uno collection. Andrea Stimpo's Have you seen it in a visual like Uno novel? The no, Uno the card game. <laughs> oh my god. Oh. How can you have a collection of Uno? Like How can you have a collection? Versions, NFL Uno, Batman Uno, Simpsons Uno. There's Simpsons Uno? Shut up. Put them all together and blew up is that like fake or is that like yeah. an actual thing? And while I was doing it, I was... Somebody confirm, about, please. Oh, I love the Simpsons. What's wrong? We're just having a normal conversation. Megan has no idea we're doing this. It feels kind of messed up. Look, it's oh my god, he has a okay. conscience. Just think about it like this. Your relationship with her is a long-term romance kind of thing. Like dating and whatever. <clears throat> she really loves you, but needs time for the rest of it. Well, yeah, but the time is killing me. And if time's <laughs> the issue... You just need a friend to kill time. There death. is. But what would Megan it's real. Megan doesn't need to know. I want it. Explore your <laughs> I urges. want it. There's I love the Simpsons. Finding someone who will. Besides, it's only cheating if you na, say you love me. Na, 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 na,
Na, so, na, 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 na. Actually, I wanted to invite you to something. Oh, for real? What is it? What is it? Do you want to go to church with me this Saturday? What is it, bro? Megan canceled on me. Church? I'm sorry. Church? <laughs> yeah, it's a parking <laughs> lot function fuck? with food and games. And bye, bro. But see. also little ceremonies in the middle to appreciate the Lord. The Lord. Like Jesus? Yeah. Like Jesus? One and only. <laughs> So, you snap pictures of your penis while frequenting a church? Oh yeah, my know, god. But that's what confession's for, right? And you're gonna tell a priest you came in your mom's jewelry box? Yeah, I'll have to this Sunday, huh? Go on blind and just forgive me, Father, for I have sinned. Oh so my god. So, you're telling me you blindly say to a guy all the sex shit you did over the week and call him father, but not daddy? <laughs> well, I don't... What do you mean? Oh my Sorry, god. Redtube. What's... Sorry, Red so Nicole, please report to the counselor's office. Repeat, Nicole, please report to the counselor's office. Thank you. Looks like I gotta go. I'll get back to you on that, though. Just let me know by Friday. Just let me know this by Friday. first really time good. being here is less awkward than where I just was. <laughs> Nicole, hope I'm not interrupting too much with your class. It's what the fuck does the he want? Amount of interruption. Regardless, I wouldn't want to knock you off of your newfound drive. Driving where? I meant Driving where? <laughs> Your sudden passion for scholastic participation. Since when? Did you just lie to get me in here? Of course not. You're saying that you haven't gone the extra mile in theater and science lately? Your teachers and both spoke very <coughs> highly of you. Oh, they have? Yes. No. They're both very impressed with your sudden initiative when it comes to participating in the classroom. Quite frankly, it's pleasantly surprising to hear, given your prior reputation. Okay, listen As here, asshole. It'd be important to know. What's the sudden inspiration? Oh, um, drama and science? Couldn't tell ya. I'm just really smart, I guess. Well, <laughs> just way, really smart. Great to see one of our most beautiful students <clears throat> is in just a pretty face. What a great Can I nut punch this guy? Problem. What the fuck? Not to mention a daring fashion sense. You have a knack for turning heads, don't you? Whoa, now you're really flirting. Nothing flirtatious about admiring a creative mind. Bruh. You picked out such vibrant shorts. They shape you out very nicely. I'm Sorry, gonna I'll try not to show off kick him. next time. Nonsense. You're more than welcome to show off in here. Why don't you give me a twirl? You're literally 40. Why do you want to see my ass? Now, Nicole, it's not about oh that. He's creepy as fuck. Why, what? why is he in this game? Now, well, I mean, I know why he's in this game. Dude, I'm white. There's nothing to see anymore. But, like, why the fuck now? is he in this oh, game? No, that sounds like a low self-esteem. If I could volunteer a few more compliments. I'm gonna go while I can still voluntarily leave. Bye. <laughs> I got Go off back. the goal. Sorry, I was caught up. What happened? I was in French 2 and called the weird kid Rugrats fetish and got held after. What the like, fuck is Rugrats French 2? Cartoon? Yeah, that's a really good diss. I know, everybody laughed and the teacher made both of us stay after for me to apologize to him. Oh but then God. after that, I was forced to say three nice things about him. While he was there to his face? Yeah, talk about awk as fuck. That's literally awk as fuck. Cool and unusual punishment. What'd you even say? One of them was, you don't smell that bad. Like, I had no idea what to say. Did he get oh my turned God. on while you did it? Like, think of how often a regular girl would say something nice to him. Was trying to block that out. <laughs> when he gets home, he's going straight for your Facebook summer photos. Shit, and I forgot my password, too. So what were you freaking out about? Megan's boyfriend? I thought she said the counselor was horny. Oh, that's like every week. I'm already over that. But no, her <laughs> I'm already over that? Oh, my God, mind. Nicole. Well, yeah, he sent 11 dick pics for nothing back. No shit. No. He invited me to church this Saturday. Isn't church on Sunday? He's so involved with the church, he goes more than just Sunday. Wow. Oh, he's one of those, those. Is it really that surprising, though? Okay. I didn't think a guy he's who one of those, his though. and photographs his dick would have a strong relationship with Jesus, I guess. Oh, my oh God. yeah, no, I've seen it. I would so get off to your pictures if it wasn't for my faith in God. Like, okay, thanks. Okay, I thanks. Why was I so religious? <laughs> That's when I found out. Like, what the fuck do I say? <clears throat> I didn't know Jesus was the escrow in titty pics. Who even is Jesus anymore, anyway? Someone pedophiles find to say they're not pedophiles anymore? Do you think our counselor will ever find Jesus? Oh my yeah, god. Jesus is a 15 year old girl wearing juicy couture. High hopes. So, I guess I'll just go to a really awkward drama class tomorrow. How are you gonna tell him no? You just distract him. Hey, so I can't go to church, but you know what I do wanna do? You know what I wanna do really fucking badly? That was cool. How do you do that? How do you do that? 90% of dirty talk is just rhetorical questions. So like oh I warned last week, here's my casting for the school's Romeo and Juliet production. 
Let's see. For Romeo, we have... Wait, they made a play about Romeo? Oh, my God. Uh, yeah, Romeo's the lead character. Isn't that Master P's kid? Why'd you take the little out of his name? <laughs> no, as in Romeo Montague? It's Shakespeare. <laughs> we studied this all month. <laughs> So it's not <laughs> Lil Romeo and Juliet then? Yeah, what the fuck? Enough. So, playing the part of Romeo is Hunter. Congratulations. Oh, thanks. Oh, thanks. A little more excitement. Can it's we totally not because your girlfriend's a yeah, student teacher. Yeah, thanks, guys. <laughs> and playing the role of Juliet oh. will be... Not me, not me, not me. Nicole! Oh, thank God. <laughs> not me, not me, not me, yeah, not me. I know we got off to a rocky start, but your onstage synergy with Hunter has really <clears> blown my mind. I can't think of anyone better for the part. I'll text you about rehearsal later tonight, Nicole. Cool, yeah, sure. For a pairing like this, communication is everything. Good luck, you guys. You're gonna need it. Oh, you too. Oh, what the fuck was that, Nicole? No, this is like an American dad house. To send the shit. What's going on? Nothing. Gamer <laughs> brother. Dude, that does not sound like nothing. Who are you texting? A guy. Who the oh, fuck? Guy? Is he getting serious? Ew, I'm not having this it's conversation with you. Stage. Is he asking for ass pics or something? Can you not? I can give you the ass pics trump card if you want to know it. Just so you can see it coming if he tries using it. What trump card? Oh, it's real simple. If any girl's holding out on me, I just make it about trust and how I'll kill myself if she doesn't trust me. Oh my god. There's no way that works. No, it works like every... Well, not every time, but like 10% of the time. <laughs> what girl would respond emotionally enough to a suicidal guy begging to jack off to her? <sighs> well, you're a sociopath. You don't respond emotionally to anything. You wouldn't get it. Get the fuck out of here. Okay, suit yourself. But in case you fall for it, the light's really good in the bathroom. What you're the my fuck? brother. Yeah? Why would you care about the quality of my ass pics? Uh, no, it's, uh, I gotta go. Oh my god. <laughs> you had to teach us about ancient Greece in school. There. Yeah, I'm still here. It's been 45 <laughs> seconds, asshole. <laughs> I haven't gotten anywhere on this. 45 seconds, well, let's take the asshole. idiot's way. Do you not trust me? I just want to see you all in one picture because it would be really nice. That I was. Got him. Got what? You Jesus know Christ. what? Link ticket? They're not even together anymore. The picture. They're not even together, together anymore. I'm still plotting. How's that going? Let's just say I have the key ingredient. He really sent you a picture with just everything in it? He sent a lot of pictures with everything in it. After the first one, the floodgates just opened. Oh my Nobody god. that many pictures of the same thing over and over. Oh, I had him write different things on himself with some pictures of it. Stuff like loser, Nicole's bitch, Megan's a whore, just cool shit. Oh my so god. that's why you weren't picking up yesterday. Busy with the worst shit imaginable. I don't know. Last night was the closest I got to any sexual gratification in this whole plan. Literally how? It's just some ugly guy writing shit on himself. Hmm? No, not the visual. Just the raw control felt really awesome. Nicole, that's Is Nicole right okay? Now. I Jesus mean, I guess, Christ. but like, I'm a girl. What am I gonna do? Guys will fly off the handle for barely anything. Yeah, guys will not get a Lego set when they're five and 30 years later molest kids over it. Oh exactly. Now on to the next step. Are you gonna post the pictures online somewhere? No, I think I'm gonna hold on to these. Until the time she is, is right. so evil. And what time is that? Oh, you'll know. I think everyone's gonna know. Is she gonna put them on display on the play? Run less than five guys, phones off. Let's get it together. She's got that's what she's gonna Megan's do, isn't number? she? Number check. Picture of her boyfriend with his weird dick out. <laughs> check. <laughs> hey, Nicole, good luck tonight. Good luck to you, too. Oh god, it's making me send the photo. Fuck. <laughs> oh, Hunter, I'm so sorry. Oh dear god, Hunter, I'm so sorry. <laughs> Megan's gonna be so bad. Oh. Fuck. Minutes into the Hello, y'all. Hello. Checked her phone. Oh. Honestly, I thought she wouldn't check till intermission. What an amateur. So she ran out on stage in the middle of a Romeo line, yelling out of control, and just broke down crying in front of everybody. They were taking videos, laughing. Oh, God, cool, no. Actually. Then she had to go to the ER for a panic attack, and that was really fucking cool. No, cool. I'd go through rehearsing Girl. for a whole play, even though I knew it'd end like that. 
Well, I had to commit to it. Otherwise, she was going to see what was up. If I sent the picture as soon as I got it, she'd have time to resolve everything before the play anyway. There's no satisfaction in that. You see these movies where people kill someone for revenge, but it's like, you're going to let them off that easy? I didn't break a single law, and this is like 10 times the payoff. Oh my She's going to be mentally fucked for the rest of her life over this, <laughs> and I just feel good about it. Now I like Megan's this smiley face. End up a cat lady. A cat lady. Any guy she dates will just remind her of me. Remind Ooh. her what any girl's capable of if you push her far enough. Nicole, I, I'm so worried about you, but like, go off, girl. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh, God. Thought you were done after one ending, not by a long shot. Explore every fate of Nicole and you, and you, fuck. And you just might see things her way. Or you're some loser who gets trigger response when talking to women. Okay, fuck off. <laughs> Do you still want to talk? I want to let you know that I'm not mad at you or anything. Who is this? Let me read. Thought you were done. I let me fucking go fuck off. And still want to hang out. She broke up with me. Oh, this is Hunter. Fuck off. But that isn't why I'm texting. I just generally like you, not even for the sexting, but because I think you're a good person on the inside and want a real relationship. If that's cool, W U, bro. Can you fuck off, Hunter? <laughs> So, I'm confused on how this game works, or how this visual- I keep saying game, it's not a game. It's a visual novel. I'm confused on how this visual novel works. And that's Oops. why I wanna be- Okay, so this is a rom- I didn't mean to click that. Uh. Yeah. <laughs> Let me go again. I'm confused on how this visual novel works. So do you have to go through, like, I'm so confused. <laughs> I'm so confused on how this works. I'm so confused. Because it said we have to go through each story stage, I guess, or whatever. Because this is where we were. With the photo. I'm gonna go I swear I to I fuck. Yes. Stupid fucking game. Yeah, because this is the photo thing. Is that what we're supposed to do? Do do I just hit different ones to get... Um... Different things? Is that what it is? I don't know how this game works. <laughs> do not pick drama class again. That is the only ending from that choice. Okay, so we're so we're staying clear from drama class is what you're saying. Like nothing drama related, not nothing. So am I supposed to hit new game? Is is that what I do? I I'm new to all this visual novel shit. Do I hit new game or do I continue from one of these auto saves? I don't know. Like, when we hit new game, we just stay clear of drama class, basically. Is what I'm gathering, anyway. That I'm th thinking makes the most sense. If you haven't saved, I guess. Okay, so you're telling me that we should save. Okay. Because, <laughs> like, I don't know. <laughs> Fuck. I keep hitting that. God damn it. Yeah, because I haven't- I didn't know I was supposed to save. I, I swear to fuck. I can call out the critical choices for you. So, like, am I supposed to save- because these are auto- I fucking hate these. I'm just gonna save it myself now. <laughs> just start from there or a point f before the drama class. Uh, none of these points are from the drama- before the drama class. And we didn't- I didn't save anything. 
So we're gonna redo this. Okay. <laughs> we're gonna <laughs> we're gonna redo this. Hold on. <laughs> Ew, this rope is filthy. What are you? Okay, so it's like new, new. This nothing, is all new, new. Moving it. Unrelated. This is new, you know new. Tie a noose? Why would I know how to do that? You were in the Girl Scouts. Yeah, we learned how to tie knots to go on boats and shit, not hang ourselves. Well, we're just assuming a whole lot today, aren't we? Hey guys, what's going up? Why so, is the rope in here? She was. Hold on, can I save it from this, like from this start point? Oh, I can. Okay, cool. Okay. Just and like, did you help her? Okay. <laughs> Nicole, are I'm you not gonna touch it anymore. Again? Yeah. No. Uh, pick your favorite answer out of those. Why would you help her tie a noose? I didn't. Oh my god, I can't right now. Oh my god, I What's can't. Problem? What's your problem? We're not even two weeks back yet, and you're trying I love to the voice yourself with the gym rope. I Dude, love their voices. No it's so good. What I, had to I wasn't a fan of Hunter's the voice. The Shepherd I don't like kid his was voice. doing cartoon voices for Mr. Burliday, and the guy just nodded, telling him he had a future in Hollywood. <clears throat> like he wasn't joking. Yeah, so now he's just encouraged to go up to us talking like Elmo all day. All Elmo. Right, yeah, I get it. But could you hold off on killing yourself for two more weeks? We're still partners on the lab, remember? <laughs> oh, that's your motive for keeping me alive. Yeah, sure, no problem. So, will I see you in science today? About that. Why don't we just go out and do something else? Regardless of whatever you say, I'm not showing up to any class with Jeffrey for the rest of the week. Oh, I God. exerted all that Jeffrey. energy to keep you alive and you're still not gonna go? <clears throat> you can come with me if you want. Uh, I'm trying to get into a college after I graduate. I don't Fine, understand. Who the fuck Jeffrey named Elmo that character? Who named oh, him Kyle? Where are you even Jesus going? Christ. Okay. So we skipped school last time so should we go to the mall this time or hang out at home because we picked skip um school last time because i'm stupid so we can either go to the mall or hang out at home <laughs> oh i feel like we should go to the mall at least for this one and then next time hang out at home Because this skip in school was cut. That was stupid. I don't know why the fuck I picked that. Let's go to the mall. Okay, let's go to the mall. Why did we come here if we don't even know what we want to buy? Dude, we're, we're Food court. in the mall. Just figure it out. Even if I do want something, <clears throat> it's just torture. I have, like, no money. Who said we're buying anything? Just steal the shit. Oh, okay. You think they have MSI stuff here? The band? Yeah, they're all in my the shuffle. Fuck? They might be in town this Saturday. Shuffle? Oh. Is there a problem? No. Malls I'm used to be fun. Do you like MSI because you're so normal? I think malls Bitch, are only fun just as much as when they do. have I a good food have court. To do, okay? That's not how it... Uh, okay, so what are we getting? Ooh. I want a CD. And a shirt if they have one. I want a I CD. Want to Ow. I can't steal both. You don't steal twice in the same trip. The only people here... I still love Nicole. I'm still worried for her, but I love her. She's so great. He wouldn't look at us. We're like children skipping school. Oh, those children are so hot. <laughs> How many men do you need to see outed as sex offenders before you start dating <coughs> a good friend? You know what? Pick for me, Nicole. Lead the way. Okay. Um, steal. Oh, we're stealing. Okay. Steal a ten dollar shirt. Steal a CD in two thousand and eight. <laughs> I'm gonna make myself sound fucking old. From what I know, in two thousand and eight, you can get away with a lot of shit. <clears throat> you could get away with a lot of shit. A lot of youngsters would steal and they can get away with it because they didn't have the technology they do have now. I think they were kind of introducing it at that point, but like you could get away with a lot of shit. So I'm wondering if the CD is better than a shirt. It's a fucking $10 shirt. You could take that $10 and shove it. <laughs> I used to hang out at my local mall all the time way back when. Same. The mall was, like, the quote-unquote, like, cool place to hang out and everything. But, like, the mall's food court was, like, where to go. Remember to save here just in case you want to- Oh, right, 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 right. Okay, let me do that. Let me do that before I forget. Okay. CD has more. CD does have more value, and it's 2008. We can fucking get away with that. I always wonder if the big gaudy security tags are for show. They don't even reorganize the CDs. How am I supposed to? Oh my to god, the, <laughs> the CD store is so accurate. Holy expect. fuck. 
<laughs> Acknowledgement of the alphabet. Don't you have the songs on your iTouch? What do you even want a CD for? Collection. I you touch, put them on a shelf somewhere. Bro. Look at my CDs. Look at my CD. Look at your CD collection other than you. Guys who want me bad, see, they think they can manipulate me by pretending to care about my taste in music, but I'm oh, actually manipulating them into learning about my favorite artists. So <laughs> all along, I have no intention of fucking them in the first place. That's genius. <laughs> Why genius? is Flaming oh Lips in the M section? Wait, what is Flaming Lips? Shitty. Okay, I'll give it a try. Oh my Can you god. Hurry up. I feel like we're 20 seconds away from a guy in a Spitfire shirt asking us what bands we like. <laughs> oh, just found it. So, how do we sneak it out? Say that again, but just as loud so everyone in the store can hear. <laughs> I don't do this all the time, Nicole. <laughs> Polish stuff and major in shoplifting. Quick, come on. Oh Hi, god, Freddy. Such a rush. Yeah, spending money's for posers. Oh, it'll sound so good on my dad's stereo, too. I only had I an iPod. Heard a single I remember the iPod Nano. Dad in front of oh, it. my God. Oh, yeah, are for old people without iPod, iPod Nano. <laughs> oh, my brain. Ew, I don't want to think about being old. <laughs> iPod yeah, Nano. I kill myself before that happens anyway. Wish I had an too. eye touch. Do you like, <laughs> even know how you killed yourself? In case I want to do it, too. Dude, yeah, what are friends for? Yeah, because my mom was telling me about the Zodiac Killer, and I don't think anyone's going to go out that cool again. Oh, is he the guy with the symbol mouths? Oh, my God, yeah. Yeah. It would be cool to go out like that. Think about it. Some infamous it shadowy cool. figure kills you and then writes to the news in code about how hot it was when you died. You can probably say that. You about guys are old as fuck. Kills. Fuck you. Yeah, no, that's true. If he fuck off. Specifically <laughs> say I'm his hottest victim, then fuck off. He can kill someone else. I get that. Do you think we're crazy for wanting that? Yeah, I basically, no, it makes more hot. sense now. Save it levels. at every totally. choice point, and then caught, or... you can go back no, and go play through it. Looks like the jig is up, girls. God damn it! Caught over stealing a 12.99 CD. <laughs> I hope it was worth it. What band did you like so much, huh? He's not wearing a Spitfire shirt. Dude, he's not wearing a Spitfire shirt. Brought him home to trade in. With the price label and security tag still on it. She collects, right? Yeah, they lose collector's value if you take those off. You girls are gonna need a better story than that, bro. Oh, I gotta save. I'm gonna save it. Uh, save. So we can either flirt with him to get out of it or make a run for it. Do you think these girls are fast runners? We're going to do both of them at some point, but I'm wondering what to pick right now. Are they fast runners or are they better flirting? They're better at telling people off for sure. Flirting, I'm not 100% sure. <laughs> and I don't know if he's into that. <laughs> Both of these are hilarious. Oh, <laughs> uh, God. Oh. You know what? I'm going with my gut. I want to see him make a run for it. <laughs> Maybe now you'll think twice about breaking the law. You shot five bullets. <laughs> Yeah, it could have been less, but I fired with my eyes closed. A little inside <laughs> challenge down at the precinct. What? Are you actually <laughs> fucking insane? You know, you remind oh me of my God. wife a bit. I want to fucking kill my wife! Oh my God, what? Shut your mouth before I blow your fucking brains out on the tile floor! Oh, no, please don't. I'm sorry. <laughs> now that's more like it. I'll call you girls an ambulance. <laughs> Do you want to go to my party this Saturday? Uh, oh, my no, God. Oh, that was so good. One of the guys from All Time Low might be there. I'm fucking All Time Low. I have therapy twice a day now. What happened? You don't remember the news two weeks ago? Oh, that was, um, no, I don't. No, I don't. I'll see you later. Yeah, totally. Just RSVP by Thursday so we know. <coughs> what a fucking bitch. Hey. Oh my god, you're out? Yeah, they cleared me last week, but I didn't feel like going to school. You didn't feel like answering your texts either. I thought you were dying. <laughs> well, yeah, I was emotionally. I'm always dying emotionally. Yeah, I'm in therapy twice a day. Shit was wild. So what happened with your life? The next choice oh, yeah, is so root they said critical. The went deep into my thigh by the way, and okay. almost hit an artery. Okay. But they got it out, right? The surgery went well? I mean, I'm walking as well as it could go. Oh my god. What? 
I don't know. When they were putting me under, I was so afraid they were gonna, like, violate me or something. What the They're fuck? doctors, Nicole. They're not gonna do that. Okay, well, that's what they said about teachers, parents, <laughs> and police, so who the fuck can we trust anymore? Oh, God. By the way, do you know what happened with that cop? My dad heard they gave the cop paid leave or something. What the fuck? Being a cop has to be the most cathartic job in the world. Really? Think about it. You're some loser with a gun. You can start navigating from there in the future. You, so okay. you go out, shoot a teenager, and get a paid trip to Bermuda. That sounds kind of good, actually. You gonna join the academy? Why would I? I'll never be in a situation where my spouse doesn't want to fuck me because I'm a perfect 10 with a high libido. What How many times a day you say you go to therapy? Hello, girls. Are we staying out of trouble here? Well, what are you doing How, what here? What the fuck? After our little skirmish at the mall, the county reassigned me to patrol this school to pay my debt to the youth. So let's stay in school this time, huh? Uh, uh, yes, sir. What? Okay, bye, dude. Sure, but one more thing. If either one of you get in any trouble, I will not hesitate to fucking oh. murder you. Have fun in school, you girls. <laughs> yeah, sure thing. <laughs> Why, why did they send him here? Dude, you didn't even get shot. Calm down. He said he was gonna blow my brains out, Nicole. Oh my god, you're such a poser. What the fuck am I supposed to do? We can't all be sociopaths like you, Nicole. You'll get there. You'll get why there. Why are you here? Are you gonna skip again or what? Okay, so we're staying away from theater class. Staying away from the teacher. Oh, wait, we gotta save it, right? Okay, no theater class, so we can either do our class or we can keep skipping. I feel like if we keep skipping, um, that cop's going to shoot our brains out. Um, <laughs> so, art class? I mean, I'm artistic. I like art. But the, he said it was a critical... I'm picking our class. My gut's telling me art. For this week's assignment, let's really open the floor of creativity. He looks like an art teacher. In the My medium God. of newsprint and charcoal pencil, we're going to draw a few characters. We're going to draw a newspaper? Oh, my it's God. It's like newspaper without the ink. What the fuck did my mom pay a $50 supply fee for for drawing on newspaper? <laughs> yeah, isn't that cheaper than printer paper? It's not <laughs> cheaper. It's just specialized. Our, our class, class is cool. Our class, yeah. You, you're <laughs> special. So are homeless people special when they eat out of the garbage? <laughs> Your minds are special. Is he calling us special ed? I guess we are if we took this class. <laughs> and with the medium of Excuse newsprint me? and charcoal I pencils, an art kid. we'll be drawing characters. Any characters you'd like. These characters could tell a story, show how you feel, tell a portray story. a social cause. Anything you feel is worth the time to draw. Can my characters murder bitches? <laughs> be mindful that anything we do in this class must be school appropriate. Can my characters okay. be the gym teacher trying to molest us? Oh my god. Nicole. <laughs> what? Nicole. In I think you're all smart enough to know what pushes the envelope. It's your first assignment. <clears throat> just play it safe. Any other questions? Are we allowed to just draw people hanging out? Of course. Though it might not be the strongest so test of your creativity. Think <laughs> I why feel offended. Are they out? What purpose brought them all together to hang out? God, bitches and shit. If there are no further questions, bitches I'll hand shit. you your papers and we can begin. Fucking draw. Actually draw. Bro. Uh. Fuck drawing. Bitch, you do that shit. <laughs> Excuse me, dude. We're seniors. Hey, there's his beard and animal. He's fucking classes. something else. I'm sorry, but you're in art. Not a sleeping class. Is this an elective? 
Well, yes. So what are you going to do about it? Fail you for your lack of participation. Oh, yeah, and the elective that doesn't stop me from graduating. That'll really show me. Yeah, actually, why the hell are any of us drawing? For the easy GPA. What fucking college would care if you drew some bullshit picture about your feelings? Oh I'd my rather God. see an A in an easy class than a B in a hard class. I don't want to be in fucking any class. If you had to do 12 years of this shit, you're going to volunteer for more of it? Oh Whatever. God. You have a real Whatever. attitude problem. You know that, Nicole? You have a teaching a real class problem. Go work at Starbucks with your little apron. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see how the principal deals with your abundance of comebacks. Oh, man. Oh, Nicole, shit. we're not even a week in and you're getting sent to the principal. New record. Don't be jealous. <laughs> Don't be jealous. You're on your final warning, Nicole. Final warning? This is the first time I was sent here. <laughs> I've decided to roll over your warnings from last year. You made such a habit out of coming here. It's hard to forget over the summer. You don't do that I'm with anyone else. Fix my chair. Yes, Hold on. But anyone else doesn't seem to deliberately disrupt the class as much as you do. What am I supposed to accidentally call my teacher a bitch? You're supposed to follow the class and not insult faculty. No shit. Then why do you <laughs> no continue shit. to not do that? Because that's boring. So your life here is a game to you? No, nope. nope. Candyland's a game. This shit's torture. <laughs> Candyland's a game. If the current curriculum isn't working for you, we could always have you transferred into a different program here. I swear to God, if you put me in spec ed, I will bully all of those kids into killing themselves. Oh my Nicole, God. don't be ludicrous. They're special, Miss Lynn. <laughs> One little push and you'll have to make a really awkward phone call. I wasn't implying special ed, Nicole. We have alternative learning programs for students who feel they can't quite get along. Oh, no. Really now? I wouldn't look at it as an out. Believe I'm sad. me when I, like I tell you, class. the classes you're in now are a lot more just pleasant. Drew. We'll I should have just that. drew. Again, final warning. I should have just drew. I just something. don't understand why we can't upload <clears> anime <throat> to YouTube anymore. A lot of the time, there's no other way to watch the original Japanese version with- Oh English my god, subtitles. Jeffrey's us in high school. <laughs> Besides, I can't even stomach the American version. They just change so much. It's not a faithful adaptation, so YouTube is the only way we can watch the true original version. Oh my god. Why do you think I know what any of this shit you're talking about is? Well, it's sort of been a big deal in the online communities. The Digital Millennium Copyright Act, have you heard of it? Will you shut the fuck up? Well, <laughs> hey! You're going off about copyright and shit. You can't even tie your shoes. Oh I know God. how to tie shoes. Slip-ons are just quicker is all. Quicker is all? You sound like a cartoon character quicker arguing is all. age of consent laws. <laughs> but what's wrong about sounding like a cartoon? Cartoons are my favorite. Second to anime. Weren't you talking about how much you want a girlfriend yesterday? Yes, and I still want one. A and you plan on this hypothetical girlfriend touching your penis? Well, I don't want to <laughs> rush things. But one day, yes. Okay, let me help you out. Approaching girls in your Velcro shoes with the current events of YouTube anime will not make her want to fuck you. H who said I was trying to do that with you? Oh my Just god. Just talk between friends. I don't think about you in that way. Really? Yeah, not at all. Not even a little? N no. No, well, no, no. Why? Because I wanted to give you a hand job after lunch, but if you don't anime dude that in high school, way, everyone I mean, knew one Jeffrey. Well, we were I all that Jeffrey. Hello. My feelings if you felt that way. <laughs> what do you mean we all knew that? We <laughs> were Jeffrey. <laughs> you kill yourself while your mom watches. I'm hearing a bit of profanity over here. Is everything all right? Oh, I, I don't know. You're not going to write me up, are you? I'm on my last warning. That depends. Jeffrey, what's going on here? N nothing. Nicole was actually helping me out with some life advice. Well, all right. Back to work on your lab. Don't worry, Nicole. Usually you just ignore me, but I understand you were trying to be extra mean today, so I'd better myself. Oh my no, God. I was extra mean to get written up so I don't have to take these shitty fucking classes anymore. Oh, well, if you're ever feeling like you need an escape, oh my the God. manga club's doing a- Just stop there. Just stop there. <laughs> Hold on, you told him kill yourself while your mom watches? Yeah, that's really good. I know, right? And that didn't get you written up? Bro. Yeah, the teacher wasn't there when I said it, so the response was lukewarm. You're really going for these remedial classes, huh? Is that what they're called? Nope. Yeah, but it's for major fuck-ups. I'm not sure you want to be there every day. What, stupid kids? No, kids who are going to go to jail My life would have been hell graduation. otherwise. It's like the worst My life course. was hell. <laughs> Saturday school, but more My life but was hell. I just accepted it. I'm just it. tired of these lame-ass teachers who won't leave me alone about anything. You think the other teachers Mine are just was let you do whatever you want? I just want to sleep in class and, I accept and by it. default, yes. It's fine. A collection <laughs> of the worst kids in school means distractions from me. But you still can't find your way there. Tragic. Tragic. Well, What's your textbook there? It's for government. Why? Can I borrow that real quick? 
Sure. I'll be right back. What the fuck? I should do it. Why'd you ask what subject it is if you were just gonna throw it out a window? Huh. I don't know. <laughs> All right, what the hell's the matter with you? Acting out, felt alone. Do I look like a therapist to you? Nicole, we've been trying to take a more understanding disciplinary approach lately. Tell me what's wrong, because you're disappointing us here. Oh, my God. Wait, are you not going to write me up? It's the no child left behind act sort of thing. I don't want to escalate anything if we can resolve this through a dialogue. So oh why did you feel the need to break a window? Because yeah, you're fucking annoying. My textbook? I need that for government. Nicole, is there a hostility towards <laughs> government class? Are you really not going to write me up? Nicole, answer the question. Nicole. What's wrong with government? Nicole, uh, answer the question. The government hates women. Excuse the government me? hates the government women. The government hates women, dude. We can't get abortions or anything. Oh, I see. A political extremist, huh? <laughs> Using violence to spread your message? If you want to call it that. Oh, the shit. dictionary calls that terrorism, young lady. We've been cracking down on terrorism for the last seven years, if you haven't noticed. Are you connecting this to 9-11? Oh my Just god. What is happening? Right the principal. Come with me. Getting warmer. Getting warmer. <laughs> Wait, am I at lunch alone now? Join the club, Jekka. I could sit with you if you want. No, fuck up. <laughs> no, you fuck really off. You don't waste any time, do you? Guess not. So I'm out of regular school now, right? He accused you of acts of terrorism, Nicole. That's a bigger punishment than remedial classes. What? How's throwing a book terrorism? You threw a book through a window for a political message. And did he not explain the message? Nicole, I'd rather not get into your diatribe on the Communist Manifesto. Oh my Communist? god. Communist? That's what Mr. Colby informed me of. <laughs> I don't even know what the fuck communism is. Must you play dumb with me? No, seriously, is it like for people who go on the internet too much? I have no clue. Well, if not for communism, why did you break the window with a government textbook? Because the government hates women, that's what I told him. So if anything, it was feminism, not communism. This isn't the first time he's referred to feminism as communism. Oh, See, shit. he's fucking insane. He wants to rape women and force them to keep the baby. Total psycho. Just despicable. Right there with ya. So, are you writing me up, or...? Women's rights are no reason to write any student up. You're very brave, Nicole. <laughs> oh my god. Now I'll be having a word with your gym teacher. Wait, but I broke a window. Isn't that delinquent behavior? You have behavior. Your reasons, <laughs> but this is an intricate conversation we'll need to have later. But what if I just did it for fun? Like, no terrorism or feminism or anything? Well, that would be different, now wouldn't it? Okay, then I made the feminism shit up. Just give me the regular trouble. You're not getting sent to remedial classes. No, seriously, I hate women. Nice try, Nicole. I I'm not messing around. All women are good for is sucking dick and watching desperate housewives <laughs> out of my office desperate <laughs> oh my god this american good news dad nicole very good day today <gasps> this is our mom marshall's transfer even better i got a new job mom you get eight alimony checks a month where the fuck did you get a job you're <laughs> going to be 18 soon and when that happens the well dries up just a bit also, it's a reason to get out of the house. No, oh my Is God. daytime drinking at P.F. Chang's not getting out of the house? Will you be serious? <laughs> I am. Well, I got a job in catering for that little kosher deli in Falls Church. Rossler's? Yeah, Rossler's Deli. I'll be prepping the sandwich trays. It's not the most prestigious, but I think there's value in working amongst the common man. What the okay, fuck? Okay, cool. Why would you work at a kosher deli? I thought you hated Jewish people. Nicole, I do not hate Nicole. Jewish people. <laughs> You said my third stepdad only got a good settlement because the courts won't let the Holocaust go. We all say brash things when we're upset. Let's not read into it. I won't feed into your negativity and let it ruin my moment of progress. Oh, what book is that from? Again, happy thoughts. Happy so thoughts. So school today? I got in trouble and they transferred me to remedial classes. What? I know. Took them long enough. No, what the fuck is the matter with you? I need remediation. My grades and behavior are apparently not cutting it. You're great. You go to school every day. Don't you get a C just by showing up? Mom, it's not the 70s anymore where you just show up and get a C. You actually have to do shit now. It sucks. Excuses, excuses. Oh well, weren't you supposed to be happy or something? <sighs> I'm going to go up to my room and read up on how to fold the pastrami. Oh my you God. better find a way out of those remedial classes. You better find a real fucking job, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Jacko is oh freaking out over nothing. These kids aren't that tough and crazy. Hey, you got put in remedial English too? <laughs> wait, okay, wait, just English? I thought all my classes would be here. No, nah, they only have it for math and English. So I still have to go to art class? If you need extra time here, they'll let you skip electives. Guess I'll have to take it. 
So did you get put here for some bullshit reason like the rest of us? You could say that. Why are you Sun here? Time. There's some bullshit with Mr. Horvitz that she He's shit the face. Fairy. I wish the Holocaust happened. Oh my god, I'm worried for these endings. Part? I said I <clears> wish <throat> the Holocaust happened. I think you need remedial history. Pretty sure the Holocaust did happen. What? Oh. Well, <laughs> I wish it happened more. Then that fuck wouldn't be here. So this is remedial class. Is Kyler all right, okay? Time to start. I want to see you all in your assigned seats. I want to see you in a wheelchair, bitch. Fuck <laughs> <laughs> you, Miss Ames. Are we finished? Yeah. Oh, shouldn't say shit. I see we have a new student. Welcome to remedial English. My name is Miss Ames. What shall we call you? Uh, Beyonce. <laughs> Beyonce. Okay, I'll just look it up during attendance. Can we listen to our iPods? Listen to what? Does it matter? If you're listening in class, it should serve to benefit the course in some way. Would Wheezy benefit the course? Yeah, and what about Kanye? Oh my Are god. Are these rappers? No, they're accountants. Come on, we'll just do one earbud. While I'm sure this music is catchy for all of you, it serves little in terms of lyrical substance. Not appropriate for English. Then who can Bro. we listen to? How do you feel about the Beatles? You're such a fucking white mom, it's not even funny. <laughs> I'm sorry, such Dodge a Caravan white bitch. <laughs> Yeah, so we can't listen to oh rap or my anything. God. I never said that. You just need to choose something with meaningful lyrical content. What do you think about Tupac? I think he's dead. Yeah, think he's <laughs> oh dead. God. He could be hiding in Ecuador for all we know. His music? He's whatever. Yeah, he's okay, I guess. Okay? Socially conscious music is just okay? Okay, so the she's a cool teacher. The lyrical content of Tupac was such an important submission she knows of shit. modern poetry by the African-American community. You wouldn't say any of that shit unless the Washington Post did an article on it. Yeah, do you have Tupac on cassette or something? Irrelevant to my point, but I say all of that as a lead-in to your next essay. No, Dude, Dirty. why the fuck do we have to write? I just want to watch fight videos. An essay on the state of modern poetry. It needs to be four pages, double-spaced, and feature a variety of citations of proper modern poetry. We don't read proper modern poetry. And this assignment will force you to do so. Oh my what God. about our music? Poetic merit seldom exists with these modern rappers. The misogyny alone is sickening. What misogyny? A variety of things I'd rather not repeat. Are you oh bad God. at pronouncing the slang? I might too, it's okay. It's okay. <laughs> Why is lunch at like 10.30? Okay. It's remedial lunch. They gotta keep us away from the other kids or we'll cause trouble or some bullshit. Kyler, was that a negative remark I just heard? Oh, this, this fucking guy. Fucking it wasn't even counselor. negative. I was calling something bullshit negative, huh? Do you recall our chat last lunch about the energy in which we charge our language with? Why don't you come with me Bro. for a refresher? Can you not? I'm talking for gay people. <laughs> hey, can I sit with you? Why? The kids at the other table keep throwing ketchup packets at me. You're not covered in ketchup, though. They don't know you have to open them first. Damn, we need a remedial bullying class, too. <laughs> so, how do you like remedial English? I guess it's whatever. My mom was really pissed, though. Yeah? What about your dad? My dog killed himself. Oh, wow, my God. dramatic much? Oh, no, he killed himself last year. Fuck. You want to trade dads? You want to your dad. Literally everything. He's so up his own ass all the time. I'll be happy about anything, and he'll go, what about your grades? Like, go away. What about your grades? Like a weekend dad. <laughs> he is a weekend dad. Every he is kind of, yeah, that dies, counselor so is something Saturday. else. Jesus That's a good Christ. dynamic. So do you guys actually do the essays here? Yeah, and remedial you have to or they transfer you to a hood school. Dude, that's such bullshit. I wouldn't worry. They're not expecting a good paper. It's remedial, right? I guess, but like <laughs> modern poetry? How do I even write half a page on modern poetry? Every paper here is just zoning out to the last minute. By the way, you want to pop C's with me? Triple C's? No, bitch. Quadruple C's. <laughs> How many you got? Like a ton. I stole a bunch from Rite Aid yesterday. They weren't behind the counter? Yeah, you get far away enough from the beltway. They don't care at all. No, if only I had a car. So, you want to do them with me? Maybe a little early to get high on cough medicine. What? Like, we're too young for it? Oh, my bitch, God. It's 1030. <laughs> bitch, it's 1030. Bitch, it's 1030. Quickly. Ugh, how do I reach these kids? How do I show them there's more out there? I hate her so much. They really <laughs> picked the right teacher for punishment. Oh my god, I can't even go back there. What, are you gonna skip? Do you wanna? But if we don't do the paper, don't they send us to some hood school or whatever? Dude, it's just one class. It's not like we won't finish the paper missing one class. Well, where do you wanna go? I don't know. Out? Around? I got a prescription to pick up. We could go do that. 
do that as in go there or do that as in abuse the prescription? No, you can't do that with Seroquel. It's not a fun high. Oh, so what's Seroquel for? It's like an antipsychotic. <laughs> it's like an antipsychotic or it's an antipsychotic? I don't know. It just makes you sleepy. My mom forced me to get it after I slashed her tires. Oh, my God. Cool. Yeah. So you want to go with me? Why can't you just go yourself? I'm not going to skip alone. That's like a step above reading at lunch alone. Oh, just ask some other psycho remedial kid. No, they're all shitty. I want to go with someone cool. Are you hitting on me? What? No, I got a boyfriend. But you actually love me? him. Yeah. No. I love that my parents hate him. Close enough. But seriously, come on, let's go. Oh, oh, okay. Okay, okay, okay. We gotta, we gotta, we gotta, we gotta, we gotta, we gotta, we gotta pick. Let me shave. Okay. Do something evil with the essay. Skip school with violence. Uh, skip school. God, I really don't want to go back either. See? But I don't know. You already know what you're getting if you go back there. <clears throat> Some white bitch with wholesome bumper stickers. And a sun damaged poster telling you your outfit doesn't matter. Plus her whole stupid I don't own a TV attitude. <laughs> yeah, so fuck that bitch. Fuck that petition writing Prius driving bitch. Okay, <clears throat> but if we don't go back to class, where should we hang out then? I don't know. I have a car, so pretty much anywhere we want. What car you drive? 98 Saturn. <laughs> You said that like a Saturn's badass. <laughs> it's the two door. Oh, she did. Shit. Yeah, but all the AC vents are chipped because we kept using them as bottle openers. That's hot. You're like Avril Lavigne if she never got famous. I know, right? Oh all right, let's go. Cool. But first, we gotta stop by my locker. Yeah, sure. What for? I need Adderall to stop at stop signs. Oh, what the fuck? <laughs> Why does he have to be right in front of my locker? Yo, yo, hey, you guys hanging around too? God damn it. Is there a reason you're specifically here, or are you just some annoying free spirit? Well, if skipping is free spirited, doesn't that make you guys free spirited too? It's, it's not a bad thing. Oh my when God. girls are free spirited, it's actually cute. Yeah, when men do it, it's like, fuck off, go die in a war. <laughs> exactly. So if you don't have any business here, go to Iraq and leave us alone. Actually, I kind of might have some business here. Business what of what? what? Business like... I heard you buy Bud. Jesus Christ, hasn't everybody? Yeah, but not Jesus everybody Christ. buys good shit. Okay, what do you got? How what much? the fuck? A quarter for 180. 180? <coughs> is it laced with gold? I know there's cheaper stuff out there, but this shit here, this shit here is 180. You better turn 180 and walk away, gringo. Gringo? <laughs> My boyfriend's an MS-13. I have the pass. I okay, have the pass. So what, 175? How about 120 and a buzz? I'm open to trades, what you got? Ugh. You're an X, right? I could be, but why is your ex shiny and red? Why is that, is that cough medicine? drawn Dude, so no well? Way. It's only like that because she got it from Mardi Gras. Why is that yeah, drawn so the well? Necklace. Is red a Mardi Gras color? Do you want to get <coughs> fucked up or not? How <coughs> do I know if they're good? Take one. No, actually take all of them because they're kind of weak. Okay. Take all of them. <laughs> one. Oh. Damn, that wasn't even 20 minutes. Fuck. Now I can find me open my locker. Steal a shit, by the way. Yeah, I got it. That was really good. You were really good. The Mardi Gras save was awesome. I was surprised you didn't fuck it up. When I try that with Jekka, it takes her a second. And then they know <laughs> something's up. Yeah, exactly. We're really good at fucking with people. I know. Just wait till we get to the mall. God, this isn't even that much weed. You want to roll some? No, marijuana's a baby drug. You can't even die smoking it. Okay, we'll just sell it. Okay. This might be the first time they ever actually restocked this mall. Yeah, did you see the homicidal slut shirt with a gun on it? The one in Spencer's? Yeah, that was awesome. Oh my what god. What about those panties with Kurt Cobain's suicide note on them? What those the are fuck? so hot. Fuck, we need money. We gotta sell the weed. <laughs> fuck, we need Emily money. Emily and Nicole. I didn't know you guys were friends. Why is Jeffrey here? You know his name? Do you no, know his name? No, I just call him Nerd Shirt. Jeffrey, why aren't you at school? It's 3.30. School's been over. Wow. Time is like automatic in here. Well, what? Jeffrey, since you're out and about and everything, I love are you this part. Get baited? Oh, baited? God. Uh, are you gonna throw bleach on me again? No, no. <laughs> what she means is like, are you looking to blaze right now? Oh, blaze, like Blaziken the Pokemon. <laughs> what? Pikachu's a Pokemon. What the fuck is Blaziken? Blaziken's a newer Pokemon. You're up to date on all the Pokemon. Isn't everybody? <laughs> They're only up to 493 now. Bro. How much head do you get an hour? Can the two of you just speak English? <laughs> Jeffrey, you want to get really high off some OG Kush? Wait, 
I know what that means. Are you guys trying to sell me drugs? Dude, shut the fuck up. Don't make us stab you with an eyeliner pencil. Nice try, but I think my time and money are spent better elsewhere. I don't. Let's just hope the both of you learn how to pay attention in health class. I'll see you never. I hate Damn. him so much. How can you talk shit when you can't even tie your shoes? <laughs> yeah. Did that seem out of character for him? Have you shoes, seen him with a girl before? <laughs> no, not that. He's oh. never been that dismissive with a girl before. I've literally told him to kill himself, and he'll still try to be friends. Oh, me too. He just likes female attention. Uh. He's turning ours down. That means. Sorry, I'm late. Got a little caught up. Oh. It's okay. What do you want to do next? Karen. Oh my God. He actually found a human female willing to listen to him. I'm not happy for him. After the way he just talked to us, me neither. Are we gonna do something about it? I think you already know. Yeah. By the <laughs> way, did I mention the YouTube anime copyright controversy? You did actually. It's okay though. Oh, sorry. It's just a big deal. A lot of people have been talking about it. I don't mind. Do you want to hang out after school again tomorrow? Tomorrow? I guess so. That'd be good. In, like, a date sort of way. Oh, my God. Yeah, I'd like that. We have a lot in common, and you're really nice. Well, a girlfriend. What was that? Oh, nothing. Nothing Why at all. Why does she sound like um, an anime oh, protagonist? This. Is this your next jump off, Jeffrey? Um... Okay. okay. What's going on? Oh, he didn't tell you? Then again, he didn't tell us he either. Was yeah, Jeffrey loves telling girls they're the only one. Then he blocks your number after you're left with herpes. Fuck the herpes. You got me pregnant, Jeffrey. What? what, what is this true? You told me you're a virgin, Jeffrey. Oh, oh. So we just never existed to you? But they're making all this up. I don't understand. I am a virgin. Would a virgin say there's 493 Pokemon before going down on me? <laughs> 493? You told me that exactly that Pokemon number yesterday. Were you cheating on me? No, I don't even know them. <laughs> Not only will he cheat on you, he's also really Christian. Yeah, he'll tell you he's pro-life while finishing. Oh, no. You're not believing them, are you? <laughs> I... I need a minute. I need you to pay for my treatment. And you better pay for this baby, Jeffrey. <laughs> I gotta go. What the... Karen, no. Come back. I feel... Better. Yeah, I feel I don't even better. feel like this quad anymore. We can just go back and steal all that stuff. Drop me off after, though. Yeah, okay. Oh, my God. <laughs> but yeah, that was productive. Why does Kittles taste better when they're stolen? Dopamine rush. I thought Seroquel stopped that. Nicole, where have you been all night? Oh, I don't my know. God. Are you a cop now? Are and who's this? Now? Should I go? Nah, you can hang out. We were at the mall, Mom. So I'm supposed to believe you were just at the mall all night? The fuck you mean all night? We were there for like, what, two, three hours? Yeah, two and a half. Like the sitcom. It's two one and in the morning. <laughs> Damn, we hung out with that guy that long. What guy? Nobody. What guy, Nicole? Mom, Hi. don't even worry about it. You're gonna freak out. Tell me! Oh my god. Tell me! Sorry for the language at, in home. advance. I'll tomato. You really want to know? But this is yes, fucking what hilarious. What was this? The crackhead in front of the mall we sold weed to. Where did you even get? Ugh, you're so stupid. Oh, so I guess you hate homeless people too? No. <laughs> dealing drugs in public, dealing drugs in general. Just how can you be so idiotic? Uh, it was actually kind of smart. Excuse me? Bitch, you better fix your fucking tone with me before I slash your tires. <laughs> really? <laughs> we sold to a crackhead, because what would a crackhead want with weed? Cops would never expect that shit. It's genius. Yeah, so why don't you shut the fuck up, Mom? How about I call the police? Your plan's just so bulletproof, you shouldn't worry. Oh, shit. Go the fuck ahead, bitch. They'll sign with <laughs> us anyway, because we're cute and you're old and used up. <laughs> Nicole, I don't want you hanging around with her anymore. She can hang out with whoever the fuck she wants, so why don't you go to your room, <laughs> pour your little wine, put on Grey's Anatomy, Grace, and no! shut the fuck I love up. Grey's Anatomy. Don't diss Grey's I Anatomy, please. Please, I love Grey's Anatomy, oh, please. I wish I could say that to my mom. Why don't you? She'd probably cut me out of the will. Yeah, that's a... Uh, huh. But huh. hanging out with you, this was easily, like, the best day of my life. Shutting your mom down was just the cherry on top. Yeah, you're cool. Let's do it again sometime. Oh, can I spend the night here? I guess. My mom's too busy crying to say no now. Awesome. <laughs> Where's your bathroom? There's one downstairs. Cool. I'm just gonna flush my Seroquel. All of it? Yeah, I'm just done with it, period. Go. Oh. Jesus Christ. Why? Just all the stuff we did today, how I ripped your mom to shreds. That's the real me. 
That is the real unfiltered me. So fuck this med shit. I don't want my mom controlling me anymore, and yours shouldn't either. Yeah, Just I got you. That's cool. Besides, I want to take a Percocet to fall asleep, and perks do not mix with Seroquel. Oh my god. How do I do this paper, dude? There's got to be a way to get out of doing most of this. How many times have I petitioned for palm juice in the lounge vending machine? Miss Ames? What is it? Me and Nicole <clears throat> were wondering if we could pair together for our essay. We were. Pair together? We yeah, were. <laughs> like we make it an oral presentation for class. We'll make flashcards at everything. An oral presentation on the state of modern poetry? Isn't poetry all about the spoken word? Hmm. I'll allow it. But just know I'll have a higher level of scrutiny since it's two of you together. No, that's fine. Thanks. Since when are teachers okay with switching the whole assignment? <laughs> it's remedial. They just want to see it done. Something you two would like to share with the rest of the class? Like what? Actually, could we be excused to the restroom? Since when do you ask? Well, I just had an anxiety flashback to when Hillary Clinton lost what the to fuck? <laughs> last summer. Oh, oh no. Yeah, we don't care what color he was. It's still misogynistic. Understandable. Take all the time you need. What the fuck? <laughs> what the fuck just happened? Spontaneous. What? How you switch the assignment? No, not that. Spontaneous? Oh, yeah. It means like Are you trying to talk down to me? Oh what? fuck. No, it's just a word. They had it in the Cat in the Hat live action movie. <laughs> the one with Dakota <laughs> Fanning. <laughs> oh, no, you're right. I love you. <laughs> yeah, I love you too. But if you were talking down to me, I'd smack the shit out of you. I'd make you bleed. Good to know. Oh but my anyway, god. But anyway, I wanted to switch to a presentation because I've had a pretty big idea for that class, but no one to do it with. Until now, obviously. Exactly. You're down for anything, even if it crosses the line. Bitch, what line? Exactly. Miss Ames is this perfect little bitch in her perfect little world, and I want to ruin that for her. I'm oh, yeah, worried. <laughs> What do you want to do? I'm worried. So I've had this plan for a while, actually, but, um, sorry, it's really wild. Let me think how to word this. Oh, no, no. take your time. It doesn't smell that bad in here for once. Right? Yeah, uh, fuck, I need a cigarette. That movie was so horrible. It was so bad. Here. It gave me oh, nightmares. Oh, Ari, do you have a cigarette? I don't smoke. Of course. What's your problem? Do I look like I want what's to be asked? What's your problem? Calm down. You hear this bitch, Nicole? Yeah, she can't tell you what to do. Okay, what the fuck is this? Can you stoners act normal for once? Stoner? What is it, 1990? <laughs> Show us your purity ring, Jonah's sister. Show me the guy in his 30s you're banging this weekend. Yo. You're really <laughs> cute, Ari. Shut up. No, seriously. Your eyeliner is always sharp. Your lip gloss matches your hair. You're actually really pretty. Thanks. That's why I want to look you in the face when I stab you. Okay, I'm out of here. When I stab you. <laughs> I knew that bitch was soft. Yeah, she's weird. What was the idea, by the way? <sighs> I still need that cigarette. Jekka has a ton. She's not in remedial, though. You want to ditch and go to regular lunch? Not like we do anything in class, anyway. Oh, my God. Always the same table. What are you guys doing here? Hanging out. Do you have any cigarettes? Uh, are you guys skipping remedial? Are you at lunch alone? <laughs> no, Kelly just went to get water. You guys are gonna go to school jail if they catch you. Well, they won't catch us, right? Because you're gonna keep your mouth shut, right? Nicole. No, no, Emily, she's cool. Oh, oh, cool. So, yeah, can I borrow a cigarette? <laughs> uh, if I have one in my locker. And yours is by the science rooms, right? Yeah. Sweet. Don't get up, I got it. Wait, you don't even know the combination. Don't worry, I'll get in there. Oh, dear God. Isn't she great? Nicole, what are you doing with that girl? Just yesterday, triple C's in the line of park. No, why are you hanging out with her? Don't you just get bitch over this. I'm allowed to make new friends, okay? No, I'm not jealous. She is fucking insane, Nicole. Insane how? Psych ward visits, choked a girl in class, set her ex-boyfriend's car on fire. Yeah, but that makes her fun. Besides, oh my you're God. a hypocrite because you buy scripts off her all the time. Buying her Adderall isn't the same as hanging out with her. That bitch is gonna get weirdly attached to you and snap as soon She's as She's like a wild her. dog. <laughs> well, I'm not tired of her now, so I guess we're gonna have to wait and see. Were you guys just talking to Emily? Sort of. I hate her. She literally choked me in gym and didn't even get expelled. What the see? fuck? Hold on, but why'd she choke you? Because I said she wasn't as pretty as Fergie. Still sound okay to you? <laughs> a girl can be confident. Confident? I was passed out on the floor for like two minutes. Bitch, oh, that sounds like a you're here thing. now. <laughs> you're here now. By the way, where's your mom been? Uh, she hasn't been here since you yelled at her. I think she's afraid of you. She better be. <laughs> oh, yeah? For real? I don't like how she talks to you, Nicole. You're actually, like, really cool and smart, and you should be treated as such. Wow, that's 
Uh, what's wrong? <laughs> Guys tell me that all the time, and I just say, I know. But I now know. Now that a girl's saying it, I forgot how to take an actual compliment. We're friends. Don't worry about it. Are you trying to have sex with me? <laughs> Not really. Yeah, I have no idea how to process this. Does your mom ever compliment you? No. Because she can't appreciate what she has. And seriously? Like, seriously, Nicole? Like, if I ever seriously? If like that to you again, I will rip her beating heart out and hand it to you on a silver platter. Ma'am? And you don't want to have sex with me? No. Are you sure? No, come on. If you saw someone talking down to me, what would you do? <laughs> oh, uh... Damn, killing my mom is a tough act to follow. Okay, like, if you saw my boyfriend cheating, what would you do? Kill that bitch. Oh my god, please. He's such an asshole now. Things what are rocky fuck? with your gang member boyfriend? No way. Bro. Yeah, he fucked all his shit up on heroin. The sex isn't even good anymore. Yeah, competing with heroin? May as well kill yourself. Oh, that reminds me. The idea for the oral presentation? Oh god, that's tomorrow, isn't it? No, oh, no, shit. don't worry. I got all the supplies ready. It's just flashcards, right? Not exactly. So you know how we want to, like, screw up Miss Ames? Oh, dear yeah, God. sure. And we don't even really, like, have a plan of our high school, right? Like, honestly, what are we going to do? No, you're right. So I thought it'd be really badass if we show her the real state of modern poetry. Real suffering. Not some bumper sticker bullshit. Dude, I'm down for it. What do we do? Okay. We go to the front of class, say a few words, and then we'll swallow this pill mixture I made and... A mixture of what? So I started saving all my Seroquel instead of flushing it, oh, and then Christ. I mixed it with stuff my boyfriend gave me, and then I bought Percocet off Kyler. Well, ho hold up. You're gonna OD in front of the class? Oh my You're god. You're gonna OD, cause death is fucking poetry. And when Miss Ames sees that, she's gonna shut her ass up about poetry for the rest of her life. Oh my god. Uh, are you sure about that? Oh my are god. Are you backing out? Well, it's just a little... This is a two-person gang here, Nicole. Don't make me jump your ass out. No, no, I'm cool. Shut the fuck up! I said I'm cool with it. No, not you. I was hearing voices again. Voices where? Like, in my head. They always oh tell me God. I'm wrong about something. The psychiatrists <laughs> might disagree, but have you considered listening to the voices in your head? Whatever. Look, are you down or what? Totally. Anything you want. Awesome. You're awesome. I love you, Nicole. Like, I really fucking love you. If you told me to kill someone, I'd do it. I wouldn't tell the cops shit. What if I told you to not kill someone? Like, yourself? <laughs> Nicole, I know you're worried, but we're gonna do it together. It's gonna be okay. We got a big day tomorrow. Let's get some sleep. We sure do. Oh my god. You're not gonna kiss me goodnight? Oh my god. Mwah. Thanks. I love you. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> Are you gonna say it back? Okay, now I do want to kill myself. <laughs> Oh my god and that is why modern poetry is written done you certainly are is that a threat hey miss is that a threat? sorry we're late not actually though late again what's the excuse this time i tried ironing my shirt with a hair straightener and it caught on fire witness putting out a tiny oh fire god. wouldn't make you 10 minutes late would it well no it was a really cute shirt so i cried for like nine minutes <laughs> i find that hard to believe no, it was actually such a good shirt. Yeah, it had a Jack the Ripper crime scene photo and said, all work is sex work under it. I met the crying uh, front of the class. This oral presentation better be good. It will be. Uh, yeah. Well, go ahead when you're ready. Uh, no warm up or anything? I don't see why you'd need one. Does public speaking make you nervous, Nicole? No, there's just a few things higher on that list. Oh, okay, dear God. let's just start. Go on. So. Me and Nicole have been looking at modern poetry and made one main conclusion. Yeah, <laughs> a real big one. When you really get down to it, any living poet is a whole-ass poser. <laughs> and why is that? Poetry is about the spoken word, about storytelling, right? But movies have stories, too. I have a bad yeah, feeling I know where this is going. And movies suck when you see the ending coming a mile away. Why should it be different with anything else? Yeah, and poetry sucks, too, because... Because a writer's life is reflected in their work, and if their life is boring and stupid, how can we expect their work to be any better? We can't. The poetry's linked to the poet. Good. Most people's lives are boring. Lots of waiting around. Lots of doing nothing. But when does it suddenly get I'm interesting? When do people care about you more than any other point in your life? When you die? <laughs> exactly. Especially when it's unexpected. And especially when it's voluntary. Like suicide. And so I noticed a link. 
Basically, all the best writers kill themselves. Hunter S. Thompson, Ernest Hemingway. Hemingway, whatever. It's pretty obvious <laughs> to me, modern poetry sucks now. It's ruined. <gasps> ruined by what? Therapy, self-help books, psych meds. It's like you're not allowed to be sad anymore. Yeah, what about the pursuit of unhappiness? Oh Happy my god. Happy people aren't interesting. <laughs> they don't tell good stories. They'll Girl. tell you about their cousin's science fair project or some other shit you don't care about. Language. So get rid of the good poets. Get rid of Language. the people who keep you guessing. You're left with no good modern poetry. So all poets and storytellers <laughs> need to be suicidal? It's not about what they need to be, it's what they are. Their life is their work. Then what's the thesis? The what? The central message of your essay? All great writers have suicidal thoughts. Because you can't have a good story knowing there's going to be a happy ending. That's very nice, girls. C+. Plus. That's it. Decent length, but a little inaccurate and rather melodramatic. Oh, Bruh. then how many poems have you published? Excuse me? <laughs> you graded us low because we implied you're a shitty writer. Just say it. That's enough, Emily. Sorry your world's too cozy for anyone to care about what you make. This is entirely baseless. Have a seat. You're soft, bitch. Face it. Yeah, honestly. Truly deep thoughts come at <laughs> oh a much God. older age than 17. Whatever. You probably call Bob Dylan deep. <laughs> What's really deep is voting, volunteering in your community. Have you ever thought of anyone other than yourself? You did not say that. Lip service, ho. You're the type of bitch to fuck one black dude, then call yourself light-skinned. <laughs> okay. Oh. Oh my god. I think you need to be written up. Go ahead. Write me up. No one's gonna want to read it. You're teenagers. You think you're any deeper than any other adult in the world? Deeper than you, bitch. We're about that shit. And how's that? Watch us. You ready, Nicole? Please don't make me pick. It's honestly super humbling when the trashiest girl you know, probably coked out of her mind, says the most thoughtful thing you've heard in years. Oh dear God. I thought I was like deep and misunderstood and made the text and background all black <clears> on my space so it's like a blacked out profile. But no, I never planned this suicide pact. I never cut anywhere other than my wrist. Oh she took her shirt off in front of me, cuts all over her body. Had one of those angel wing shoulder blade tattoos. In the feathers, it said, proud mistake. I can't compete with that. What I'm trying to say is, you could skateboard, smoke cloves, get your tongue pierced. There's always going to be a hotter bitch than you. And you just got to accept that. I'm jealous of a girl who just killed herself. That's how fucked up I am. You might be wondering how I'm even telling you all this, even though we both followed through with it. Yeah. Well, I cut her little pill concoction with crushed up Flintstones vitamins. <laughs> so I passed out. I had a seizure. But it was just diluted enough to where i didn't die oh my god I'll say the same for emily though okay so i'm not sad about it but at least i have the serotonin to not kill myself oh my god oh, what the fuck <laughs> i'm sorry what <laughs> Oh, dear God. Okay, that's a lot of words. Uh, you won't see this because they make us turn our phones off, but I just want to write this for me. I am glad we are dying. Okay, this is from... What the fuck? What's her name again? <laughs> Emily. That's who it's from. Uh, I can't think of anyone. I'd rather do it with... I may as well write this too. I'm super fucking gay for you. Sorry I lied in the hallway and didn't tell you before we shared a bed and changed in front of each other. I don't know if that's... <laughs> or whatever. But if it is sorry, I can die fulfill... 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 Because dying together with another girl is a bigger... <laughs> then some soft ass bitch getting married to Jack the construction worker or some other boring white guy who can't pronounce I can't pronounce that hello beanie I can't pronounce that <laughs> but yeah if you pass out first I'm gonna try to fall over on you so it looks like we're cuddling Aw, <laughs> the ending was kind of cute but like what the fuck Okay. Oh my god. Jesus fuck. 
So where did we say it? Okay, so this is the art class. This is the do something. Did I not save them correctly? I don't think I did. It doesn't look like I did. Because there's only these ones here. It looks like. I don't think we saved them correctly. Because I don't see the other ones. Because there's way more. Oh no, they're here. Never mind. They're in five? Is this five? Okay, yeah, that's five. So we go from here. So we picked the CD last time, so t-shirt. This place always smells like plastic. <clears throat> hey, how you guys doing today? Brody? Holy shit, are you skipping too? I dropped out. My mom forced me to get a job. So fucking not straight, I know. <laughs> okay, well, if you do something wait, evil with the essay, uh, there's another ending. Paperwork. Okay. You thinking about it too? That's okay. Yeah, you're the guy in the PBS commercials they make fun of. Oh, the tiny wallet commercial? Yeah, it's like 80% of dropouts. <laughs> like, I, I don't know. The TV said you suck, so fuck you. Yeah, right. Do you guys get paid eight an hour to go to that bitch idiot school? <laughs> Wow, you thought that would impress us. Yeah, you're dumb, white, and broke. Shut the fuck up, you albacore eating bitch. Hey, whoa, where's your manager? You can't talk to customers like that. Oh Apologize, my god. Apologize, wage slave. Wage god, slave? Fine, sorry. Good. Now, what sizes do you have MSI shirts in right now? The band, uh, I think everything but large. Damn, that's the one size she wears, too. Can you check in the back for us? What you see out is what we have, dude. If you don't check right now, I'm gonna tell your manager you didn't say hi to us when we walked in. Oh my Fuck. god. Fine. Fuck. Fuck. You bitches, so I'm just gonna go back and pretend to look. Okay, grab the small. Let's go. Yeah, I was like, how the fuck do you think I'm a large? Come on. <laughs> How'd you learn how to do that? What do you mean, learn? You can't just take the shit in front of them. Oh my okay, god. Okay, so what's next? Uh, we leave before we get caught. We can't leave now. That was such a rush. Come on, let's go to the food court and steal some Dairy Queen. Do you hear How yourself? How the fuck can you steal yeah, Dairy Queen? it'd be pretty hard to jump the counter and fill a cone without spilling it. No, that shit's easy. Why would you risk getting caught over Dairy Queen? <laughs> Should we try Saku Japan or would the free samples lady chase after us? Literally anywhere but here. Come on. Oh my god. Oh god, I ate way too much. There's no way we can run out on the check now. How do fat people eat here? It's like pure sodium. <laughs> Fuck, answer my own question. <laughs> it's we're not my own this question. Either. I figured I'd demo some other part of the menu. It's literally just a burger where your mom forgot to buy buns. Who would voluntarily pay for that? Someone who butters margarine with butter. <laughs> you think we got Trody fired today? I don't know. I don't care either. Weird. Most of our friends. Imagine just stealing from some. Shh, 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 but he has to like. Don't tell them my secrets. Shh, 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 shh. Yeah. <laughs> Almost like he has to deal with the consequences of his actions or something. Since when do you, of all people, worry about accountability? I don't worry about it for my actions. I'm too smart for consequences. Bro. It's the one time I feel kind of bad for a guy because he can't do any of the stupid money jobs like pole dancing. Yeah, if I was <laughs> dumb as shit, being a stripper would be awesome. Though I'd feel ripped off because I learned how to read for nothing. Oh my god. I'm too shy and just work at Hooters. The Dude, Hooters is even worse than a club. It's a legalized brothel. What? Oh my god. How? How do you know this? My cousin works at one. She says half the girls blow dudes for like $300 tips and then wonder why they're getting stalked the next week. That's really specific. <laughs> that really happens. So what's next? I think I want to go back to school now. Why the Dude, fuck? You know you're going to end up sitting there bored. I'd rather do that than end up the dick-sucking girl at Hooters. You can just say girl at Hooters. <laughs> the dick-sucking's implied. Check, please. <laughs> not even paying for it. Just get up and leave. Check, please. Strolling in at noon together. You girls had a busy morning. Yeah, you don't know the half of it. Not even a quarter, if we're being honest. Well, the sign-in sheet is on the desk. The unexcused column. I think you know it all too well, Nicole. Oh, dear unexcused? God. Yeah, we kind of miss class for very traumatic reasons. Yeah, trauma has to be one of the excused hardies, right? For some reason, I don't believe you. But today, I think that's your problem. Oh, Being a fucking bitch, your problem? Nicole. Excuse me. Nicole. Oh my god, it was the trauma. I'm so sorry. So why don't you both enlighten me to the source of this trauma that's called <laughs> absence after absence? Oh, fuck. Ah, oh, shit. What the fuck do I put for that? Depression pity party. You lie about having. Oh, fuck. Um. This is just gonna. We're gonna have to pick that anyway, because I wanna know what happens. 
Uh, fuck it. Uh, okay, you're gonna want to take a seat. I've heard it all, Nicole. Uh, no, you really haven't heard. Whatever she's saying. <laughs> Shut up. Go on. We just came from the doctor, and we, um, we tested positive for HIV. We did. We we did. And the nurse we did. We did. Us we might be AIDS positive because we went so long without treatment. We won't get the results till later, though. You both went to get tested together at the same place. Yeah. And where was that? Like the oh fuck. Like the Springfield Clinic. And you expect me to just believe this, shouldn't you? Think about it, Miss Lynn. If you believe us and we're lying, it's just a little prank. But if we're telling the truth and you don't believe us, you're gonna have to explain that to the local news. Oh. And we'll have to explain that to the national news. How our principal made us cry while we're literally dying from AIDS. I, I need to see some documentation, girls. Do you realize the odds? How would you even get HIV in high school? We didn't get it in high school. Yeah, it's kind of embarrassing, but we go to a lot of swinger parties. <laughs> With homeless people. <laughs> homeless swinger party. Oh yeah. my god. And it's TMI, but I have a unprotected sex fetish, so it all kind of adds up. What yeah, and I have a sex in general fetish. Small world. One of my 30 boyfriends has that too. 30 boyfriends? Oh yeah, when a Dominican construction worker cat calls me, just immediate relationship. Yeah, I love Jekka, but she's a major whore. I don't get paid. So you both got your I don't get for paid. HIV? Did the blood work and everything? Yeah, that's what we said. What's your T-cell count? Uh, I, I don't get it. We don't take shop. You don't take shop? Oh, yeah, they use you fucked up. in shop class. What's that have to do with AIDS? You that's a T-square, Nicole. Fuck! No, if you knew, why'd you look at me? I didn't know how much we were supposed to say. How the fuck would I know? You said we had AIDS. It all comes out. <laughs> and Damn it. Incidentally, I have a lovely way for you girls to spend your Saturday afternoon. Or you're expelled. This sucks. Uh, <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> this really sucks. We're almost set up here, but thank you to everyone for coming to the AIDS Awareness Speaking. We oh, have Jesus. about 10 guests here with their journeys to share, and we hope you can all learn a lot from them. I can be at the MSI show right now, but no, I can't because I listen to you. Oh, don't say that. Don't say we have AIDS when you don't know what the fuck a T is. <laughs> like she was supposed to believe you had a Rolodex of 50 guys? It was 30. It was fucking stupid. And she didn't ask about T-cells until after you said that. Oh 30 God. guys, what are you, a public restroom? <laughs> Whatever. Why is AIDS such a big deal anyway? <laughs> Isn't Magic Johnson like the healthiest man on earth? Huh? Magic Johnson? He got AIDS like 20 years ago and he's fine. Who's Magic Johnson? Is that a porn star? Oh my so. God. My dad talks about him a lot. You don't think your dad could like a male porn star? Nicole, I'm already here. I don't need to also have a crisis over whether my dad's gay or not, okay? Jesus Christ. Hey, did you get an email quiz from Miss Lynn? About the Saturday thing? Yeah, I was almost late filling it out. Like, it wasn't enough for us to just go. She had to know we were there somehow. Yeah, but if she wasn't there, how would she know we're telling the truth? She could record the assembly and play it back later. But then just record the crowd so it shows we went there. <laughs> Female teachers are fucking insane. It's all about a power trip. And the male teachers? Pedophiles. Pedophiles. How'd you know what I was gonna say? <laughs> I'm noticing a trend. No, vote for Pedro shirts were a trend. The other thing's just forever. Okay, well, I'm gonna go to class now. Are you going this time? Why? To not get forced to go to an AIDS assembly again? <laughs> that didn't happen because we skipped. That happened because we lied about why we skipped. Well, okay. Are you looking for a classroom or another excuse right now? Oh my God, you sound like my mom. Whatever. See you later. Hey, Nicole, you got a minute? Oh, my God. I my whole life ahead of me. Doesn't mean I'll waste it talking to you. Oh, totally. But, I, I mean, nah... You see, I was asking around and wondered if you wanted to go to the knife collector show, the expo center. Why the fuck would any what girl want to do that with you? <laughs> no, fuck? it's not like a date. It's, uh... But yeah, how are you? Oh, my God, are you Hunter. A text message? Um, uh... Is that the alert that you're typing? Sorry, it's just kind of hard to talk to you. Good. So what you doing today? Oh, Okay. So, I don't have to save this because we already did theater class and we already did art class, so we're just going to keep skipping. I wonder what the guy from Cody Banks is doing right now. Oh, hey, Nicole. You over here, too? Oh, great. Yeah, I just, like, 
I couldn't even handle whatever was going on in class and stuff, and I just had to break loose from it all, you know? Like, I don't know. The these teachers fuck are is wrong with this guy? That was the longest possible way to say you're also skipping. Oh, no, like, yeah, um... Hey, I like your shirt. Hey, I like your shirt. Okay. It looks kind of cool. deep. Is there, like, any sort of meaning behind it? Dude, how the fuck should I know? Well, you picked it out, I thought, you know? I go to the store, it looks nice, I buy it, and not for an artistic conversation with someone this dressed dude. like a bad religion fan. <laughs> oh, well, hold up. I'm not really, like, a bad religion fan. I only like maybe, like, four of their albums. I'm real happy for you. Yeah, but, I mean, it's cool that you know about them. You like a lot of rock? That was the most weekend dad question you could possibly <laughs> ask me. What's that mean, exactly? What's going on out here? Torture. Oh, hey, Megan, what's up? I'm just on my way back from the bathroom. Oh, yeah, cool. I like your shirt, by the way. Oh, thanks. Yeah, no, it's like mega fucking cool. Is there like a thing with it, like a story? Actually, there kind of is. It's, um, well, I don't want to waste your time. Oh, my no, God. No, I, I got time. I'm hanging out. Dumb fucking bitch. So it was custom made, and it was basically a whole story on my journey with, like, finding my... They should make a game show where a guy eats everything in a vending machine. Aww. And if he loses, he's gotta like take his shirt off at the pool or something. Oh my god. So dead. Then there's a bunch of hot girls in the pool laughing at his imperfections. I can't. What do I do? Okay, Ari, what is it? <laughs> Wait, what? I didn't. Bitch, do not play this game with me. What game? I was just sitting here talking. Shut the fuck up. What is it? Okay, well, I'm supposed to be in physics right now, but there's this project due, and I have literally nothing. Yeah, so... Wait, this doesn't make sense. What doesn't? If you cared about the class this much, wouldn't you have done at least some of it? It's not the grade. The teacher's just gonna, like, yell at me in front of everybody. They do no. it because they care. Not because they're paid shitty and weren't smart enough to work at a university. <laughs> you think their salary determines how smart they are? Isn't it just a number on paper? They think our grades determine how smart we are. Let's see how the fuck they like it. Oh, my okay, God. That doesn't solve my problem. I've been here for the last 10 minutes, and I can't think of any good excuse. Is it like a two-day project or a three-week project? Closer to three weeks. Huh. What's the <clears> problem that lasts more than three weeks? Could you pass for pregnant? I hope not. What works for me usually is saying I have depression, but you can't use that. Why not? Because I use that. If too many kids start saying it, it won't work anymore. All right, I'm just gonna go to class and get yelled at. This sucks. Oh my or god. You drop out and live in a methadone clinic. <laughs> How would I pitch a game show to Spike TV? You there, hold it. Here we go. Wait. Oh, how could you run this fast? What Don't make me call security. Hey, you dropped something. Whoa, that is a shit ton of cocaine. I wonder if it's. Oh my real. god. You just wait till I call your parents. Shit, she's coming back. Nicole? Hey, Miss Lynn. Rough day at work? What's going on with Braxton? None of your business. Why aren't you in class? Oh, uh, I was just on my way to the bathroom. You came all the way out to the main foyer on the way to the bathroom? What, do we need bathroom GPS now? <laughs> Tell me what class you're in right now. Civics? It's okay, I'm going now. Don't worry. I'll walk with you. No, that's okay. You don't have to. I insist. Wow, you can ask me out after? <laughs> on a date? Why would I do that? Wait, you're not a guy teacher. Sorry, let's go. Sorry, let's go. You're and not a as guy I teacher. hope you remembered, <laughs> today is the final day for submitting your community service sponsor. If you don't get those hours in, you Bowling cannot for... graduate. What oh the my God. fuck is on the Nicole, whiteboard back there? So nice of you to join us. I tell you to kill yourself in your garage, but you probably only have a two bedroom condo with your pets. <laughs> Pretend I didn't. Hear oh my that. god. I trust the rest of you will be taking the community service hours seriously. I guess. <laughs> you guess? Kelly, who's your sponsor? I'm volunteering for the county police department. Wow, that's lame. Something you'd like to add, Nicole? That's yeah, lame. Why don't you help the people who screw us over with speeding tickets? The office is really close to my house. I don't have to drive or anything. So you're gonna fuck the rest of us over just so you can save on gas money? What did I say about the F word in this class? <laughs> Sorry, bitch. Are we just supposed to drive as fast as we want? The police are here to keep us safe. Is that why I think it's $200? They're keeping my safe. Holy shit. Huh. Funny that a girl so critical of our legal system is failing civics. Funny how you teach the most expensive car you could ever afford. Oh my god. <laughs> All right, Nicole, if you're so in tune with the needs of the people, how about your cause? My what? Your cause? Your sponsor for the community service hours? You had two weeks to set something up. Now uh -oh. tell me with who. Uh... 
depression as an excuse. Ah, fuck. Yeah. I'm gonna end up doing both, but like, what one do I want to do right now? Uh, I want to use the depression. About that. See, um, I've sort of been going through a lot right now. Of course. Are we depressed? I let's guess we are. It. Yep. Let's hear another marvelous excuse from Nicole. I've been diagnosed with clinical, clinical depression, depression, so I haven't really gotten out of bed much lately. Depression? Yeah, it's from all the PTSD and some other letters. <laughs> some other yeah, letters? You couldn't at least think of a community service sponsor? Well, I tried a couple times, but when I did, I just started cutting myself. <gasps> Why? What the um, fuck? Because I'm a burden on everyone around me, and the community would be better off if I, I was did save dead. it. Ah, oh, jeez. That's really not good. <laughs> oh no, a am I bringing the mood down? Sorry. If anyone has a gun, I could borrow. I could just take care of myself now. A gun? Shit, I left mine at home today. <laughs> do you need someone to talk to? No, I don't want to bother anybody. Unless it's for a gun I can use to blow my worthless fucking brains out. Oh, no, okay, Nicole, this is not for the classroom. I think you need to go to the council. Oh, office. God. Don't I need a community service sponsor? We can worry about that later. Just go to the counselor. Okay. And, and you're sure you don't want me to kill myself? Oh, my God. I'll fire it right in my mouth. My nose will bleed like the Chocolate River from Willy Wonka. No, please don't kill yourself. Right, Mr. Cat? Well... What the fuck? No, no, we don't want you to kill yourself. Just go. House. <laughs> Please, Hunter, get help. Oh, Nicole, come in. Your civics teacher told me you'd be visiting. Have a seat. Sure, but I thought these were one-on-one -on -one sessions. What's she doing here? Normally they are. <laughs> However, I thought I'd try something different given your... Uh, I hate what the counselor. Then? Depression. You... Bitch. Nicole, you I understand bitch. you're going through a lot right now. No <laughs> What's up? Um, sorry, what well, we're going through like something. To deserve it, right? We're going through Ari, something right now. Using an I statement, please tell Nicole how that made you feel. This will be good. Um, I feel like you might not be considering my own situation too. That's very good. Thank you. Now, Nicole, oh dear please respond using your own I feel statement. Oh, dear God. Go ahead. Ari, I feel you're a conniving fucking bitch. How's that? Oh, my this God. This is going to be a long session. Jesus Christ. Nicole, wait. What? Need another excuse to steal? No. Well, no, it's just... What if I wasn't making it up? Making what up? At first, I went to class thinking I'd lie about the depression, but after talking to the counselor, I'm starting to realize there's something I actually am depressed about. Okay, cool. Talk to him about it. I can't. All right, fine. Fuck off then. Bye. Wait. <laughs> Fuck off then. What bye. Jesus Christ. Nicole. Something about me. Something I really can't let him know or he'll tell my parents. What are you, gay? What? How did you know? I've never told anyone that. Dude, look at your hair. Dog. Really? You're either gay or colorblind. But they have the you... same voice. Really? Okay with that? I mean, I wouldn't use that color, but do that. what you want. Not that. I meant the other thing. Are we in Nebraska now? No one cares if you're gay anymore. Are you sure? This is the most 80s conversation I've ever had. <laughs> My cousin in West Virginia is gay. He says it's horrible. It's West Virginia. What the fuck isn't horrible there? <laughs> oh so God. around here, you really think no one will care if I'm gay? Maybe like a weirdo or two, but everybody's gonna be like, look at that asshole. We're in a white ass high school 10 minutes from the Capitol. This is such a non issue now. But gay marriage isn't legal here. Were you looking to get married? I don't know if I'd ever wanna get married. So why do you care? And by the time you do, it'll probably be legal anyway. Oh, I'm not that optimistic when didn't it comes know to that. government. Ari, you're white. You could be triple gay, and the government's the government still gonna worry about you. You really think so? Oh, hey, Nicole, you still hanging around out here? Did I tell you that's a cool shirt, by the way? Look, hey, Crispin, you want to hear something about Ari? Oh, my God, don't. Ari's gay. She's gay? Yeah, like lesbian gay. Oh, that's cool. Is, is there, like, another part to the story, or? Go down to the cafeteria. You'll find it there. <laughs> oh, it's like a mystery. That's pretty cool. You're so creative inside. Oh, my God. All this time, I thought this would be the end of my life. If you lived in Texas, it would be, but this is civilization, dude. Texas. Well, I'll 
see you around somewhere. And thanks a lot, Nicole. I feel kind of free for once. Fuck off, bitch. You still stole my excuse. <laughs> now I have to think of a new one. <laughs> You oh didn't God. start depression, Nicole. I never said that, but I started using depression as an excuse at that school. No one was doing that before me, and now that she took it, everybody's gonna water it down. Do you feel like you're getting to a point where the excuses for <laughs> the homework are more effort than the homework itself? I don't know. Hold on. What's another mental disorder I could pull off? Quite a few. Yeah, but whatever I pick, I'll need to research at least a little, right? No, you don't. Mental illnesses are like horoscopes. You just look up symptoms that loosely fit your personality. Holy shit, where's my laptop? Oh, wait! Schizophrenia, good choice. No, I forgot <laughs> to tell you what happened after the counselor. Ari came out of the closet to me in the middle of the hallway. Closet with a glass door? I thought everyone knew that. Yeah, that's what I said. She thought it was like this huge deal. Well, wouldn't it be? What if someone homophobic knew? Yeah, who? I don't know anyone at our school who wouldn't vote for Obama. Holy shit, I can't think of anyone either. This area is like so Democrat, you're just preaching to the choir. Yeah, no, last year this gay guy sat at our table and was immediately the most popular person there. Because he was gay or... I mean, kinda. He quoted Amanda show a lot, I guess he was funny. <laughs> no one gave him shit or anything? I mean, oh, no. Kyler came up to us, but everyone was like, what's his problem? That's exactly what I told her. Well, as long as she's happy, like, whatever, right? I'm so happy for her. So happy I have to see her ass every week with the counselor now. Oh my god. And I wanted to say, Ari, how proud I am that you've been able to come to terms with your sexual orientation and openly share it with the rest of your peers. Thanks. It's just kind of liberating to tell someone I'm gay, you know? Every chance you get. Truthfully, you are so brave. Liberal high school, let's not get ahead of ourselves. Everyone's been so supportive. I can't believe there was a time when being gay was so hated you believed it last week yes yes <laughs> you believed Times it last have week certainly changed isn't that supposed to be a group therapy is there something you'd like to add nicole just thought it'd be worth the time to spotlight the progress we've made as a society though we still have a very long way to go in terms of sexual identity and acceptance what's left to accept transsexuals for one but also the rather silly notion of controlling other petty qualities. I hate hearing this counselor audience, talk. My God. Background, <laughs> Who is race, his VA? Religion, Please. And even age. Here we fucking go. Age? Why would someone have a problem with age if they're legal? But isn't that the problem? Letting legality control love? The state law says you can't marry another girl. But does that mean it's wrong for you to love her? No, but I'm pretty sure age is one we, you know... Society creates laws, but laws didn't create society. I hope what? both of you girls realize we should never be critical of anyone's preference regardless of what your parents or TV says. Like gender, age is just another thing on your driver's license. He fucking did um, not. How do you feel about that, Nicole? Do you have an I feel statement? I feel like he wants to fuck children. <laughs> yeah, but My that's God. not true, right, counselor? Like, you wouldn't date a 15-year-old, right? Would you date a 15-year-old? Oh, Maybe, my God. but I'm only 17, so it's not illegal. I just said, going by legality means you'd be in the wrong, too. Oh, my God. Did you say God. in the wrong, too? As in you would date a 15-year-old? I never said that. Oh, my God. I'm merely open-minded enough to I don't, not I hate him so much. The value of anyone of any age. You're trying to sell a teenage girl on pedophilia using her own gayness as leverage. What the fuck? Tennis pedophile love 15 looking bitch. Let her go, Ari. She's just having a personal moment and needs her space. Uh, okay. By the way, I didn't want to make Nicole jealous, but your hair looks absolutely beautiful today. Actually, I'm gonna go check on her to make sure she doesn't, uh, kill herself. Nicole, wait. Wasn't walking. <clears throat> that wasn't like... A normal thing, was it? No, him campaigning for that is a pretty normal thing around here. You didn't know? Not that. I meant you sticking up for someone like that. I never really seen you do that. Sticking up for who? Me. Okay. <laughs> I, I Say really it. appreciate it. Say uh, it. Huh? This is um oh my god, this is so fucking stupid. Kinda is. Nicole, I've, um, since we started oh, doing fuck off. counseling no. together, I've actually kind of been 
thinking a lot about you, but uh, not in a weird way, right? No, it's, sorry. it's in a weird way. <laughs> Sweetie. I really, really like you. I'm sorry. It's just you were the first person I came out to and what sorry. you said in there and your whole look, and I think I'm in love with you. Oh, my I'm God. Someone you know for two weeks. Yeah, you're real stable. You're not, like, all sketched out now, are you? A little, but it's not like you're a man saying this. How is it different with a man? Men kind of have a tendency to rape and murder. I'm not sure if you've seen a TV in the last forever. Oh god, that reminds me. I never even asked you. Ask me why. You, um, do you like girls too? Oh, we get to pick. Okay, let me save first before I get yelled at again. Uh, before college, make... Oh, dear God. Okay, before I pick this, before I pick this, I ran out of water and I need more stuff to drink. <laughs> so I need to run and grab a drink. So I will be right back. Okay, I've acquired the drinks. What do I want to open next? I don't know. I have three drinks. I have water, an energy drink, and peach tea. So one of those, I don't know which one I want to open. <laughs> And she is like that. Like what? Who? What? <laughs> huh? Okay, so I saved this, right? I did. I remember I saved it. Which one are we going to pick? Go for peach? Okay, I'll open the peach one. You ready? There you go. <laughs> There's the serotonin for open up the peach. Ooh. Ooh, that's a lot of peach. Okay. Um... Well, we're gonna pick one or the other because we're gonna do the other one anyway, so we will do this one oh, first. Oh, this shit's fun. Oh, fuck. I mean, why? You don't think it's weird to tell a girl you love her and then ask if she's it's, gay? It's a good one, right? I, I guess I wasn't thinking. I don't know. So let's say I said yes, right? If you were my girlfriend, what would you do for me? 
What would you, you know, do for me? Anything you want? Oh my anything? god. Damn. So any depraved ass shit you're just down for. Are you? Uh, yeah. Could I choke you while we make out? If you want. Could I smack the shit out of you in public? I'm gonna grab yes, a snack please. too, because like I'm a little hungry. Am I too desperate? No, not your self esteem, my self esteem. Group right now. How come? Now that a girl wants me this bad, I'm like universally hot now. Like, I'm universally no, hot yeah, now. Not really. Sorry. <laughs> not there yet. Oh, oh, man. Look, you're probably better off. It doesn't feel like I'm better off. Speaking of off, you're not gonna off yourself over this, are you? Oh my god. If you do, will you leave me your eye touch? Why the fuck would I give an eye touch to a girl too? rejecting me? Sorry, it works with guys, never mind. Does this feel like a hole in your chest or what? What the fuck? I feel like you're gonna be alone forever. I don't know any girl who's gay here. You could find out. How? Sex to pick of yourself to every straight girl you know. One of them's bound to be in the closet. What? And if they're not? Worst case scenario, they forward it to their boyfriends. He'll text back like, ha ha, what an idiot, but the picture will absolutely go in the rotation. Rotation for what? Look, I gotta go. Just oh forget what I said. Good luck, excuse stealer. <laughs> Good luck, bitch. excuse bitch. Bye, you like your old Is that the parody movie? Yeah, the one with the milkshake song. Yeah, it was kind of funny. My I thought so too, but I was trying to watch yard. it online and the movie website said it was 3 out of 10 stars. Oh my well, god. It wasn't that bad. I know. I tried clicking 9 stars to bump it up and it said I had to sign in. What the fuck? Who the fuck has time for that shit? I just wanted to watch the movie again. Hmm? Huh. That means all the opinions on the internet are only from weirdos with enough time to create an account. I know, it's so dumb. Like, maybe if you fucked a bitch, you'd know a good movie when you see one. <laughs> are you saying oh my that God. a date movie makes you a virgin? I mean, basically. I could get behind that. But no, so I go on the rest of the site, like, what did they think's a good movie? And all their nine-star movies are so boring. Have you seen The Godfather? I've heard of it. My dad made me watch it. I fell asleep. How is that a nine? What else was high? Uh, there was American History X, but I haven't seen it. That one's cool. Kind of long, though. What's it about? A racist guy? You like a movie about a racist guy? What the it's fuck? like a whole moral whatever. Weird Christian bitch. <laughs> Weird what the hell Christian was that? bitch. Yeah, I don't know where he got that. But so another movie was... Oh, look who it is. Oh, it's the fuck. school bigot. What? Don't play dumb. We heard what you said. And we heard what you did to Ari. You'll really reject a gay girl, then have the nerve to say no one's homophobic here. Oh, oh my so God. So now our conversations are worth broadcasting. I only mentioned it to one person. I didn't think it'd be a thing. Ari told people too. You're sick, Nicole. Pretending there isn't bigotry here. It must be nice to ignore it. What, are you gay? No. Then fuck off. You don't need to be gay we to fight homophobia. Off. I never said she can't be gay. I said no one here would hate her for being gay. Indifference is as bad as participation. American what History X is an amazing movie, though. I've said. never seen it, so I can't say. Sayings memorized? Actually, we have a list of 500 signatures. 500 signatures in favor of expelling you for gay bashing Ari. Damn, that's a lot. When the hell did you get 500 signatures? Over the last two days. And I think it's safe to say the people have spoken. Everyone we went up to immediately signed to fight homophobia. Okay, kind of proving my point. What point? That you hate gay people? If there's such a mass homophobia problem at the school, how'd you get 500 signatures with no pushback at all? Uh, so ignorant. Oh my GSA God. Club weeps for you. Yeah, I don't think you're ready a GSA for a GSA Club weeps for you. Come on, let's get more signatures. Homophobic, come on, man. Like Even Hunter. <laughs> yeah, this feels a little over the top. Can you, like, talk to people for me and clear this up? Hell no, not getting involved. Oh, Ari. Yeah? What's this shit about me hating gay people? I didn't tell anyone that, but they just kind of had their own conclusion. Well, can you tell them to chill out? Why the fuck would I do anything for you? You rejected me. Oh my this god. bullshit. Oh, Ari, I got your picture. You did? Yeah, you looked hot as fuck in it. Oh my god, thank you. Would you want to try, like... No, sorry, I'm not there yet. Maybe in college. Dumbest advice ever. <laughs> Who would advise her to randomly sex people? Oh, shit. What? Oh, no, shit. Show me the picture? No, get your own. As you might be aware, the school's oh, GSA has been petitioning for your immediate expulsion. What the fuck's a GSA? Gay Straight Alliance. So if a gay girl asks me out, I'm just not allowed to reject her? I'm not exactly sure that's what they're saying. The claim is that you bullied a gay girl by downplaying homophobia. Yeah, but I'm pretty sure this all became a thing because I wouldn't go out with her. 
Well, I'm sorry, but that detail doesn't seem to be relevant in the documentation for this petition. What do I have to do to prove I'm not homophobic? Make out with her on public access? Nicole, you know the public <laughs> oh access God. stations wouldn't allow that. Don't be disingenuous. Okay, then channel four, five, the CW, what? That's not what I meant. Well, what do I have to do? I believe the best course of action is writing Ari a formal apology letter to- Fuck that shit. Do you even know how I got involved with this bitch? <laughs> Language. Do you even know how I got involved with this hoe? Slightly better. She stole one of my- <laughs> Slightly like better. And I got stuck in group counseling with her. Ari screwed me over first. Nicole, this is like telling police they should arrest someone for selling you bad weed. Wouldn't put selling a bag of stems past her either. <laughs> Look, it's either write her a letter, go to a sensitivity retreat, or be expelled. Sensitivity retreat? Is that like conversion therapy? Third person reverse conversion therapy. You have a week to decide. You're excused. Oh my god. <laughs> what the fuck? Waste of time. Karen? Homophobe. Even Karen? Days are numbered, bitch. Holy shit, get a hoggy. <laughs> Sucks, don't it? Okay, let's hear your dumbass insult. What? Pilot on. I'm a homophobe, right? You think I'm just another sheep, don't you? Is sheep interchangeable with dipshit? Don't get defensive. I've heard what they're saying about you. Let's just say I know a place that can help you out. What the what fuck? What could possibly help me out of this situation? I don't know. Maybe the straight club the straight what? club <laughs> no. it's on the DL, dude what the hell is the straight club just a place for us straights you know a group to avoid bitches in the gsa for sure if they're so proud of being gay then we're proud of being straight i gotta be dreaming right now that good huh <laughs> more like so incredibly fucking stupid there's no way it's real oh it's real all right and you're invited oh shit. i feel so special come on it's fun we make signs plan events talk about john mccain have pizza parties just a wholesome get together oh my god some huh 100 percent. do you still have percocet i'll go if you give me some oh uh, all right sure okay where is it follow me we can't disclose it verbally okay what the fuck too it's straight club movie night wow straight club movie night <laughs> guys welcome our new member nicole oh what's up fancy seeing you here why am i not surprised it's all men it's movie night <laughs> boys we got the projector ready no nah, but i got it cool let me help you so you're in the straight club huh let's not use the word in visiting then i guess why are you <laughs> in the straight club isn't it obvious don't make me say it well okay maybe it's kind of a long story it all goes back to when I finally started narrowing down my interest to a couple key hobbies. Oh my god. Video games and anime, for starters. Jeez, don't make me say it. And I love stuff like that so much, I wasn't afraid to tell anyone about it. But I didn't think so many people would find it annoying. My hobbies are practically my identity. And <coughs> ever since middle school, I've been bullied for every hobby I have. Jesus Good. Christ. Yeah, that's what they said, too. I saw other kids get bullied for being gay or foreign, and everybody immediately rushed to their defense. But what when I got I bullied have? for how I talk, um, what I like, no one Humpty really cared. Dumpty like, Party Mix. Supposed to be protected. All just Almost flavored. Liking anime is a choice. <clears throat> exactly, and that's when I realized no one's sympathetic when you're regular bullied. They only care if just, my stomach was growling when we were before they were jerks earlier, for bullying so me. I'm like, oh, but with I'm this grab new some group, shit. they're gonna be bigots. Okay, that's surprisingly quick. Except for one thing. What's that? How the fuck did you pick the straight club? I couldn't <laughs> really pull off being gay. I get too nervous around girls. My friend Jasper loved cartoons and Amanda show. But then he came out as gay, and it was like no one was allowed to call him annoying anymore. Did you say Amanda show? Yeah, why? No reason. Straight pride isn't going to make anyone want to <laughs> no protect reason. you. Straights are way in the lead here. Well, if that's true, why do we have to be so secretive of the straight pride club? Feels like everyone gets a pride rally but us. It's called a Redskins tailgate. Uh, never mind. Let's not get into this on movie night. Really movie not night. For politics. It's not politics. It's fucking dumb as shit. What teacher would even sponsor this? We couldn't get an official sponsor, but one teacher agreed to under the table sponsor us. Okay, so what teacher would under the table sponsor this? Greetings, fellow straights. I brought the movie, Nicole. <laughs> Nicole? Now that we got a pretty girl in the straight club, we're really in business. Dude, oh my god. Timing. What's the movie this you don't week, have coach? those here? It's They're really Rambo good. Three again, is it? Nah, I thought we'd switch things up from the last They're four really weeks. good. They're the best tips ever. They're my favorite. Of American History X. Seen it. I'm leaving. 
thing. Not so fast, young lady. What makes it so special? See, when the movie first came out, it was great. Just a man proud of his heritage kicking ass. But then Hollywood had to come in. Hollywood. BS progressive agenda on the last part of the movie. So this is my copy of American History X with the last 30 minutes cut out. Who wants to watch? Oh, I love director's cuts. I'm going to get us some popcorn. Be right back. This is gonna be right back. So, Nicole, what brought you to the straight club anyway? Some drama. I don't worry about it. She's just being shy. Some dyke bitch told everyone Nicole was homophobic. She didn't want to date her. What the fuck is wrong with these <laughs> gay people? Oh, oh my God. God. What? Remember his VA water. is? We should publicly execute those Love weirdos. It. Now that's what I expected to hear the fuck? Club. What's her address, Nicole? Let's show that bitch a lesson. Whoa, chill out. I don't know it. Don't hold out on us. Tell me where she lives or I'm gonna choke slam you into the sugar cube castle. I told you I didn't know her fucking address. Kyla, Kyla, calm down. Oh my God. This is way over the top. I don't get it, coach. <laughs> I thought this was the straight club. I know, but you're being messy. Besides, I'm a teacher. I'll just look up a file and get the address that way. Great thinking, coach. Get her address for what? Just gonna teach her and her family a little lesson in humility. Come on, straight club. First a student files, then a drive down 95 where the gas is cheap. <laughs> down 95? Wouldn't that take forever? I'm not gonna burn her house down with expensive gas. Oh, hell yeah! Let's go, boys. Finally, reparations! I hate these hobos. I wonder if they'll get blamed for this, too. Probably. Get me out of this shit. What the? Where'd everybody go? Uh -huh. Maybe I should find something other than being straight. Oh my god. What the fuck is that house? I'm trying not to get blamed for hate crime. I'm watching Drake and Josh. This better be really fucking good. It's actually really bad. Watching Drake and Josh. <laughs> I'll see you later. Dude, wait. What? Okay, I was well. invited to the straight club and they're on their way to burn Ari's house down right now. We have to stop it. Okay, slow way the fuck down what the hell is a straight club the gym coach started an underground cult for straight pride they all think they're victims for being straight aren't we victims of being straight name one good boyfriend either of us had <laughs> no, it's all men oh how are they victims they're jealous of gay pride rallies that's all i gathered they should be they're fun it's the only place where you can make out with <laughs> different girls and feel proud of your cold sores the next morning Cool. So they're on their way to kill Ari right now. Oh, yeah. Why would they burn her house down? Because they heard she spread the homophobic rumor about me, and now they want revenge or something. They were set off, like, instantly. And so why is that your problem? I thought you hated her. Because it's a hate crime that I am going to get blamed for. These guys are insane. They watch American History X with the ending cut out. But it's about a racist guy. Isn't cutting it down good? The end's where they learn how to not be racist. Okay, okay, I get it. <laughs> Except for one little detail. What? Why the fuck did you come here? Call the police. When have the police ever done anything good for us? <sighs> All right, let me get my shoes. <laughs> let me get my shoes. <laughs> Is she already asleep? Ari? Ari! Why can't it be like the movies where they're just conveniently 10 feet from the door? It better be like the movies soon. When are they getting here? I think they went down to Woodbridge where the gas is cheap, so we maybe have a few minutes. The price is cheaper, but don't you burn that driving down there? <laughs> Not for their car. Oh yeah, to burn the house down. Drake and Josh is on. This better be good. Drake and Josh. Marathon. What do you want? It's almost 10. Is your family home? No, they're out of town. What the fuck do you want? You've got to get out of here. Someone's on the way to burn your house down. What? Who would set my house on fire? Coach Colby Straight Club. They're mad at the general idea of homosexuality and want to kill you for being gay. Yeah, so pretty serious. That sounds so made up, it's not even funny. You already rejected me. Now you want to prank me? She's not making it up there on the way. Why the hell would Nicole go out of her way to help anyone but herself? It doesn't make any sense. Because if you die, the school would indict me as the cause of the hate crime. You really got to get <laughs> out of here. Why wouldn't I just call the police? So they can show up 10 minutes after you're dead? Okay, where's the camera? There's no fucking camera. No MTV, no Ashton Kutcher, no <laughs> the guy from Drumline. No Ashton what Kutcher. What do we have to do to prove we're not making this up? How should I know? I don't know, just anything she wouldn't do to pull off a prank? Uh, fine. Kiss me. Oh, well, easy. Not you, her oh, he... fully loaded. He... I mean, Nicole her has to fully me. loaded. Why me? I thought you were mad at her. Oh, I am. I hate her. Nicole, you're a cold, corrupt, selfish, psychopathic bitch. Literally oh. the most sadist fucking whore. I wouldn't be surprised if you like killing animals. Oh. I tried. You don't even get mad at the assumption of that. You're severely twisted, evil, manipulative, and in general, just a heartless bitch. Oh my god. Doesn't mean I don't want you every waking moment of my sad fucking life. 
Excuse me. Oh, oh my you god. Show every sign of an abuser, and I don't give a shit. You're the kind of girl who choke me good night. The kind of girl who walk in on me cutting and take the razor blade and do it for me. I don't want a girlfriend to marry. I want a girlfriend who helps me plan my own suicide. You're that girl, Nicole, and I need you bad. Bitch, you need therapy. Okay, but she confessed her love for you. Are you gonna kiss her now? No way. Fuck this bitch. Why? She stole my excuse. I don't kiss depression posers. You are so petty. How else is she gonna believe this isn't a prank? My demand's final. We're here to save you right now. Shame that you hate being a homophobe more than I hate dying. Even if you're telling the truth, I don't care. You know what I want. Oh my Nicole, god. We lost five minutes doing this and she hasn't moved one inch from her house. Uh, what if we took you to the Super 8 and I kiss you in the lobby? The lobby? What am I worthless? Yes. Do you want to hear <laughs> yes? I'll get my shoes. No time. Get in the car. Well, at least they got her out of the house. How being nice lands you in hostage friendships. Well, the fear of being blamed for inciting a hate crime lands you in hostage relationships. So, after our house burned down, it went from everyone in school hating me to everyone in school threatening to kill me. And I only had one option out. <coughs> I've had to date Ari for the last two months so far, so they wouldn't think it was my fault. And I gotta keep this up for another six and hope she doesn't figure the charade out before graduation. She's really, 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 really fucking annoying, too. Do you want to watch Heroes? <coughs> no, I don't want to watch fucking Heroes. Heroes sucks. Jack is the, is the only heroes? person who's in on it, and every day... See, there's homophobia here, but them burning our house down for being gay doesn't prove anything, okay? Oh Obama's literally the president now. If a plane crashes, does that make 99.9% .9 of the rest of airplanes unsafe? Yeah, that's what I thought. If it's so bad, she can move to Brooklyn, or wherever annoying people live after they graduate. Oh my god. Jesus Christ. <laughs> oh my god. Emergency service request. This is 911 with SMS update on your service request. Approximately time for your police officer arrivals. What the fuck? Please find a safe location until your first responder arrives to assist you with your arson hate crime. Oh my god. Thank you and have a nice day. To no longer receive these text messages, reply stop. All texts from everyone are subject to 24-7. What the fuck? A series that was good for one reason. Oh, Jesus. Oh, okay. I want to... Let's try um, this one. Do you want me to? Y yeah. How badly? Extremely... No pressure, but I might cut if you say no. Where do you cut? On my upper thigh, so my parents don't see. Damn, that's actually kind of hot. It, it is. What the yeah, fuck? Yeah, because you look too normal to cut, so it's like a fun surprise. Are you messing with me? No, seriously, it's like a cheerleader with a nipple piercing. Ooh, wild side. Really? <laughs> what? Cut too? Duh, but it's not hot when I do it. It's like, look at that trashy hoe. I bet she cuts herself. I don't think you're trashy. I don't think I should have an F in gym. Shit happens, though. <clears throat> So, if you think I am hot, would you want to start dating? Uh, yeah, I guess I'll try it. <gasps> really? <laughs> really? It's really funny so if I said no right now. Please don't do that to me. No, okay, I'll do it. You have a car to take us out? Yeah, my mom's old Camry, and only three of the windows are broken. Oh my god, fucking Camrys. No, they're just manual. <sighs> oh, but I could borrow my dad's Lexus if it makes a difference. It makes a difference. Okay, <laughs> I'll see you after school. I love you. What the Bye. Bye. <laughs> Bye. Why'd you take me to a bookstore? It's like the library, but all the books are new. Do I look like a bitch who reads? <laughs> Not even Harry Potter? It's like coming of age relatable and stuff. Oh my There's god. No Percocet and Harry Potter. How's it relatable? Hey, Nicole. Didn't know you read here, too. You had to stop in the graphic novel section. You didn't know him? <laughs> not really, but I'll take care of it. So, are you reading some manga with your friend there? Oh, she's not my friend. She's my girlfriend. Girlfriend? But you're. Hold on. <laughs> Do you have a problem with two lesbians going to a bookstore as opposed to literally anything else? Th though, it's good to be yourself. 
You guys are just a little different, like me. We are nothing like you. And why is that? Because while you're beating off to your little anime book, we're going to get fucked up on whippets and make out. Hey, that was completely uncalled for. Oh, my God. Oh, don't freak out when someone makes up a joke about you. It'll make people think it's real. But <laughs> I have done that to my manga. She shouldn't act like it's wrong, though. Oh, God. Shouldn't have helped him. I've seen him around before. I didn't know he was fucked up like that. By the way, I started a YouTube channel. You, you guys want to see it? No, we got to go by Whippets. I never <laughs> tried Whippets. Do they taste bad? Do they taste bad? And then the counselor got so weird, he called my mom and told her I might have schizophrenia if I ever mentioned he was a pedophile. And what'd your mom say? She believed him. We had like an hour-long fight over it. Right, honey? Right, honey? Dude, I said don't call me that in public. Oh, I thought it was don't say it in private. If I didn't want it in private, why would I want it in public? I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm still getting used to your boundaries and everything. Boundaries? I didn't know you're dating a marriage counselor. What's up, queers? Nicole. Dude, he's not gonna do anything. Heard you guys were <laughs> dating now. What are you, special or something? Why do you care? Sorry to hoes like you always looking for attention. Find one oh, right, he's in that in stupid room. club. No one's falling for this bullshit like you think they are. Hey, Hunter. Hey, Hunter. Sure. They're saying they're gay now. That's fucking dumb, right? Uh, Obama might be president soon. Who's worried about being gay anymore? Dude, fuck Obama. He's a bitch. My dad's voting for McCain. Why would he vote for McCain? He's a fucking war hero. Maybe then we'll nut up and nuke the Middle East. What the hell? Oh. Well, sorry, dude, but your dad sounds really fucking gay voting for McCain. What? No, no, you're gay. <laughs> Eventful. Thanks for taking care of that, Nicole. No problem. Hey, could you go to the longest pizza line and get me four slices? <laughs> yeah, sure. Anything. <laughs> okay. Why aren't you going? <laughs> you won't kiss me on the cheek first? Oh, my God. Mwah. Okay. Mwah. <laughs> the way she oh, does it. Mwah. <laughs> what? Are you straight again? No, I have dollar store foundation on my lips now. Ugh. This could double as baby formula in Pakistan. She's your girlfriend. So? So take your bitch to Ulta. No, already trying to limit the exposure. That's why I sent her to the pizza line. But you haven't even dated for a week yet. Fucked up, right? Did she do something wrong? She just gets really awkward when you're around her for long enough. Awkward how? Okay, so she was in my room while I was changing real quick. Then she saw one nipple for like a second and was all, Oh my god, I'm sorry I look, but you're so sexy, you're so sexy, I'm so lucky to have you. Like, bitch, fuck off. Oh I've seen her with god. guys before. I don't know why she's acting like such a virgin. Her relationship is kind of hot, though. Girl. Jesus she's like a higher echelon. But if she's so gay, why was she even with guys in the first place? Because hooking up with a guy is the easiest thing on earth. Even if a girl's gay, she's going to try it at least once or nine times. <laughs> nine Wait, times. So first time you're curious, second time you're bored, and ninth time you're just trying to keep the lights on. What and the I fuck? just want to see how cool it is that you guys are so open about this, right? Yeah. I kissed a girl at a party once, and I totally get the appeal. Lesbianism is just so, so bold. Have you thought about, like, going full time with it? You mean, like, gay married? Yeah. Fuck that. Then I wouldn't have a rich husband. Isn't there more to a relationship <laughs> than money, though? Maybe? I see you guys ride around in that beat up Camry, and it's cute, but I'd never cuff a broke bitch. Can you believe her? Yeah, these by curious hoes, fuck them. By the way, did you <laughs> hold on? I'm replying to something. Okay. Are you done? No, shut up. Hold on. Nicole, I, I don't really like it when you tell me to shut Just up. Just fuck off, okay? <coughs> Maybe quit the fox die. It's fucking your brain up. <gasps> oh my god. Oh shit. Oh shit, I, she says. Um, hey, listen, uh. I'm really sorry for not respecting your boundaries. I promise it won't happen again. Oh. What? what? <laughs> I was totally in the wrong. You had every right to say that. Well, as long as you're sorry, you dumb bitch. I know I'm a dumb bitch. I'm sorry. I love you. I think I'm starting to love you, too. Oh, my God. You guys see the new Smallville? <laughs> Dude, Smallville's for straight people. Who watches that shit? You were straight three weeks ago. Yeah, and I didn't watch it then, either. Guess it's just universally bad. I saw a couple episodes once. It was okay. Was anyone asking you? Um, no. Just checking. Yep. Anyway, I was gonna buy lunch today, but the lines are like so <coughs> long. It's probably spicy chicken sandwich day. Oh, and I want one. Me too. Ari, get us the chicken sandwiches. I'll pay you back. But the line's gonna take forever. Can we just- Don't you love me? <sighs> okay, I'll go. Cool. Yeah, and get me two if they have enough. They're big. You gonna eat two? One for now, one for when I'm depressed. <laughs> Are you got all that? Be right back. 
You're forgetting something. Oh, right. Sorry. Mwah. Good girl. Don't make me ask again. I know. I love you. That's nice. That's nice. What the fuck? I know. What's her problem, right? No, what the fuck did you do to her? She's like your pet now. Yeah, see, you know how I wanted out of the relationship? What I thought would be more fun than breaking up was just seeing what I could get away with. Get away with what? <clears throat> Dude, like, everything so far. I'll literally call her a bitch to her face and she'll just apologize and kiss me on the cheek. It's such a power trip. Oh my god. Uh, it sounds like abuse. I get that. But honestly, if it is, abusing feels fucking awesome. Don't knock it till you try it. Yeah, but you know why you're getting away with it, right? Oh, let's hear this. <clears throat> because you're her only option. <clears throat> so you're taking advantage of the fact the only lesbian in school knows there aren't any other lesbians to date here. She's basically stuck with whatever you want to put her through. She can break up anytime she wants. She's not stuck with anything. Okay, so she breaks up to move on to who? The only girl willing to date her is her abusive ex-girlfriend. And? <laughs> sense, but you're like an evil fucking bitch. No, okay. If you're so high and mighty about it, why don't you tell her everything you just told me? The dynamic, the game, everything. I don't know her like that. Awkward ew. Awkward if only ew. life was like TV, where friends spill their hearts out to people they barely know. You probably don't even watch anything good. You watch Smallville. You're evil. You're friends with someone who's evil. You're <laughs> friends with someone who watches Smallville. Holy shit, don't say it that loud. <laughs> Holy shit, Again, don't say I it that loud. I <laughs> apologize for the misunderstanding we had last time the two of you came in here. I would never want to be mistaken for an abuser. I can assure you that. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Abuser? Yes, anyway. Nicole, it's been a while since we've chatted. What's going on with you? What's going on with me? Yes, if you'd care to share with us. What the hell do I say to that? A variety <laughs> of things. You could speak about what you did over the weekend or something that's caught your interest lately. <laughs> Ari and I are here to listen. Okay, well, I heard Kanye West just got out of jail. Really? Tell me more. Um... <laughs> He was in jail, that and then peach he wasn't in tea jail. is making me hiccup so now. So why was he in jail in the first place? He broke somebody's Get this camera dude off the and screen! And his new Please. album's delayed or something. Four A new four. album? Do you think it'll be as good as his last album? No. Why are you pretending like you know what I'm talking about? I'm not pretending. That's what counselors Just do. Just having a conversation. Uh, name one Kanye West song. Um, I can't think of any off the top of my head. <laughs> name one. What are some of your favorites? Dude, you're name so it. fucking gay. Nicole, you know that word isn't welcome on this campus. I'm gay now. I can say it. The F word. But the homophobic one's fine then. Well, out of respect <laughs> to Ari here, I wouldn't say that's fine either. Ari, how does that make you feel? Well, actually, I actually wanted to ask something. When you said we mistook you for an abuser? Yes, go on. Like, how? You, you weren't violent or anything. I don't know. Abuse can come it's in many forms. It's not the comp. Shh. It's not just violence it's or physical assault. Shh. It could be psychological, it's the peach. emotional, it's the peach. financial. And it's not carbonated, actually. Over if like I'm being honest, it's not I think carbonated. They call it sexual abuse. Nicole, what did I say? Something about fucking kids. That's it. Yeah, this no, it's not carbonated. I'm sorry, but you'll both have to come back at a later time when you learn how to behave yourselves. But I didn't. Out. Finally, fuck. It's like the guy in every sitcom's pedophile episode. Every sitcom has a pedophile episode? Yeah, where the kids learn a lesson or whatever. Oh, yeah. Nicole? What? Could I ask you something? No, sorry. I don't have any more kisses today. The kiss factory's closed. Somebody died. No, it wasn't about that. Somebody it died. It was, uh... Why are you dating me? Why am I dating you? Why am I doing anything? I don't know. It's just... I was thinking about what the counselor said in there. Dude, your shirt doesn't see through. I don't want to try that. What well, the no, that's a way bigger problem, but I'm just talking about us right now. What about us? I'm just thinking like what we've been for the last couple weeks. You mean awesome? Maybe mm -hmm. awesome, awesome for you, which is good, but what he said about how abuse works, it, it kind of made me worried. So I'm abusing you? Uh, I don't know. If you do, I don't think you mean to. When have I ever hit you or anything? You haven't, but the emotional abuse and how it controls. You're really putting weight into what the fuck he says? 
He's a counselor. He knows about this stuff. I'm your girlfriend. I pay for your five guys. He wants to put his dick in a child. How am I getting outclassed here? No, I always have to pay when we go to five guys. Okay. Do I have well, almost nothing like that here. Don't worry about it. But I'm just saying, like, how are you gonna let yeah, a freaking cost... fucking counselor put all I these ideas in your I think it was like a dollar fifty. And it's like it's a huge a it's like while. a huge can. All he did was six hundred to tell you. And ninety five milliliters what? is how much is in there. I don't think we should see each other anymore. It was only like a dollar fifty. So I'm losing my girlfriend because of the pedophile counselor. I'm sorry, Nicole. I got dumped <coughs> before the counselor got reported. <laughs> well, I'm gonna go home and kill myself. One month later. Is dust off the same high as whippets? I never tried dust off. Really? Why is that surprising? You've tried everything else when a guy offers. <clears throat> Why would I flirt with a guy to get a free hit of dust off? You can get the whole thing at a store for like three dollars. Only three dollars? Yeah, have you ever gone to a Staples? Oh, Staples? What are you two high school musicals staples? walking to a Staples now? No, every time I go in the one near school, the manager always flirts with me. He's like, let's find you a new computer, sweetie. What if he just wants to sell you a new computer? Let's let's a new computer. Hand on my okay, a little late on that detail. You don't complain when the guy at Paxson does it. Because the guy at Paxson can get me something I actually want. I'm not going to make out with a manager for a free pencil case. Are you saying you made out with a guy at Paxson? You're gay, right? Don't ask, don't tell, bitch. Not gay anymore. <laughs> oh my god, I forgot. I Sorry, I wasn't thinking. No, it's okay. I'm over it. Are you sure? Didn't you, like, try killing yourself over it? Oh my god. Honestly, not really. Like, I got in a tub, caught a little, and the water was really nice and warm, and... I don't know, I just wasn't feeling it. I get that. Oh shit, she's coming over here. What? Why? Hey, Nicole. Hi. I just wanted to talk a little again, see how you were doing. You haven't showed up to the group depression counseling in a while. What the fuck? Yeah, I sort of quit that. I figured it would be awkward and everything. Kind of like this. Sorry, I know. I just worry <coughs> a lot. Uh, are you trying to get back together again? I don't get it. Yeah, uh... What? That's not exactly an option for me anymore. Hey, Ari, what's going on? Oh, nothing. I was just wrapping up here. Who's this? Oh, yeah. Um, Nicole, this I'm sorry, is what? my boyfriend, Hunter. We've been dating for a couple weeks now. What? Hey. What the fuck? Is something wrong? Oh, uh, I was just thinking about Staples. The <laughs> about store? Staples. Long story. Ari, I gotta get back, but your tray is at the table for you. Oh, you're so sweet. Thank you, Snookums. Who the fuck says Snookums? What was that? Oh, sorry. What I said was, I thought you were gay. Okay, I knew we'd have to talk about this eventually. Are you bisexual now? Honestly, no. What the fuck? <coughs> Are you thinking about Staples again? No, like, what the fuck is going on? Yeah, how can you have a boyfriend if you're not bisexual? The truth is, I still love everything about girls. I love how they talk, how they laugh, how they use moisturizer, how they do makeup. I love how girls do their hair, how they smell nice, how they don't wear the same thing every day. I'm so confused. I really love how they hold your hand. I ship it. it feels when they kiss I'm you. so confused, this bitch. Ari makes no sense. Then you're dating a guy because... Because, like, even though I feel that way, I have to be honest with myself. Girls are kind of high maintenance. Oh, Girls play mind games I can't figure out. And so the month we had together made me realize something else. Realize <clears throat> what? I realized that guys turn me off, but girls make me want to fucking kill myself. <laughs> you bullied a gay girl into it's being be straight. She's not oh straight god. Now. She's just going to be miserable for the rest of her life. Big difference. Are you seriously not getting how bad this is? How bad what is? You bullying a gay girl into being straight? Oh my I didn't god. Bully her. I was just abusive while dating her. What's the difference? One's homophobic, the other's just regular bad. So you get how bad this is then. Bitch, you watch Smallville. Do you get how bad that is? Jesus That's Christ. not gonna work this time, Nicole. What the fuck is this? Why do you even care? Whatever. Whatever what? Are we Whatever. not friends anymore? Well, I wouldn't want you as an enemy. Holy shit. No, <laughs> explain to me how this is any more awful than anything I usually do. Because usually you do it to men. I'm like, was that overboard? And you always say he'll end up a rapist or pedophile anyway. But she's a teenage girl, Nicole. I don't know she why. She's a gay, <laughs> codependent <laughs> teenage girl. It wasn't hard enough. What's your excuse this time? 
I don't like Ari. I don't know why. Idea. Fuck her. You should have said nothing. Do we not have friends now? You ever feel guilty oh. for just wondering if you should feel guilty? She poured her heart out again and again over how she felt about me, but it's like, isn't she better off? Like, I told her it's hot she cuts herself, and I wasn't lying, but am I really the one here? Going by Jekka's bitch morality, abusing her was a good thing. Figured it out sooner than later, right? But then you gotta ask. That's actually kind of cute. Be alone, that picture's kind of cute. Or have a hot, twisted bitch who demeans you in public but gives amazing head. These are the real questions that plague society. I wonder if it's like that for the other physically bisexual, mentally gay girls. Talking with straight guys must be so fucking weird for them. They're both worried about what girls are thinking. Both go into depressive fits when a girl won't text them back. They experience the same dating dynamics, and yet they will never bond over it. Because the guy will say, well, if you're sad and lonely, I'm here. And I'm she'll here. go, I'm actually more gay than bi. And then he's like, all right, bitch, fuck you then. Guess you don't know how it feels. I'm not saying I've seen Jesus. it, but it's totally possible. Did I have a moral with this? Fuck. Did I have a moral with this? Fuck. Oh... Oh, new message. What's the new message? You're a fucking bitch. <laughs> Every time I miss you, I remind myself it's exclusively for the sex and I can pay for that. So, bitch, you're not priceless. Not even close. P.S. Call me for... I don't know what FWB is. Don't know the lingo. Sorry, high as fuck right now. Bro, what the hell? Well, that was something to- what the fuck? <laughs> what the f fuck? <laughs> um... What was that other one with- It was the essay. It was the essay. It was this one. I kind of wanna, this one. but I just can't right now. I told you the papers don't need to be good, they just need to be done. Yeah, but I want it to be good to oh, me. Oh, it means friends with what, benefits. What, so you care about school now? Never said that. Good to oh. me, but bad for the teacher. Oh, so okay. you're plotting. I'm plotting heavy. I want to write something <clears throat> that gets me the grade, but destroys her reputation. This sounds like way too much effort. How would you even do that? Everybody has biases. And when push comes to shove, those biases turn into major personality flaws. Are you trying Ooh. to get Miss Ames fired? Maybe. And if I can't get, get her Ms. fired, Ames I'm fired? perfectly happy with showing her she's just another Democrat in a gated community. Yeah, she's really afraid of rat music, too. But then again, she likes Tupac. Does oh she God. like Tupac, or does she feel obligated to mention Tupac? Oh, shit. Yeah, she always says that as a response to something. Yeah, so I'm going to go back to class. I need to do some research. Some okay, research. Okay, well, I'm going to skip anyway. Do you want to hang out, though? You know, yeah, come over after school. Seriously? Your mom's not gonna bitch about it or anything? I mean, she will, but fuck her. Yeah, I get it. I'll see you tonight. Oh my god. You had to make this shit about poetry. Are we having trouble over here? These poetry books suck ass. Can I just say the state of modern poetry sucks ass? <laughs> Remember, four pages. So, can I just copy and paste modern poetry sucks ass until it fills four pages? Are these books you gave us really all we're allowed to use? <laughs> Unless you're able to find some contemporary works on your own. And that's other than the rap on your iPods. But what if it's iPods. meaningful rap? And what's the likelihood of that? You find a stanza about drug use and misogyny? There will be no papers on the meaning of hoes in this classroom. Not a big fan, huh? Oh my I God. won't lecture you on intellectually stimulating music, but I think it's necessary to not voluntarily degrade yourself. <laughs> the uh -huh. best care. So Why does everybody like, like Kyler? Everyone, rap, all of you, all of you love I Kyler. Do I don't get it. This culture of rap and how it's so awful <clears> now. <throat> that would be a new one. You can try that. Just make sure to give it real effort, even if it might disagree with some of your stances. I'll try my best. Who knows? Studying some other opinion might change my mind. Finally reaching these kids. Finally reaching what? Is this like a movie for you? Yeah, oh we're not black or Mexican or anything. You don't need to feel good about helping us. The Back to work. Jesus Christ. <sighs> Today was hard, but still rewarding. What was? My day working at the deli? Jesus Christ, you guys oh, are obsessed with I wasn't color. asking, but all right. You don't want to hear what happened? 
I think I'm good. Nicole, just because you're so based. doesn't mean you can take me for granted. Oh my god. I was taking you for granted. Then talk with me like you would with anyone else. This is how I talk with anyone else. Somebody says boring shit and I let him know I'm not interested. You know, it's not surprising why you only have one friend at school. I have more than one friend. Oh yeah? Who? Emily. Who the fuck is Emily? Girl that goes to my school. Who She's pretty fuck? cool and way more fucked up on drugs than I am. Really no. And you're not making this up, right? Mom, I'm not gonna make up a person to look less <clears> lonely. <throat> Am I some guy on AOL with a model girlfriend? Oh my All god. Right. Okay. What's her last name then? I don't know. I knew it. Mom, I'm not a cop who just asks for people's full names. Well, if she's real, why don't you invite her over? You wanna meet her? I'd love to. Cool. Because she's coming over in five minutes. What? You said you want to meet her. How could you invite someone over? This place <laughs> is a mess. Well, she's a mess too. It's a perfect match. It's oh a my perfect God. match. Every little comment will just come back to haunt me. Tell her she can't come. <laughs> too late. I'm still in my work apron. Hey. Yeah, hey. Let's head to my room. Nicole, you're not going to introduce us? Mom, do not fucking do this right now. What? Huh? I can't even know her name. Emily? Hello, Emily. It's nice to meet you. You are such a fucking bitch. Nicole, don't <laughs> call me a bitch in front of your friends. I'm sure Emily doesn't call her mother a bitch. You can You like that. <laughs> Excuse me? Okay, Mom, Jeffrey is all of us now. in high school. Well, hold on. I'd like to know some more about your friend. Emily, what do your parents do? Uh, my mom is like a nurse or something. A nurse practitioner? Yeah, I think so. Oh, and how about <laughs> your father? He's a boardroom person for a nonprofit. It's called United Police Fund. Oh, I see them collecting <laughs> donations mark. at the mall sometimes. That's really interesting. Yeah, okay, so let's go. Before you leave, I just wanted to say it's very nice to meet a friend of Nicole's with such an impressive background. You didn't even ask about her. I'd love to, but I need to take care of some things. I'll oh see my you later. God. <laughs> you never mom. told me you were rich. Is that rich for real? God, now I look like an even trashier bitch. So are we going to your room? I kind of just want you to go home now. <laughs> Are you going to see Nick and Nora? Wait, see who? It's the new, like, romance movie with the guy from Superbad. They put McLovin in a romance movie? <laughs> no, the other one. Who would watch a romance with that fat piece of shit? No, the other, other one. Oh, wait. Yeah, no, I saw the preview for that. Oh yeah. my god. So are you gonna see it? No. Why would they make a romance starring ugly people? It's like different and free spirited. Are we talking about me? No. Nick <laughs> and Nora. What are you doing here? Nothing right now. You got any good shit on you? Jacka said you're in <laughs> remedial classes. Yeah, what of it? Don't you have a different lunch from the rest of us? Are you skipping remedial? Why are they all you in your swimming pool? What the hell? Come on, Jekka, let's go. You can go. No, I meant go with me. Why the fuck would I go with you? Bye. I thought we Bye. were friends. <laughs> I only sit with you so I don't sit at lunch alone like the weird kids. Damn, shit hurts. Fuck <laughs> you guys. Whores. Dude, how have you handled a week of Kelly? No, she's pretty entertaining. Entertaining like Britney Spears in 1999 or like Britney Spears now? Oh, Britney Spears now for sure. All of our stories start with her and a guy who graduated three years ago. Oh my god. The end. Last weekend, she told me she went down on a guy during High School Musical 3. Is that the one in theaters right now? Yeah. That movie's for children. Why would she do it there? I don't know, but there was a baby crying two rows down while she did it. Was it Kelly's? Not yet. So why are you here? I need a little help with a paper. Since <coughs> when the fuck do you care about Since when a paper? the fuck? Since I got an idea to fuck over a teacher with it. Miss Ames wants us to do a paper on modern poetry and hates rap music. So... You think she's racist? I don't follow. Oh I God. know she's racist, and I want to write something where she shows her whole ass over it. Nicole, if you write about rap music being good, <laughs> you're just going to get an F, which won't prove shit because all your other papers get Fs. No, 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 no. I'm going <laughs> to write a paper yeah. that agrees with her. And if she agrees with it back, it's going to get her fired. Yeah, but you're going to write the racist paper she agrees with. I'm a kid. What do I know? Then how could I possibly help you with this? Do you want to ask my dad about Katrina refugees? Well, no, so you read books and shit. Is there, like, a really racist book I could just plagiarize? Oh, my God. Uh, I have the English version of Mein Kampf if you want to borrow it. Why do you have the Hitler book in your backpack? Have you gotten to any endings so far? Just history. asking. So, yeah. Bitch, you pop pills and fuck on the first date. Yeah, Why we have three, three endings. Because maybe I want to fuck on the third date one day. Literally for who? 
Brian Sheckler, Free obviously. Free slept, I think it was. He's not going to marry some dumb blonde hoe, I know that. Rep. But a smart but rep blonde hoe, that's where the element is. poetry. It literally stands for rhythm and poetry. Not according languages. to this so teacher. I'll be set to impress when I see him at the Not according to Miss Ames. <laughs> uh, giving head is an third language. It is if you're good at it. Take the book. <laughs> Reading Mein Kampf alone at the diner. <laughs> Let's see guys turn this into a conversation starter. Hence, today I believe that I am acting in accordance with the will of the Almighty Creator by defending myself against the Jew. Okay, let's cross out Jew and replace that with rappers. <clears throat> what else? The ignorance of the broad masses about the inner nature of the Jew. Hip hop artists, if you could even. Call them that. Mm. This paper's gonna be so I'm not a huge. Nicole, I'm not a huge fan of rap. You were in AP history. I think huh? the only no, person I like history. is uh, this is gonna be base, but like comp? I think the only one I like is Eminem. I'm racist now. Oh, all right. <laughs> Ari. Ari's cool about anything. Oh, hey, hey, what's up? What the Ugh. fuck do you want? What the what? fuck is he no, doing here? Nothing. Just saw you reading and was like, wow, she looks real smart like that. Is this like a usual thing for you? Reading in public? Sure. Yeah, yeah. So what you reading there? <laughs> yeah, Mine yeah. Pump. Oh, yeah, I've heard of that. It's supposed to be really interesting, right? Uh-huh. What do you think about it? Like, I need... Specifically? My feet are so cold. I think Hold it on. I has, uh, <laughs> like, really good themes and a story. Oh, my God. Are you a fan of the message in Mein Kampf? Yeah, you can this say guy What's fucking, your favorite like, part? What's yours? Oh, uh... Like, go away, like bro. the middle. Did you read it in English or German? Was it in German <laughs> first or something? Yeah, sucked. it's the only German book America cares about. Oh, that means it's super good. Know that. I, I should recommend it to a friend, right? Right. Right. <laughs> so can I sit with you? Mein Kampf is the Nazi book. Oh, cool. I didn't know that. So can I sit with you? So can I sit Why with you? Why do they block MySpace on the Wi-Fi? Because you're not supposed to be on it, duh. How the fuck is there a narc in remedial class? Yeah, no. all I want to do is see what this bitch is saying about her infected snake bites. To be emo and unclean. Tragic. All right, settle down. <coughs> your papers were all interesting, to say the least. Yeah, because they're good as shit, right? Kyler, F. <laughs> F? I, I turn it in and everything. <laughs> Three paragraphs about how gay poetry is doesn't make for a comprehensive think piece. I'll give you the stink <laughs> piece, motherfucker. How do you fail oh. a paper in remedial English? I didn't know we weren't allowed to tell the truth. You're dumber than the bitches on Next. Yeah, an MTV <laughs> reality show hoes are really fucking dumb. Emily, D. Are you even supposed to call our grades out like this? Just so the class knows the bar they're setting. D oh and remedial, God. you're gonna end up on next. And Nicole. Uh-huh. A. A? <gasps> a as in A or the loud at, or like the letter? Almost A plus, if anything. I was happily surprised with the gripping prose you provided on rap music. So like the letter? Really? You thought it was that good? It was excellent. The best paper I've ever received teaching <coughs> these classes. The persuasive wording direness of tone as if you were a poetic politician wise beyond your years oh, Jesus as Christ. if right literally got an a were you white <laughs> i've earned the title it's actually perfect timing because next week your principal is bringing a few members of the school board to demonstrate why this program is still worth funding <laughs> With this paper, I think it'll be obvious remedial programs oh, can still reach troubled students. <laughs> this is going to be so bad. Gonna, like, read the paper aloud? Of course. An amateur written work like this deserves an audience. If it's okay with you, Nicole. Um, yeah, definitely. I think that is an amazing idea. Great. And I trust you'll all be here this Friday? Let's hope. Oh, anyway, for today's lesson, slang. The death of the English language. <laughs> what the fuck is with this teacher? Why would they pick the cafeteria for this? It's freezing. Yeah, how many people could possibly be on the school board? What's the school board do anyway? Stupid shit, like <laughs> making the lunch healthy and covering up sex scandals. No, At least God. with the scandals, someone enjoys themselves. When they fuck the chicken nuggets up, everyone suffers. I wish you were in Hello. California where the schools have food courts. Yeah, how do you, how do, how do, how do we? Yeah. Jesus. How, Wait, what? how do we do the lead? That's what I ago. fucking wanted to say, early? Jesus Christ. No? Wait, what the fuck? Did you actually see my mom here? I'm pretty sure. <laughs> mom. She was with a bunch of people, too. What is wrong with her? Why? Uh, are you sure you're not just hallucinating off those meds? No, Seroquel doesn't make you hallucinate. Oh. During the day. During I'm gonna kill myself. Nicole! No, mom, get the fuck out of here right now! 
What? I can't see my daughter when we get called out to her school. Called by who? Your principal called us at Rossler's Kosher Deli to cater your little remedial presentation. I was so proud to hear a paper you Jesus did Christ. would be the main event. I've been excited to hear this all week. You what knew about this for a week and didn't tell me? I thought it'd be a fun surprise. Why would they care this? So Why would they care this? So I could blackmail you to call in sick, you just want to swoop oh. in and socially ruin me. Oh, you're so dramatic. I'm sure Emily wouldn't mind if her mother was here. I would actually choke her. Right this <laughs> way, here's our star student. Looks like my boss needs me to set up. Good luck, sweetie. School board members, if you could just line around over there for our presentation. Why did yes. she push them? Before we get to the catering, we wanted to present just one of the. Do we not get to see the school board? Program. What do they right. look like? And as I've come to understand, the remedial are classes we just talking are up to air? renewal at the end of this school year. A lot of talk has gone around asking, what's the point of helping these troublemaker students? And after hearing this paper, we think you'll see the progress <laughs> that can still be made here, Nicole. Would you like to read your paper to the board? That is okay. Well, I'd love to read that it for you. That is okay. Go ahead. Right. So this is Nicole's paper I'll be reading for all of you. When Nicole first came to us, she had a 1.1 GPA, several truancy violations, and even more in-school suspensions. Oh, Jesus. I'm all too familiar. <laughs> Look at all these sexless marriages. <laughs> at first, she didn't want anything to do with language arts. But after we exposed her to the right literature again and again, she was inspired to write this incredibly biting piece this is on go contemporary so bad. music I can and see poetry. It. This not take I foresee I it. <clears throat> As a teen, I've come to be disappointed with the ignorance of the broad masses about the inner nature of rappers. The lack of instinct and narrow-mindedness of our upper classes make the people an easy victim for hip-hop's campaign of lies. Little Wayne's domination in the state seems so assured that now not only can he call himself a rapper, but he ruthlessly admits his ultimate national and political designs. Huh. A section of his genre owns itself to be a foreign people. Yet even here, they lie. <clears throat> For a while, the Zionists tried to make the rest of the world believe that... What is this again? Uh-oh. Catering, please don't interrupt. Uh-oh. The Zionists tried to make the rest of the world believe that the national consciousness of the rapper finds its satisfaction <laughs> Look at them back in the away. <laughs> of MTV. The rappers, again, slyly dupe the dumb people. Politics are weird. Oh. Like, really fucking weird. Like, everyone doubles down till they're eventually Hitler weird. Honestly, uh -oh. I just thought the school board would get her fired or something. Did not plan on the owner of a kosher deli listening in on it and calling the ADL afterward. Oh, Thanks Jesus. for the heads up, Mom. Everyone involved had to go to court. Everyone. I took the stand like, I'm a kid, what do I know? And that didn't work so well. Oh, no. What worked better was calling the McDonald's hash browns latkes and saying uncircumcised men are disgusting, because they are. But then I was in the clear, and they went through all of Miss Ames' past, and this bitch was fucked up. In college, her thesis paper was about how interracial relationships were misogynistic against white women. What you the can't fuck? make this shit up. The school itself was a problem, too, because every guy watches South Park, and Jews been like the number one insult for the last 10 years. So now Principal Lynn has a mountain of paperwork. Miss Ames is losing her teaching license and me, I've never been more satisfied. Oh my God, she's so evil. Girl. Ah, a new message. Uh, special offer. Hey, if you're receiving this text, it means you were selected for the blah, 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 deli. Oh, it's the deli. Chance to win your very own free catering at any event you would like. Events excluded from this offer are schools. Political rallies. <laughs> oh my god. Jesus. Book club discussions. Oh my god. Okay, so we have two endings left, right? I think. I think it's two endings because they said we had three before so this would mean we have two from what I'm gathering oops I clicked up by mistake
Um, show. We did that already. Uh, I guess it's a uh, it's like a nonprofit. A nonprofit what? A nonprofit charity. A nonprofit charity for what? A cause. You wanted it for a cause, right? What is <laughs> a cause? A healthy cause, so people are healthy. And how do they make them healthy? Medicine. So pharmaceuticals. What's the name of this pharmaceutical nonprofit? Ooh, gotta get back to you on that one. You signed up for a charity and don't even know the name of it? <laughs> it was kind of long. I don't have it in front of me. But it was <laughs> definitely a charity and definitely for medication to the underprivileged. underprivileged. Where is it? Bitch, no one asked you. I was asking. You're aware you'll need to fill out a form with the location of this charity, right? Just so we know it's not made up. Yeah, totally. I'll get all that for you next class. It was due today. Oh my god. Well, I don't know what to tell you. Is the charity going to disappear because I didn't get it in on time? If you're fine with your grade taking a 10% hit, then be my guest. My policy on all late work. Oh, my so you God. You need to stop watching C-SPAN. How <laughs> did you know what I watch at lunch? You just seem like a rules fan. I hope everyone here is a rules fan. This is civics. If oh my rules God. did anything, wouldn't rape and murder stop happening? It stops most of it. Okay, let's tell all the rape and murder victims that. I'm sure it'll make them feel better. Get your charity in next class and hope I don't fail you for the year. God <laughs> failed you for your entire life. <laughs> Oh so my then my God. mom's like, he's too old to date you. And I just ask, are you going to buy me alcohol at one in the morning? Exactly. Like, I thought you were supposed to look out for me, Mom. If you don't give me what I want, I'll find someone who will. Jesus. Dude, totally. We turned 15, and they're entirely clueless to our needs. And getting locked in this bitch eight hours a day means I need the edge off. Is everyone's mom a bitch, or is it just us? <laughs> uh, Jekka hates her mom, so I guess everyone. Where is Jekka? Probably doing something dumb as shit, like school. Like school. Good. Hey, oh why do you always come up to us at lunch? Will you shut the fuck up and let me talk? What the then? fuck? No, no, all right. I just wanted to know if you knew people setting up the county's worship festival next weekend. County's worship festival? Is that like Jesus and shit? Do we look like the type of girls who would go to church? No, it's not like super religious. It's just like a county fair. So what do you want to know? Okay, there's this really hot girl on the organizing committee, and I need to get on it. So if you know any religious people, just what tell the them fuck? I want to join. Do we look like the type of girls who know girls who go to church? Who's the girl? I can't tell you that. You might try to ruin it. All of this sounds like an excuse to come up and talk to us. Yeah, are you lonely? What? No. All right, whores. Fuck you then. I think he was lonely. Like, we would even know people who set up church functions. I barely know people at this school in general anymore. Did your friends transfer? No. I always hook <laughs> up with my friends' boyfriends, so they don't want to talk anymore. Oh, that's why we get along. You have a cheating thing, too? Uh, what the fuck? No, I've just never liked a guy enough to the point of calling him my boyfriend. Good to know you're into that. I'm like a charity for guys sick of their girlfriends. Charity? Fuck, I still have to do that. Do what? I made up a fake pharmaceutical charity for civics, and now I gotta either find a real one or just make up better lies for the fake one. Oh my god. Both sound like a lot of effort. No kidding. Or you could start your own charity, then you're not lying. That sounds like more work than both options put together. Fuck no. You think people actually work at those charity things? They just vacate in Florida and write it off as a conference. How would you know? My fucking piece of shit dad who I want to kill works for a charity <laughs> business. <laughs> Is oh there, my god. Oh, explore that one. No, but that's actually a good idea. Yeah. Oh, and did you hear about Braxton? He tried selling a brick in school. What no, I had fuck? no idea. To who? Probably to, to who? the Coke problem, because I don't know any kid who could afford that. <gasps> even hey, if it isn't my favorite gym students. We never dressed out when we did it. How are we your favorite students? Oh, I know what you're doing. You want to stay looking nice for your favorite gym teacher. Why would we care about that? Ew. I hear how you girls talk about older men, and quite frankly, I support it. You want to say that in front of the principal? Yeah, and it's older men, not ancient men. <laughs> yeah, we'll see about that when you're looking for an expensive good time. Oh my god. <laughs> how many times this month has he tried asking us out? Three. But yeah, where would Braxton even get a brick of coke? <clears throat> I think his friend's cousin's in MS-13. Oh, shit. What's wrong? Nothing. It's probably no big deal. Everyone's a little dry from PG County. You going to class? Nah, I'm going Why home. Why did she yell? It's 11.30. Been here long enough. <laughs> okay, so I need a charity, a way to ditch this badass brick, and money in general. Let's see. A 
can't just sell the coke, because then they'll go looking for me. Can't never kill two birds with one stone. God, this shit feels oh so God. good on my gums, too. I try it for real, but I don't know if it'd mix well with my mom's Vicodin. How is this a prescription, then? It feels as good as the street drug. I got it. Where's my laptop? How would I word this? How to rephase. What? Oh, we have to. Oh, okay. We have to actually Google it. Damn. Now I'm told if you didn't get your community service causes in last time, you better have them today. Oh. Fuck! Excuse me. <laughs> hey, oh, uh, where's Mr. Katz? Today I'm billing in for Mr. Katz as he had a <laughs> medical issue he needed to take care of. So I had another two days to think of a charity. God damn it. You think because I'm subbing today, I won't enforce your teacher's deadlines? Don't forget, I'm your principal. Oh my. And speaking oh my. <laughs> of deadlines, Mr. Katz took extra care to remind me of your assignment in particular, Nicole. It's your last day to submit or you failed this class for the year. So what do you have for me? Uh, I have my charity. Uh, have what my charity. charity. Might that be? I was told it had to do with pharmaceuticals, so let's not stray too far from any prior narrative. Yeah, whatever. The name of my charity is Medicine Rocks. Medicine Rocks? Yeah, okay. it's a charity that helps get prescription drugs to the underprivileged in PG County. Why haven't I heard of this charity? I don't know, PG County's far? Not that far. Well, they're really underfunded, so they can't get the word out. Wanted to volunteer for something that could actually use some help. What's that supposed <laughs> to mean? Do <laughs> you know what the fuck it means? <laughs> girls, girls! <laughs> I'll have to look them up sometime then. They'd have a website, wouldn't they? No, they don't really have anything on the internet because they're underfunded and underprivileged. Not everyone has the technology us well-funded whites do, Miss Lynn. Oh my what do you God. mean by that? If you Google them, you're racist. <gasps> she got you there. Hush! Well, I <laughs> have to say I'm pleasantly surprised with you, Nicole. Here's your hour sheet. You'll need 25 hours in the next six weeks with signatures. Yeah, okay. We operate under the honor system. <laughs> But don't think I won't keep my eye on you. That's Going not creepy. Wet. What was that? Nothing. Hey, let's see you fail one of these other losers. Anyone else have a charity for me? <laughs> Dude, I've been looking everywhere for you. Since when do you take elective gym? It's the easiest class ever. You just be skinny and get an A. And get sexually harassed by the gym coach. No, he doesn't do that for the seniors. He thinks we're old enough to tell our parents or something. Ew, I wouldn't tell my parents at any age. Yeah, Jesus that's like Christ. way too embarrassing. Imagine telling your mom a 50-year-old man wants to eat a Lunchable out of your cleavage. Exactly. <laughs> parents and sex are two entirely different worlds. Unless you're in Arkansas. The only way I tell is for a pity dinner at Red Lobster. Oh my High God. bar. So what do you want? Oh yeah, I have a project I need help with. Nicole, that MySpace girl isn't even fun to bully anymore. No, not that. Jesus Another Christ. project. Project what for fuck? what? For school. Since when the fuck do you do any project for school? Since I got a really awesome idea for it, but I need you to bring some stuff over to my house. <sighs> okay, what is it? I need baking soda, a Zippo lighter, <laughs> some really tiny Ziplocs, and one of your parents' serving spoons. Are you in chemistry now? No, civics. Where the hell am I gonna get really tiny Ziplocs? Oh Is your mom in a jewelry? She would have those lying around. Okay, so Ziplocs, serving spoon, lighter, what else? Baking soda, a whole box of it. Baking soda. Okay, I'll see you after school. Thanks, I'll explain later. Oh my God. How long is it gonna take to find this shit? <laughs> Hey, sweet cheeks. What the fuck? You got a minute? Miss Lynn said you're not allowed in the girls' locker room. She don't need to know. Hey, quick question for you. What? Are you familiar with Lunchables chicken shakeups? Oh my god. Thanks for coming. I know it was super short notice. Yeah, so what do you need all this shit for? Okay, don't freak out. You found it? Was this yours or something? No, there's a rumor going around that some gang kid lost a huge thing of coke at our school. That Braxton kid just ditched it in front of me while running from school security. And you didn't think, oh, that's a lot of illegal drugs, maybe more trouble than they're worth. <laughs> Since when are we afraid of the law? I'm not talking about the law. I'm talking about MS-13's name on the side of the fucking bag. They're gonna kill you if they find out. How do you know who MS-13 is? One of my friend's cousins was in MS-13. I guess everyone's friend's cousin's in MS-13. Now, and no way it's MS-13. Why would a gang put their name on their drugs? What if it was supposed to be delivered to them? What shitty-ass drug dealer would keep their customers' names in writing? <coughs> a really fucking stupid one? Isn't stupid enough to bring this to a public school? All right, don't worry about it. They won't even know we had it when we're finished. Oh finished my God. with what? You brought the supplies, right? Yeah, for... You brought me here to cook crack? Yeah, what else is baking soda for? Jesus I don't know, Christ. baking? Dude, why are you I don't freaking know, baking. out? You've had drugs before. Yeah, 
Perks and robo, not go to jail drugs. Okay, just let me borrow your stuff. I need the community service hours. What does making crack do for the community? Nothing. Selling crack's another story. We live in cul-de-sacs. Who's gonna buy this? I'm not selling it here. Oh my god, this is gonna ruin my parents' serving spoon. Just buy another one. It's from Tiffany. Why would you bring a Tiffany serving spoon to make crack? You never told me what it was for. <laughs> Look, calm down. This will take like an hour at most. It's turned into Breaking Bad now. It really has. This is Breaking Bad now. Holy I think we're getting the hang of this. We filled so many baggies. But how do oh we know if it's god. good? The guy on the internet said if you break one of the little shards, it should give a really nice snap. That was bad. Try another one. Oh, it worked. So it's good enough. God, my gums are so numb from rubbing this shit. It's good, right? Oh my god, yeah. I want to try coke oh for god, real, but yeah. I feel like I'd kill someone on it. Oh. I just don't want to OD, but good to know your potential. Sorry, the whole room smells like burnt plastic, so I think we made enough today. My parents are going to be so mad when they see this spoon. Just leave it here. It's better lost than ruined. That's true. Okay, I gotta go to PG County now. Can you give me a ride? I'm not driving to PG County, Nicole. What if my car gets stolen? Oh, my oh, God. so you'll freebase crack but won't drive through a black neighborhood? What are you, Ronald Reagan? I helped you with your community service project. You won't guilt me into anything. Okay, just drive me to the Franconia station. I'll take the metro. Fine, but I'm not driving you back. Oh, my no God. No problem. I'll have plenty for a cab when I'm done. Jesus Should have looked up how to actually sell drugs before I came out here. Hey, what's up? Hey, what you got? You wanna buy some crack? Twelve! Twelve. Damn, we did sound like a cop, huh? Hey, Mo. What you need? What you got? I got rocks, bricks, white Legos. Uh, uh, how much? Hundred for the baggie. Uh, uh, here you go. Thanks. Oh, one more thing. What? Could you sign my community service hour <laughs> sheet? I'll give you an extra rock. Uh, yeah, okay. Yeah, just any fake name, it's fine. I P. Oh my god. A hundred bucks and a two hour signature. I think this is gonna work out. Cool. <laughs> Jesus Now Christ. that I've called roll, I just wanted to apologize for my absence. I know you've all been working very hard on your community service assignment. Has everything been okay? Not to get too far into detail, but I've been having some personal health issues arise and have needed time away from my teaching duties. Oh, my oh God. well, we hope you're all right. I don't give a shit. Either. I don't give a oh, shit. Oh, attendance over? Sorry. So nice of you to join us. Late as always. Fuck you. You've been gone the last three classes. <laughs> he had a medical issue. Yeah, I do too. It's called liking post-rock. No one rolls out the red carpet for me. Oh Just my God. have a seat, Nicole. You can have this dick, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, why are you freaking out? All right, Nicole. You act like you own the place, so I assume you're a top of the class in community hours? I might be. Pull out your sheet then. Let's see what our star student has for us. Yeah, sure. Here you go. Of course. As I expected, you... Wait. How many is this? I don't know. I lost count. 16. Oh, my God. 22 hours? Wow. I only have three. All the signatures are different. Different ink used every time. It's only been a week and a half, and you're 90% done. Oh, Jesus I'm kind of awesome like that. I'm shockingly surprised, Nicole. Good to see you really took the initiative for getting these hours. And aside from just the hours, I'm really building a reputation in the community. Anytime someone's in need, they know who to call. Quite the turnaround indeed. All right, who else has their sheets to show? Nah. What do you mean, nah? nah. Why not? <laughs> it's gay. <laughs> Excuse me? What does helping the community have to do with one's sexuality? Uh, it has to do with it's gay. <laughs> you think that way now, but go above and beyond for this. Get 50 hours. You'll get a framed certificate from the National Honor Society. Why would anyone want that? It means you really made a difference in life. For years, you can hold on to it, show it to your grandkids one day. Oh, my God. Who would do that? Yeah, imagine you're 80 and you haven't accomplished anything beyond a community service hour sheet. <laughs> all right, all right. <laughs> Who else has a sheet for me? Jesus Christ. Nicole, I'm busy. Well, what is it? Oh, good, so I can leave? No, why were you sent here? One of the security people said I was violating the dress code. Well, it looks like there's a gun on your sweatshirt, so yes, take it off. I, I don't really have anything under this. Then turn it inside out and get back to class. Ew, how do I turn a hoodie inside out? It's gonna be <coughs> weird and itchy. You really don't have anything on under that? Like a sport bra? Well, we can't just have you in that. 
Are you sure? I think your gym teacher would love it. Please, Nicole, oh my God. I'm dealing with enough as it is right now. What's the big deal over a drawing of a gun on my hoodie? Have you already forgotten Virginia Tech? Oh, so some Asian guy shoots up a school and now we can't wear cool hoodies anymore? Jesus it could Christ. promote the wrong message. Who's gonna think I would shoot up a school? He was only a mass shooter because <laughs> he's weird and ugly. I'm kind of the opposite of that. All right, fine. Wear it for the rest of the day, but don't bring it to school again. Whatever. Oh, oh, one more thing. I almost forgot. What? I've been told of your quick turnaround in civics. Congratulations on your hours. Oh, yeah, don't mention it. A night and day difference in no time at all, really. Where'd you find the motivation for it? Uh, I don't know. The community, I guess. The community. You love the people that much now? Oh, my God. Yeah. She's going to get her ass. I say that? What are you, my dom? My Is there something you'd like to tell me, Nicole? Can I tell you to fuck off? You're free to go. I'll be watching. Yeah, right. That's not creepy at all. <laughs> oh, hey, Nicole. What's up? What's good? Yeah. Cool. Yeah. So, <laughs> I, I just wanted to ask if you were busy this weekend. Fucking why? I got to do a video for a class project and was kind of wondering if you could be in it. Why can't you ask the other 30 people who take the class with you? Yeah, oh my God. Yeah, um, it's like, I don't know. I feel like they're going to flake on me. And a girl who doesn't take the class, doesn't even like you, she's gonna come through. What, you don't like me? I oh. hate you. <laughs> Dude, like, quit like, you're always kidding around and stuff. You're crazy though, it's cool. I'm not laughing. No girl randomly recruited for your class video will ever want to fuck you. Whoa, whoa, quit <laughs> jumping around and shit. <laughs> What's the end game then? You're gonna awkwardly go up to a girl just to be friends? Well, I mean, friends kind of have a lot of definitions to it. Is there a definition where you blow your brains out with a shotgun while I sit and watch? <laughs> what the fuck? Why would you do that? What else are friends for? So, are, are you waiting for somebody? Oh yeah, my God. she wouldn't want to fuck you either. Bro, you're acting wild. How can you even say something like that? Hey, sorry, I got held up in math. Jekka, would you fuck Crispin? Ew, no. See, no one wants to fuck you. <laughs> you guys are just, man, you guys are wild. Fuck off and leave. <laughs> okay, fuck off and I'll leave. see you around, guys. What the fuck are you talking to him for? Dude, I don't know. I was alone and he came up to me. You know they get brave when we're alone. What was the holdup? I was flirting with my teacher. Oh my god. For business or pleasure? He's 50. What do you think? I was trying to get an A minus. Cool, yeah. I might finish with an A for the year in civics at the rate I'm going. He bought it? He doesn't have to buy anything. They're real signatures. I god, I hate him. I don't like yet. him either. Oh my god. If you just keep He's to yourself, so no neighborhood's all that dangerous. You're not keeping to yourself. You're selling crack. Yeah, and PG loves me for it, so there's no reason to kill me. Okay, we'll see. Dude, you're such a hater. You sound like bitch Lynn right now. What bitch Lynn do this time? I got called in over my babe hoodie, and then she got all on my ass over doing well in civics. Why wouldn't she be happy about that? <laughs> she thinks I'm cheating by not actually doing community service. It's like suspicious or whatever. Oh my you're God. not actually doing community service? Yeah, I am. You're selling drugs in PG County. How does that help their community? I have really good prices. Giving pregnant women two for ones on crack rocks doesn't benefit the country. Oh, what? So now pregnant women have less rights than the rest of us? No. Okay, do whatever the fuck you want. That's what I planned on. You want to come with me tonight? I'd rather date my ugly math teacher. How oh would God. you rather do that? Because if the police show up, I won't be the one getting arrested. Man, I was going to cut you in and everything. All right, then suit yourself. Uh, so you in school or? Yeah, that's what the hour sheet's for. After tonight, I'll probably be all done. Cool, cool. Yeah, I thought you got out to prison or some shit. Right? But no, I'm too white and pretty to go to jail. Hey, the fuck, bitch, you wild saying that shit. You wild, you anything. <laughs> you want me to lie? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh-huh. Well, I got packs to move, so if you could... Nah, yeah, I'll see you some other time with it. Damn, Crack's gotta be awesome if it has this many repeat customers. Oh my god. Is this a cop? Hey, if you're a cop, do you have to tell me that you're a cop? White guy playing fuck? rocks in PG? Yeah, you're definitely a cop. I'm not a cop. Wait, you sound familiar... Is that Mr. Katz? Keep your voice down. Did Miss Lynn send you to spy on me? What the no. Fuck? Just take the money and let me leave with it. Holy fuck, you weren't missing class because you're sick. You're a crackhead. I said keep it down. I mean, if you want to buy, no problem. But are you allowed to sign my hour sheet? This was your charity? <laughs> yeah, I sell shit for cheap. I'm the great white hope of PG County. I thought it was a pharmaceutical charity. Medicine rocks? Yeah, as in crack rocks, duh. That's downright evil. Wait till I tell the school board you're cheating on your hours. Wait till I tell the school board you're buying ready rock off one of your students. Fine. 
We'll both keep our mouths shut. Now give me the stuff. Oh my Done God. deal. Here you go. Freeze! Huh? Oh shit. A little midnight marketplace here? How'd you let the cops tell you? Actually, sweetheart, the cops tailed you. We got a tip from a school principal across the Potomac. Shit! We got a runner! What the fuck? <laughs> oh my God. Uh, now we got to call in a body bag. Did you just kill my civics teacher? It was a calculated risk, but it paid off. Dude, just shoot me too. I can't fucking handle this shit. Nonsense. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say. Can oh and my God. What the fuck? You waited two weeks to visit me. Okay, if you're gonna be a bitch about it, I can go now. No, I'm so bored in here. Don't go. That's I'm so thought. bored. So how's Dale? I've been trying to kill myself every day for the last two weeks, but there's like, like no options. That. It's not the loony bit, and there's no options at all. Oh my god, there's no sleeping pills, no sharp objects, the sheets rip easily, and the guards walk by every hour so you can't even bleed out with the razor blades. Wait, how long are you even serving? The public defender was like three years of good behavior. You're trying to kill yourself over three years? I only came here because I thought you'd be in for 20. Two weeks in here feels like 20. There's only one TV in the whole block, and all it plays is UPN reruns. And that's not even around anymore. Oh my yeah, god. Yeah, so I'm going insane. They lock you in here to turn your brain into mush. Fucking every night you try going to bed, you just hear weird echoey moans in the distance. Why are they moaning? I don't know. You can't moaning? tell whether they're having sex or oh withdrawing from heroin. Wow, sounds kind of like torture. But I guess that's how the system works to make you not sell crack anymore. It's a broken ass system. Jesus they just assume we hustle for fun. Well, yeah, I mean, aren't there other things you can do besides selling drugs? Not for us. You're born into bullshit, no tools to get out of it, and they still want to act like it's your fault. They want to act like you want to be in jail, like you didn't know the consequence. No shit I knew, but it's either suffer out there or suffer in here. And when you get out, it's even more bullshit. P.O., ankle monitor, drug tests, felony record. What the fuck? It's almost like you had less problems on the inside. The system's educational for everyone but the prisoner. This is a maze and we're the rats, but most days you'd rather die than get to the finish. Now all I think about is dying. I guess 50 was right. Right about what? What? Just get rich or die trying. I did what I had to. You're white. You're <laughs> white. What? You're white, Nicole. You didn't have to do anything. <laughs> That's what you think. What I know is we live in cul-de-sacs, and you don't have to sell crack when you live in a cul-de-sac. I didn't even totally mean financially. Like, my parents were mean to me and shit. It, like, makes you make bad decisions. You sold crack to a pregnant woman because your mom was mean to you? Y yeah, sort of. Oh, my so God. all you did was take your little problems and turn them into someone else's bigger problems. They weren't little to me. You better turn Islamic and pray the judge agrees with that. Can white people be Islam? I don't know. Look, <laughs> oh I gotta God. go. I'll see you next week, maybe. Oh, wait. No, no. Don't go. No, no. Don't go. I always thought I had a bad memory until I spent two years oh in jail. Oh, my God. No one has a bad memory. Some are just more distracted than others. And aside from really cool fights breaking out, there aren't a ton of distractions in jail. <clears throat> I haven't had a visitor in 16 months. You go by months when you're locked in here. And you're left with your thoughts as your only entertainment. So like a year and a bit. See, I went in rolling my eyes. Oh yeah, I'll learn. But they eventually break you down into this lame self-reflection no matter how hard you fight it. But there's no psychologists in here. No therapists in here. No nothing. So yeah, I feel like I've changed, but what if I'm getting worse? Every now and then I'm reminded what Jekka was trying to say last time she visited me. Every new infant <laughs> story kind of paints the picture. One had to feed their kids. Another was forced in a gang. Some girl had to kill her husband. Oh my god. All I wanted to do was fill out an hour sheet. So compared to everyone else, I guess it was kind of messed up in the long run. Maybe that's my lesson. Two years ago, I never would have considered I'm wrong. I really have changed. Now to just serve my time, get back in society, maybe make some new friends, and buy a gun to murder my fucking principal with. I'd shoot her in the legs first, watch her cry for mercy before oh I finish her God. off. Change Girl. feels pretty good. Girl, honey. Shut up, Windows. 
Not sure if they let you have your phone in jail, but I guess you'll see this when they let you out. Since you're an adult now, I sold all your furniture, thrifted your clothes at that the shop. Okay. You have been renting out your room on Craigslist. You can visit every now and then, but you do not have a home here. So find a job. You're on your own when you get out. <laughs> oh my god. Oh dear god. Jesus Christ. Okay, I need to run to the washroom really quick. One sec. Okay, so we have one more ending from what I'm gathering. Um, so we did those two. We did those two. We didn't do depression pity party. Fucking hit that again. So I guess we do the pity party? Honestly, I don't know. It's just we were both diagnosed with manic <coughs> depression and it's just hard to show up anywhere. Uh what she said, it just nothing makes me happy anymore. Not even cocaine. I haven't tried it, I'm just assuming. Oh manic depression? Hmm, I'm not sure we've had that as an excuse before. But it's totally real. C come on, isn't it Mental Health Awareness Month? That's in May. Yeah, it's May. It's September. <laughs> See? <laughs> We're so messed up, we don't even know what month it is. Oh my besides, god. Besides, Winnie Houston said we need a whole year. Winnie that was Houston? the Black History Month. Uh, no, oh it was god. for mental health awareness, right? Yeah, maybe. I just don't know anything anymore. I'm not sad. I just don't feel feelings or care about anything. She's headed into a downward spiral. Oh my god, same. I just want to date a guy in his 30s and kill myself. Oh, that's good. Yeah, and I'm oh, that's so good. numb to hearing that because of my manic depression. All right, fine. I'll excuse it this time. But I expect you girls to seek help if this really is so much of an issue for you. Oh, thank you, Miss Lynn. You made my day just a little bit better. I have no emotions either way, cause depression, remember? No, yeah, that's God. right. You didn't do shit, Miss Lynn. All right, I think instead of class, you should head over to your counselor for additional resources on your situation. Hey, uh, Principal Lynn, you, you got a minute? Oh Hold my on, God. Girls. Trody, I thought you dropped out. Well, yeah, I did, but I think I want to re-enroll. Oh well, my that's God. great to hear, Trody. Why the sudden change of plans? I think it'd just make going to college a little easier. Also, I got fired from Hot Topic. They said I let someone steal a shirt. So dumb. Oh, shit. Hey, what are you guys doing here? I thought you were skipping today. What? Why do you say that? Oh, you mall, bitch. Like, two hours ago. Oh, they said they were suffering from manic depression. Could you step outside for a bit? Oh. Yeah, no problem. I meant Trody. Oh, my God. Dropouts, am I right? Yeah, who can trust what they say? Manic depression, huh? Suicidal thoughts and all? Oh my god. I mean, I really want to die right now, so we're not all the way lying. No. Is it all worth it? Worth it for a t-shirt at the mall? You must be so depressed. We stole an MSI shirt from Hot Topic. What about that doesn't scream depression? Oh my god. Dude, can we just go to an easier book? This is the easier book. Is everyone in the Reading Buddies program this stupid? Hey, what the fuck? The principal sent you here to help me, so make good or I'm snitching hard. Okay, fine. All right, try this first page. Sound it out. Uh, w uh, um, one, fis her, two, fis her. Are you serious? You picked a hard one on purpose. Oh it's my a Dr. god. Dr. Seuss book, you fucking dipshit. Oh yeah, sure. If it's so easy, why don't you try it, huh? 
One fish, two fish, red fish, you bitch. Huh, wait, you that bitch. last part is <laughs> blue fish. See, I knew you couldn't do it. This is a really potent punishment. Fuck no, I want to drop out. Suitor's hiring. <laughs> Suitor's hiring. Here oh, we God. go again. What? School. It's senior year. You're not used to this by now. Are oh you? My God. I'm not either, but you sound like a sitcom. Here we go again. Who invited this bitch? Shut up, Nicole. This is the girl with the Adderall. Emily? Emily, where the hell did you get so much Adderall? My boyfriend's 25. I can get whatever I want. Jesus Christ. Kind of awesome. So what, a seven, eight-year age gap? That's pretty cool. That should work out. Yeah, so have you guys heard they're going to start giving out free syringes at South County? South County High School? Uh-huh. Before, they were trying to curb the opioid addiction. What the but fuck? now they're just trying to keep all the kids from getting hep C or whatever. Are they giving free heroin, too, or just the needles? Yeah, just the needles. It sucks. Oh, my God. Oh, do you do that? Kinda. My boyfriend got me into it, but it's just lines. Nothing serious. Your 25-year-old boyfriend dating you in high school got you into heroin? You guys are gonna be awesome together. But if it's just what lines, what do you want the needles for? For him. <clears throat> he did it so much that, like, eventually doesn't hit as hard, you know? I think he'll be hitting plenty hard. Just give it time. Yeah, that's true. Wait, what? No, no, what? She's talking to <laughs> so can I buy Addie's at lunch today? Yeah, I'll see you there. All right, I gotta go. But yeah, she has a lot of Adderall. Oh my That's god. the opening comment after she leaves. Well, yeah, she's out there, but... Usually when I look in the mirror, all I see is a self-destructive pill-popping hoe. After <laughs> five minutes with her, I feel like Selena Gomez. <laughs> what the fuck? Like you feel Mexican? Never mind. Ow. Come on, let's hang out somewhere. I have school, Nicole. Dude, I have school, school Nicole. Everything we had to do last week, you learned no <clears throat> lessons. Lessons are for fat bitches who think Pilates will make their husband want to have sex again. You always find, like the meanest way to say something <laughs> so you're just leaving me don't be a baby i'll probably see you at lunch where are you going anyway no so it's not this one <sighs> damn it what one is it so it's not that one maybe this one Bitch, you oh, i hit the wrong you. one fuck let me try that again Oh, good to you. Actually, Josh. That's gonna there suck go. ass. Yeah. I'm sensing some negativity over here, girls. It's negative to think your class is a waste of time. That's not negative, it's just accurate. Yeah, like you're gonna accurate. fail us if we're bad at drawing. I'll fail you if you're bad at giving effort. So there's no tangible achievement in this class. That's fucking stupid. Watch the language. <laughs> Watch the office. The office? Watch the office? <laughs> yeah, it's for people who aren't funny. You'll love it. Oh my god. I like the office too. <laughs> so yeah, why do we have to draw and paint? It's our last year of high school. You're never too old for creativity. We don't know what we're doing. We're just finger painting with brushes. Well, if you put the effort in, maybe you'll learn what you're doing. Or maybe I'll have to fail you for the year. No, I'll do it. It's just dumb as shit. Next terrorist attack better be in art school. <laughs> yes, and Nicole... Can I trust you'll participate? Can I trust the housing market? Your friend's doing it. Why not join her? Because she wants to go to college and shit. I just want to hang out and get fucked up. Oh my god. So Respect. you won't be participating? Nope. Then maybe you could serve as my teaching assistant for the year. And what's that entail? Cleaning oh my brushes, god. organizing supplies, and posting to our MySpace pages. Why my you space. put on MySpace? <laughs> Online networking is the future. Uh, what if one of you kids went viral and spun a career out of it? Oh my god. Have you heard of Owl Town? You mean Owl City? Either way, in the <laughs> arts, we oh, I embrace the future. Owl City. And MySpace is oh, that future. Nostalgia. Welcome aboard, Nicole. Oh my god. Is that excitement I hear? Fine, I'll do your little baby drawing, okay? Jesus. To the best of your ability. <laughs> oh yeah, you'll see. Oh Jesus. Your hand's covered in that weird charcoal stuff. Yeah, I wash my hands for like two minutes. It doesn't come off. Damn, art sucks. I'm so glad I'm not in it. Do you like drawing or whatever? No, I was just randomly placed in it. The kids who actually wanted to be there are so annoying too. <gasps> I like taking art You class. don't know who Owl City is? No, I don't. Do you what? I gotta work on You know how to break my heart. I'll see you later, Nicole. What about YouTube me? Owl City. God, I drew for YouTube an hour, them. and then in two days, I'll have to draw for another hour. What's so bad about drawing? Jeffrey, just do the lab. Well, no, what's wrong with it? Or do you not like Mr. Lori? Uh, both. Well, I wish more people Kyler's understood him. Though. He's been through a lot this year in his home life. 
How would you know? He's a teacher. They don't tell us anything. I have lunch in his classroom because no one sits with me in the cafeteria. We talk about a bunch of stuff, like his house foreclosing and his wife cheating on him and... Wait, wait, wait. Cheated on him? With who? It was, um... I think this might have been private. I don't know if I should tell you. No, come on. I can't. Come on, Jeffrey. Don't you want to make me happy? Oh, uh, yeah. Oh, my God. Go ahead and tell me, okay? It was the UPS man. <laughs> Holy shit. Fire, fire. From Jesus, teacher fuck. teacher to mailman? He's so bad of a husband that she's fucking down. You're not going to tell anyone, are you? Jeffrey, don't you trust me? Jeffrey. Oh, okay, I trust you. Thank you. She's fucking down? Yeah, she's <laughs> pathetic, right? What if she's just really ugly? When you're ugly, all you can do is fuck down. Yeah, but she still cheated. It takes a lot for an ugly woman to cheat. Oh, oh totally. my gosh. Mr. Lori had to have been into some terrible shit. But what, though? Sup, bitches. Who invited Jesus. you? Me, motherfucker. You guys want to go to the fair with me this weekend? What the, the fuck? fair? Yeah, with, like, games and shit. Is it 1920? Why would I go to the fair? <laughs> yeah, we have internet and Xanax. Fuck the fair. What's so bad about old stuff? 1920 is a cool year. No, oh my would God. like a year where rape was legal. Rape was not legal in 1920. In practice, it was. God, shut up. There's cool shit to do there. They don't even card you. Honestly, it's your loss. Hey, whoa, what's going on? Chill with the yelling. Leave me alone, bro. Don't be a bitch. Don't Leave me alone, you. bro. What? Don't be lame right now. Why are you still here? Me? No, both of you. I was just trying to, like, he, he was kind of going at you. We're not going to fuck either of you. What the fuck? Oh, whatever then. Yeah, no. Um. <laughs> you know, I do that every week. Speaking of every week, are you still watching Real Housewives Atlanta? What the nah, fuck? I got tired of it. Is it bad now? No, just every commercial on Bravo is like, guess which celebrity's gay? We got him this time. It's annoying. For the gay channel, it's kind of homophobic. Oh my yeah, God. I only watch at midnight when they're selling Girls Gone Wild and Enzite. Do you think they pay well? Who, Bravo? No, Girls Gone Wild. <laughs> There's my artist. Oh my God. Hello, girls. Oh God. Let's keep the conversations to inside the classroom. Oh, I won't be long. I just wanted to compliment your effort today, Nicole. At first apprehensive, but then sinking your teeth into the assignment more than anyone. Good showing. Thanks, Mr. Laurie. I look forward to the final prize. Beautiful girls. Oh my god. Pictures. Right, <laughs> girls? But it's a mirror photo. I'll see you on Thursday, Nicole. What a fucking weirdo. What's his problem? <laughs> I think he's a tiny bit into you. Cool, another child predator. Oh my he god. literally said that about every guy teacher here. Well, it's literally true. You still have a dad, so they don't go for you as much. Really? Yeah, sexual father figure is like top five male fantasies, right after murder. Oh, and if they hook up with you, there's no angry dad to kick their ass over it. Oh exactly. So you could be prettier, but Makes I'm way more desirable. <laughs> I've had my fair share of guy teachers squirt with me. I just don't jump to all of them wanting sex. Oh my God. No, not all of them. Just like 90%. That high? Yeah, I'm pretty sure like 90% of men have the urge to sexually murder teenage girls. Anyone who opposes that is probably like some ugly white guy who gets mad at video games. Is that a thing? Is that a thing? The American dad house. I wonder if Jamie Lynn had that baby yet. Excuse me, Nicole? First week of school and your friends are already pregnant. Uh, no, Mom. Jamie Lynn Spears? I don't care who her parents are. I don't want you hanging around girls who make bad decisions. Oh, my I'll God. For that. This is a new year, and I want you to start it off right. As if I did last year wrong? Oh, let me count the ways. Far too many for a number. <sighs> yeah, right. Name one incident. Oh the time God. you dated your gym teacher? What I needed fuck? money. That doesn't count. Then how about when you caused a boy to get locked in the psych ward? It's not my fault I'm beautiful, Mom. I didn't know it was common for beautiful girls to ask for a gallon of their partner's blood. What if the they're fuck? beautiful and hot, absolutely. Okay, then explain the time you set a Palmia flag on fire in the cafeteria. It was funny. Honestly, answer that for all of them. It's excuse what after the excuse. You're driving me crazy with your bullshit, Nicole! I just got the Don't fuck yell. Can we do this later? Another excuse! Get your shit together and we won't have this problem! What shit? I'm fine. Stop lying. Quit shoplifting. Don't talk back to your teachers and fix your fucking drug problem. What <laughs> drug problem? What are you talking about? Stay out of my medicine cabinet, Nicole. Mom, you are so fucking paranoid right now. Am I? 
You wouldn't mind if I looked in your backpack, would you? I would mind, but you wouldn't find shit anyway. Because you did it all at school, right? Oh what is God. this, the Salem Ho trials? You have two Salem options, trials. Nicole. Live by the rules of society or live on the goddamn street. Right now, your schoolwork is the only thing keeping you here. You wouldn't kick me out. I can do whatever I want. Except find a good husband, right? Shut your fucking mouth! Oh the my milk God. window is closing, Mom. Oh, I want to hit you so bad right now. Where's my bow? Shelf on the left. <laughs> Why do they say B when they talk about football teams? Hold on. What are you drawing? Can I see? No, no, not yet. Surprise. I don't know what you're drawing for this class, but it better be really good if you care this much. We're graded on effort. I wonder if art studios hire based on effort. Oh, I no. just finished my no, drawing. What'd you draw? Bitches getting killed. Women dying is cool. You should move when you graduate. Unfortunately, the deadline for your character drawings has come. I will now walk around to provide feedback and collect your artwork. Jekka? Oh, here. Oh, cute. You want to explain the piece to me? It's me and Ryan Sheckler at the Warp Tour. Ryan Sheckler? Yep, bitch. He's sexy. That's an unlockable <laughs> character in Tony Hawk. He's not even real. You are really fucking stupid. Watch the language, Nicole. Fuck, sorry. I mean, shit, sorry. I mean... Whatever. And now I'm very interested to see yours. Are you sure? You worked hard on it. I feel like this is gonna be bad. Oh god. If you say so. This oh. is what is this? Oh, it's a picture of you killing yourself <laughs> when your wife blows the UPS man. <laughs> what? How? Where'd you get this information? Oh my god, I'm so sorry. Was it FedEx? This isn't <laughs> funny, Nicole. I oh think my it's pretty god. funny. Insubordination, inappropriate imagery, and sexual harassment of faculty. I'll let Principal Lin handle you. I'm oh sorry, my god. Sexual harassment? That's precisely what this is. There's nothing sexy about you. It's just regular harassment. <laughs> oh my god. This bitch better have some Valium left. Exposed! Guess not. I told you you were on thin ice and what'd you go and do? What the fuck are you talking about? You really think they'd refer you to the board for expulsion without giving me a phone call? The fuck you mean expelled? I got suspended, thank you. Suspended indefinitely. Yeah, indefinitely. Meaning not definite, like not for sure. Meaning until they know what to do with you. That's how much trouble you're in. Fucking oh my God. whatever. It's not a big deal, mom. They always threaten this. And what if they follow through? I don't know. It's not even your problem. Just fuck off. So I take it you're not my problem either. Definitely not. Fine. As of tonight, you no longer live here. What? You heard me. Pack your shit. Get out of my house. Go drink some wine. You're such a bitch when you're sober. Get the fuck out of my house! Are you serious right now? Like, come on. Oh Should I call God. the police? You know what? Do it. God damn it. minutes ago okay what the hell is going on do you still have that futon in your basement yeah it's covered in dried mr piv but yeah what the i guess fuck? that's fine can i sleep here tonight no bitch tomorrow are you really getting expelled over that drawing that's bullshit just tell your mom that i'm done telling my mom anything she can rot in a tanning bed for all i care well you're gonna rot in the street if you don't work it out with her dude you have a house just let me stay with you if it was my house you could stay all you want but it's my parents house Mom will get pissed. That'll probably hit on you. It'll be weird. Okay, so fuck? you and your dad against her. That's perfect. Let me stay. No, Nicole. Like, I wish I could help, but I don't know. Well, uh, can you at least give me all the fruit roll-ups in your kitchen? <sighs> I'll be right back. Oh, my God. Wonder which mall has the softest benches. Jesus Christ. Those are the worst benches ever. It's like they don't want homeless customers. Damn, Nicole, you're here early. Yeah, you too. What for? Just buying something. Buying what? Are you a cop? Bitch, do I look like a cop? Yeah, just waiting for Kyler. He's supposed to sell me his oxy. He's got a lot, right? <laughs> totally. These dumbass white guys break their legs and turn into pharmacies. Oh my I'd God. buy more from him, but then I'd have to give him my phone number. No, you don't. MySpace. Make a ghost account. A ghost account? Or they call it a burner or a puppet. Basically an account separate from you where you do illegal shit. Oh, I think I already have one of those. What do you use it for? Stalking people who blocked me. Oh my kind god. <laughs> you have the right people, you can buy anything on there. Drugs, guns, ass, whatever. Drugs, guns, and ass. And the cops aren't tracking that? No, they're old ass cops. They can't figure that shit out. <laughs> 
cool. Yeah, this is good to hear, because my mom kicked me out yesterday. I should buy something to forget about this shit. Are you couch surfing or straight up homeless? Homeless straight up. I slept on a bench last night. Damn. Well, go make some money on MySpace. But I don't have any drugs or guns to sell. You know what I meant. Ugh. I don't know if I'm ready to be a MySpace escort. No, I'm Have you yeah. ever thought about it before? No, I think about it every week. I just never thought I'd have this crossroad in high school. Shit happens, dude. I wouldn't think any less of you. Yeah, but would I think less of myself? Yes. Yo, what's up? I, I got the shit. Where the fuck were you? Places? I got shit to do. I'm not some drug addict like you. They're not for me. They're for my boyfriend. You have a boyfriend? I don't even want to sell this to you anymore. Are you kidding me? I got a hundred for the bottle right here. 110. You said 100 on MySpace, asshole. Yeah, but you didn't say you had a boyfriend. Oh, my God. <sighs> okay, 110, here. Thanks. And, and let me know when you're single. Let me know when you're not. What? Have fun, Nicole. <laughs> I'll try. Gotta get home before Mind of Mencia comes on. Kyler, can I have a pill? I don't have a boyfriend. Panhandling pills? What are you, homeless? Uh, no. no. Oh, good. Yeah, you can have one, because I fucking hate the homeless. Okay. Seriously, like a lot of politicians just say that, but I oh my actually God, Tyler, want homeless shut people up. exterminated <laughs> off the planet. Yeah, but that's an opinion. Like, the only way they could contribute to our society is by jumping in a meat grinder so we have something to feed farm animals. Give me the fucking pill! Whoa, fine. Are you like an addict? You could say that. Sweet, yeah. Drug addict girls are hot because they're really easy to control. Jesus Christ. What? Oh, uh, I think Mind of Mencia is starting soon. Oh, you're right. I, I gotta go. <laughs> Okay, I gotta figure something out. Oh, okay. Work at Dying DVD store. Start your own car wash. Mm. Car wash. In a hardware store alone. Now I know how it feels to be racist. Oh, hey, Nicole. Uh, oh wait, it's not awkward. Uh, what's awkward? Usually when I see someone from school in public, I try to avoid them. But I just realized I'm not in school anymore. Did you drop out? No, I'm getting expelled. For what? Some bullshit, don't worry about it. Okay, yeah, well, at school, stuff's been going good for me. Do you know oh what the sponges God. are? I'm trying to start a car wash. Near the chemical supplies, but I'm still class president. Could you not interrupt me? I'm not in class anymore. <laughs> You're not my president. Well, I'm still a person, so you should respect me. Dude, I'm out of high school. You're just a memory now. There's zero consequences for anything I say to you. Are you even- You're a whore. Excuse me? I have a boyfriend and a purity ring. Oh my for god, real? bitch. How do I get one? A little late for you. No, it's never too late to have your boyfriend fuck every girl but you. I don't need to take this. I'm on the honor roll, something you'll never do. Bitch, why don't you shut the fuck up before I slit your throat and watch the honor roll out? Are you threatening <laughs> oh me? God. No, I'm hitting on you. Flash me a titty, bitch. Cokehead slut. And there is no one she can report me to. Awesome. Hand wash for only eight bucks. Great deal. Hey, what's up? Uh, nothing much. You interested? What are you selling? Car washes, eight bucks. With one of those peanut sponges? Yeah, the big yellow one, hand washed. Get a car wash to support the homeless. With that sponge, fuck the homeless. What the fuck? You drive a Corolla. What are you worried about? Maybe I should flirt more. You washing cars? What does it look... I mean... Yeah, and I'd oh really God. like to wash a car like yours. I bet it's fast. Yeah, 300 horsepower. That's I bet it's brag. fast. Of course not. It is what it is, right? Yeah, it's the GT, so leather seats and everything. No, my God. Leather is so sexy. You want to take me for a ride after I get this cleaned? A ride where? I don't know. Your place, maybe? I don't think my husband would like that. Uh. Since when the fuck do gay people drive Mustangs? What the fuck? I gotta find a new spot. Teachers are charitable, right? Damn, you went 60 and a 10. What the fuck? Oh, hey, sweetie. What you doing here on a Saturday? I'm doing a car wash. Are you sure you're allowed to do that <laughs> at school without staff supervision? I'm a student here. It's whatever. Are you sure you're allowed to go that fast? Oh, my ah, God. There's no kids around today. And even if I hit one, it's just a write-off. How is that a write-off? Because you write them off the student list. Wow. So you want a car wash? <laughs> I might have some time. How much? Eight bucks. 
Get that shirt wet and I'll give you ten. I'm in high school, Mr. Colby. You're right, you're right. Fifteen, then. Not what I meant. Fifteen what? Years in prison at this rate. Nicole, what do you think you're doing here? <laughs> She's a student. She could be here. Yeah, I know, right? She got expelled, Mr. Colby. What? Is this true? Oh, my I God. I didn't get expelled. I'm suspended indefinitely while they consider expulsion. Honey, you can't be here. You gotta go. Why? Or else what? Or I gotta report you for an unsanctioned car wash. Oh, well, my God. I'll report you for trying to buy a wet t-shirt car wash. Uh... Well, well, maybe we could just forget about all this. Oh, what? I didn't see anything. You were literally walking up as he said it. No, actually, as Jesus. I recall, you were offering him a topless car wash. Right, Mr. Colby? Oh, uh, uh, oh, yeah. Are you actually fucking kidding me? Who's the whore now, Nicole? You Jesus bitches are fucked up. <laughs> you Jesus bitches. God, my space sucks on the phone. How do I make a new account? Oh, shit, what's up? Hey, what's good? I didn't know you drank coffee. <clears throat> you somewhere? I don't need to be anywhere. It just tastes good. Are you still homeless? Basically. I'm trying to use the Starbucks Wi-Fi right now. Did you try what I told you about? No, I'm making the account for it now, though. What should my name be? <clears throat> I mean, something that just lets people know you're down, honestly. Gotcha. How about dirty little rental? Little slutty. All right, what about pierced princess? Hmm, I like the innuendo, super cute, but really emo. I got shit to be emo about, don't I? <laughs> yeah, true. But that's Jesus. probably already taken, so put X's in the name. <clears throat> okay, XX Pierced Princess XX. It's available. There you go. Damn, you went from, like, hesitant to making awesome screen names. What <laughs> happened over the week? Like, I just came to grips with the fact that... When you're pretty, retail and escorting make you feel equally disgusting. Oh yeah, either God. way, you deal with hideous people against your will. So who do I add? How do I even know they're around here? There's one guy who's pretty much connected with everybody in the area. You Jesus. add one, then the others start hitting you up. What's his name? Uh, Cream Pie Casanova 420. What the fuck? Yeah, I see him here. Added. So when he accepts, <laughs> just PM him and he'll shut you out. Cool, but how does it work? I don't have a car. When you're selling favors, they usually come to you. And if you let them pay you in drugs, you get way more for your time. Have you done this before? I'm on there, but I never sell favors. My friends in Laurel have, though. Damn, oh my there's God. some white trash in Laurel, too. Would they get paid in drugs? Yeah, but only because they had people to sell to. Anyway, I gotta go. Good luck with the Wi-Fi. God, this is sketchy. I guess if anyone kills me, it'll make my mom mad. Oh my God. One week later. You know, for two weeks of being homeless, you don't really look that homeless. What do you think? Everybody homeless wears a barrel with suspenders. D no, but you're still so, like, clean and put together. The homeless dudes on the bus are covered in dried spit and Burlington what Coke factory. Fuck? A lot of the guys let me crash, use their shower, everything. Guys that you're meeting on... On MySpace, yeah. On MySpace. I never thought I'd ask this not as an insult, but... How's being a whore going? Oh my god. Escort or that? Whatever means money for sex? On MySpace, we don't call it sex. We call it favors. So, what are the guys like? Are they really weird? Well, they're buying favors so obviously, but the actual doing it isn't even the worst part. It's after. What is it awkward? Uh, so after they finish, depending on the guy, you get this wide range of emotions fuck? from wanting to save you to wanting to kill you what's in the middle wanting you to get out before their wife comes home they're married what if they get you pregnant nicole there's upper favors and lower favors i don't do lower favors those are for ugly girls shit what do they pay if you're not giving it all up there's not really a number because i usually trade for drugs what guys the into this are like pharmacies that better be some awesome shit if you're not getting paid Oh, it is. I probably did a thousand dollars in free pills this week. They're not free if you're doing favors Jesus for them. Christ. Let's not get that deep. Oh. You're only doing this because you're homeless. For real? What I'm saying is being a regular hoe for actual cash would be better than where you are right now. Then you could get your own place, maybe. No shit. I ask for drugs because I can't do this sober. I can't beg sober. I can't starve sober. And I definitely can't fuck a stranger sober yeah but why not go to a women's shelter or something you can't have drugs in a women's shelter which is the last place you want to be sober in oh. i guess it's just a month ago i couldn't imagine you doing this i could never do this it's so gross well 
a month ago, I wasn't homeless. But when your mom kicks you out and your friend won't let you stay with her, dun, dun, it dun. kind of forces you to do shit you wouldn't normally do. Are you trying to guilt me right now? Oh my god. I don't need to try. I gave you fruit roll-ups. What do you want from me? Jesus fuck. This is so much easier than phone my space. Let's see. I can only pay in cash if that's okay. Shit. I guess I have enough on me to get me through it. Also, please keep this to yourself. I have a high profile career and don't want this getting around. What the fuck? High profile means rich. And rich means blackmail money. But I can't hold up a camera phone in his face for the proof. Nicole, you're not allowed to use MySpace on the library computers. Karen, right? Do you know how to set up a timed photo on the sidekick? The phone? Don't change the what subject. The fuck? I'm the librarian assistant. You're gonna get me in trouble. Why can't we use MySpace? It's not an educational website. I learned how to break into a car on MySpace. How is that not educational? <laughs> rules are rules, Nicole. You need to log off now. Log off? I gotta reply to this. Dude, can you just act like a hot bitch for once? But I'm not a hot bitch. Oh no, I... Uh, your, um... Your glasses are cute. Just cute, though. Did I say cute? I meant hot. Like, sex for free hot. I don't know. I feel kind of nerdy wearing them, but contacts hurt my eyes. Nerdy? No, they're, oh like, God. really distinctive in a hot way. <laughs> you could, like, be in Playboy with a quadratic formula tramp stamp. Tramp stamp? Like the back tattoo? Yeah, dudes could study it while hitting you doggy <laughs> shit. I'm allergic to dogs. Christ, whatever. Karen, do you see what I'm saying? You're a hot bitch. Act like one. What are hot bitches supposed to act like? Hot bitches aren't worried about losing their depressing unpaid internship at the local library. Well, I guess you can use the computer for five more minutes, but then you really gotta log off. Close enough. So how do I do a timed photo? Uh, okay. So you go to the camera section, do new capture, then go over to flash and exposure settings. I feel like this is gonna be bad. Okay, that camera angle should be good. Where is this guy? And I wonder how rich he's gonna be. He could be like a basketball player, or Steve Jobs, or the <laughs> guy who invented Adderall. Oh my god. Oh, I think that's him. It's so dark, he probably can't even recognize me. Who is it? Is it a teacher? Hey, you weren't looking for favors, were you? Guilty as charged, accused <gasps> princess. What the fuck? You're not rich. You're Mr. Lori. Oh, God. You work at a school and you're on that part oh, of the Oh, my school. God. Oh, please stop. Oh, no. That's why your wife left you. You kept paying for ass on the internet. Emily, come out here. Damn, I was hoping you were the guy from Transformers. <laughs> what was this? We thought you be a celebrity, so Nicole had me hide with her camera phone. Oh, two witnesses. Why not just use the cell timer? I couldn't figure it out. How long have you been doing this? Girls, please. I'm just very anxious. I popped three Zans and I'm still freaking out. How do you think I feel? No, come on. Let, let's work something out here. Like what? No, fuck that. This dude got me <laughs> expelled. He ruined my life. I'm sorry, Nicole. Just please don't tell anyone about this. You better pay up then. Starting at a thousand. Each. But each. on a teacher's salary and my house payment. Your house was foreclosed. What do you got to worry about? Bitch, take a loan out. Yeah, ask your wife for that UPS money. All right, fine. Fine. Uh, I'll go to the ATM if you promise to just not tell anyone. Oh my god. Sure. Yeah, trust me. We won't tell a soul. Oh, they told. They totally told. You know, damn well we told up the money. <laughs> I told Jekka. Jekka showed the photo to Miss Lynn. Miss Lynn informed the school board, and the school board deemed his accusation of me unreliable because he pays for sex. Oh my, my god. My mom got a call from the principal saying I'm back in school, so I'm not homeless anymore either. Yay. Everything just kind of worked out. Aside from all the trauma I got from selling my body, but whatever. Jekka was worried he'd get revenge on me because I snitched. You know, cardinal street rule. But honestly, street rules don't really exist when you're actually living on the street. Mm. Everyone's gonna have an opinion on what I did to survive. But let's see you homeless with no one to crash with. Those upper favors are gonna start sounding real convenient. Then again, you're probably not as pretty as me, so you'd oh. only get paid for lower favors. Bend over, bitch. <laughs> Bend over, bitch. 
Jesus. Fuck, that scares me every time. Is that a watch? Did I say pizza? I'm so confused. What about me? God isn't watching who is. Jesus? His son? I don't fucking know. There was another... If we... I don't know. Was that... Is there another ending? Because work at dying DVD stores one of the is an option because like we've done everything else i think yeah we've done everything else i'm kind of curious okay so welcome to fye i thought it was phi uh, no. F-Y-E, it's an abbreviation. I'm Kelly, I'll be your manager. Yeah, we go to school together. Do I don't we? think it changes I anything. I really mad. Well, I kind of want to see. Are you fucking with me? Okay, Nicole, that language is okay amongst coworkers, but not in front of the customers. So, first training question, what does F-Y-E stand for? For your excitement? Try again. For your ejaculation? <laughs> no, that's our adult video branch. For your entertainment? Good. But not only are the products for the customer's entertainment, it's also the store experience. Are you saying we gotta flirt with the customers? If you wanna sell oh, that God. rewards program, is that optional? <laughs> sell it once a month or else you're fired. Oh, and after hours, am I allowed to sleep in the break room? I mean, I don't care, but the regional manager might. I can close every night. Even the days I'm not working, I'll just show up to close. Dang, really? Jesus. Yeah, do whatever you want then, go get her. And do you drug test? No. It's an FYE, not a hospital. <laughs> not a hospital. Sick. Glad to hear. Let's go out on the floor so I can show you how it's done. So I can show you how okay, it's done. We're just opening, so some customers are going to show soon. Remember the four <laughs> steps to the register? Greet, compliment, help, entertain. Oh my god, good memory. Oh my I god. Because I have to now. <laughs> oh, customer, watch this. Hey, welcome to FYE. I'm Kelly. Oh, yeah, hey. Nice shirt, by the way. <laughs> Thanks. Uh, yeah, most people were kind of down on this Guns N' Roses. Really? I thought it was even better than the first movie. Movie? So you looking for anything in particular? Uh, some DVD box sets for a road trip. Oh, my oh yeah. Collections are right over here. But you gotta pick the right one or you're in for a miserable drive. Yeah, really? My ex-boyfriend picked the most boring movies. What That's why fuck? I'm single now. Oh, man, sorry to hear. What a mistake. And the difference between this and whoring myself out on MySpace is... <clears throat> <laughs> I wonder if this place has anime. Nicole? Hi. Of course it has FYE. anime. I didn't know you worked here. Well, now you do. By the way, nice, um... Damn. damn. <laughs> nice what? Compliment. Uh, you don't look like a regular rapist. Oh my god. Thanks. So are you looking for anything? Well, actually, I wandered in here under the assumption there would be anime DVDs. Cool. Um... Do you have any? No, we don't carry anime, so sorry, you're gonna have to leave. Leave? But why? You're just gross. You look like you were breastfed till oh you were eight. Well, you're just saying that because of my breast milk fetish. <laughs> oh, now you really have to leave. <coughs> oh my god. Nicole, welcome to FYE. I'm Kelly. Hello. I like your shirt, dude. Really funny. Oh, thanks. My mom got it for me at Target. That's really hot. What brings you here today? Anime. So, we only have a few anime DVDs, but you can look at them on that back shelf. Oh, okay. I could browse for a moment. Oh and my I'll God. be with you in just a sec. Nicole, could I have a word with you in the break room? <laughs> Nicole. Okay, I got a redo. That was a psycho customer. Sure, he was a little off, but you can't just insult the customers like that. 
You saw how I handled him. Yeah, but you didn't see the other weird shit about his breast milk fetish. Nicole, we're in the business of sales. If the customer says he has a breast milk fetish, you tell that bitch to drink up. Uh, that's insane. <laughs> that's customer service. He won't remember what he bought, but he will remember telling the pretty girl working at FYE about breast milk and her being totally cool with it. I, I don't get it. Is this Hooters? Basically. <laughs> but instead of wings, we sell DVDs. And instead of a boob job, you get a lip ring. Why the hell did I get a job? This is just as degrading as selling my body on MySpace. You can do that? Hell yeah, Emily told me. It's on the internet so the cops don't track it. I've been having sex for free this whole time. You're telling me I could have got paid for it? Yeah, you want to try it with me? Fuck this place, let's quit. I'm the manager, remember? So you get a lanyard, big deal. This lanyard means I make $9.25 an hour plus discounts oh my God. plus benefits. Yeah, you're kind of set for life here. How long do we have to work before they give us the lip ring? We don't give you one. You just get it yourself. Oh. Well, I quit then. Oh my okay. God. It was nice working with you. Yeah, good luck. God, my space sucks on the phone. Okay, yeah, it How doesn't do anything. Oh, shit. So, is, so, I guess that's all the endings then. Do we do it? Is that everything? Yes. Seven. Seven of seven. One of one. So, we did do it. Yay! Four and a half hours later, <laughs> we did it! Yay! <laughs> Yay! We did it! Oh my god. Oh, fuck. Alright, well, I guess this is a good point for me to go to bed. Because we're gonna be streaming lots tomorrow. Even though I know I only have one thing scheduled, but I'm gonna be, um, I'm gonna do some, I'm gonna do another live on, um, YouTube tomorrow too. Maybe two. Maybe one. I don't know. I haven't figured out what I wanted to do, um, yet. Um, but we're definitely doing the Twitch one. And then, um... Probably another YouTube stream. I just don't know what I want to do yet. I have an idea, but I don't know if it's going to work. Um, but yeah. So, I will be seeing you guys in the morning anyway. An entertaining and messed up game indeed. Very much so. But it was a good game. It was totally worth 20 bucks. <laughs> it was totally worth 20 bucks. Because that was funny as fuck. <laughs> it was a good game. I liked it. Um, yeah. So I'll see you guys tomorrow morning. Well, today in the morning, I guess. And take it for hanging out for the messed up but entertaining game. And yeah, everybody have a good night or a good day or a good afternoon. And I'll see you guys tomorrow, okay? Okay. Okay. Bye. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Shh. <laughs>